Hi, I'm Abs from Holland Create. I've been crafting for over 10 years now and I love stamping, stenciling, creating layers, of colors, textures and creating depth and dimension. Holland Create was established in October 2016, collaborating with a group of designers and artists from all over the world, bringing different designs and products in different styles. We proud ourselves of high quality photopolymer clear stamp sets, dyes, stencils, washi tapes and acrylic blocks, all in different size and formats. In my shows at Hachanda, I hope to bring you inspiration and different ways of using your craft products. Make sure you don't miss the Holland Create shows on Hachanda. Kay Fassett is a distinguished artist, designer and author who has used his background in knitwear design to create an expanding range of bold and beautiful fabric prints for the patchwork market. Join me on Hochanda where I will be bringing you a wide selection of beautiful fabrics at fantastic prices. Hi, I'm Andy from Picture This. I've been a painter all my life. Picture This was actually formed on the back of a throwaway remark from one of my art students. This has developed my drawings into a series of photopolymer stamps, clear stamps for the crafting community and the crafting industry. The stamps are all hand drawn by me. They're made in the UK. Most important to us and Picture This. And we have so much more to bring. Our shows on Achanda, um, we hope to make them informative, amusing obviously, entertaining, but mainly it's about bringing the creative spirit to you. Make sure you tune in and watch the picture this shows on Achanda. Exciting news! For the fifth year in a row, Hochanda has been awarded the top accolade of Platinum Trusted Service Award from FIFO. These awards recognise businesses that deliver exceptional experiences as rated by you, our customers, and we're honoured to have been selected. The Trusted Service Award means you can shop with confidence based on the reviews from over 60,000 Hochanda customer experiences. Thank you for your independent reviews. It means a lot to us. Good morning and welcome. It's lovely to have your company. We are starting today here at Agenda with the wonderful Crafty Roo. Our Kim is in the building. Good morning, Kim. Good morning. How are you feeling? You've had a very early morning, haven't you? We have. It's, um, yeah, I'm not used to seeing this side of the day. I know. I know. <laughs> it's, it's cruel, isn't it? Yeah, it was nice and peaceful, though. I got yeah. to see the sunrise. So. Yeah, I bet that was quite pretty, actually, wasn't it? On the drive down. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> I love that you were looking for like, you know, the the the, the, little, the happy side of yeah. the of that one AM start. <laughs> um you've got a wonderful uh, set of stamps. What I love about your stamps, obviously, um, is these little beauties. The actual poly plate, because the poly plates that, that is such a different type of stamp because you can do so much with it, can't you? You can indeed. They are um, they're basically just a stamp. They're yeah. a big, solid stamp. So they're great for getting your inks on and just creating colourful backgrounds. Yes. So if you want a watercolour effect, use your distress oxides or your brushes. If you want more of a solid effect, go for your, dis um, your distress oxides. Yes, you yes. Know, it, it packs a punch and you can get so many different, like you said, so many different effects with one little, it, yeah. little stamp. It's like... Yeah, and that's the wonderful tool. thing, it, it, because they are different, you know, to work with. They're, they're, not, they're not something that you see absolutely everywhere, and I love that. No, and that's what we, we do try to always do something a little bit different. Mm. So this set is completely different to what we brought you last month or what we brought you before Christmas. So I don't have a set style. 
Yeah. Um, I kind of design what I want to play with. Yeah, yeah, which is lovely. <laughs> yeah, whatever, I really like it. But the these. mood takes me for the. Yeah, for I, the I like it. I like it. And this is great because you've got backgrounds, you've got focal features, you've got so much. And you've got an amazing discount as well if you're going for everything together. Now, I will tell you straight from the top if you're getting everything together and you're a Freedom member, you're saving £17.50. Essentially, that's this lot for free. If you are Freedom members, £17.50. Um, and a little bit more, to be fair, it's that and more. Um, and of course, um, have we got the Flexi on that as well? Of course we do. Two payments, 20 quid today. £20 and 23 pence today. That is it, which is amazing. You have got separate bundles as well. So if you don't want to go for a big bundle, we have got a separate bundle. But we'll start from this end. So you've got your, your wonderful poly plate. So that's your gorgeous flower. And as Kim said, you can do so much with this. Think a solid stamp. Think almost... Almost like um, a gel plate, but not, isn't it? Yeah, the only thing that's different to your gel plate is I wouldn't recommend using your alcohol inks on there. Yeah. And that is only because your alcohol inks, um, your, your stamp's going to um, drink it in. So yeah. you're going to yeah. use that much alcohol ink that it just becomes... Nothing a left. Yeah, it's, it's a waste of time because you're just going to yeah. spend so much alcohol inks to try and get a print. There is a way to do it, but I wouldn't recommend yeah. it. It's yeah, not going to damage your it. stamp, that's yeah. the main thing. Yeah, um, yeah. But so yeah. much you can do with these, Absolutely. though. Absolutely. They're really cool. Um, now, individually, this one will come with this stamp set. And let me show you, because this has been sized so it fits the flower. If I just slip that in, you can see that will actually fit your polyplate perfectly. You've got that lovely honeycomb background. <laughs> you've got the leaves there as well. And then you've got fabulous news, smile, and you're blooming. You're blooming lovely. Um, now, there's loads you can do with this. And if I just point out those two, the leaves, they're actually little poly plates as well. And you've got your, your actual outline. So you can start building that up. Now, those two are together if you want those two. Uh, just at the bottom of the screen there. And it's just £18.99 if you just want to go for those two. 710456. Obviously, I'll show you loads of finished samples in a second. You've then got um, your bigger flower set. Now, with this one, bigger flower set, but actually smaller flowers. <laughs> <laughs> um, and let me show you. So you've got your smaller little bump, but same idea. It so is. these are like mini poly plates. Yeah, they are. Um, and I started to design this and I thought, well, I'm not going to put any more poly plates or solid stamps in there. And it's like, no, I really want them. I really want to play with them because yeah. you get all those lovely effects on that big one. And I just wanted to carry it through to the smaller ones as yeah. well. I think they're lovely. And I like that you've got your different backgrounds. Uh, you've got your flowers. You've got sending love and hugs. And they're separate, which allows you to play some wherever you fancy. So that's your second stamp set. Now, only £12.99 if you want to go for that individually. Remember, that is part of the bundle. I mean, the bundle, even if you're not a Freedom member, you're saving £12, which is basically getting that, uh, sorry, £13. So you get that for free. So it's up to you which you look at that you get for free. Do you know what I mean? Um, next, <laughs> you're getting the big poly plate. This will allow you to do so many different backgrounds. You'll be able to layer it with the smaller ones. You'll be able to create some beautiful effects. Honestly, it's one of those when you see it, you want to play with it because you can do so many things. So now, if you do want that one on its own, um, again, you have got that choice. £12.99. See, isn't that beautiful? And that's something like that that we're looking at, that beautiful flower with the black and white on top of it. Mm -hmm. That's dead easy to do, isn't it? It is. It's three distress inks, a spritz of water and slap it on the paper. See how easy. Yeah. But it looks... I don't do complicated. I, I can't do complicated. But <laughs> it looks so <laughs> effective. Yeah. And that's what we like. Something that looks really, really cool but is absolutely achievable. Yeah. It, it's trying to get that step between... It's almost that, that little step into mixed media, but not quite. Yeah, it's the, yeah, it's yeah. It's like the cheats version. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it's the <laughs> nice, it's the, it's the safe version. Yeah. You know, it's achievable. Um, so that's your big flower. If you do want that on its own, £12.99. And then, of course, you've got your lovely backgrounds, your textures. I really like the textures. I mean, you'll be able to use these in so many different ways. And you can see the stamps are way bigger um, than the packaging. They're just ridiculously handy. See, you can't have enough textures or too many textures Absolutely in your collection. Not. These are proper under. Yeah, they are. And 
um, the lots of blocks of that little one there, that one interlinks, so you can make a nice big wall out of it if you wanted to. Beautiful. And um, those dotty lines, you've also got the smaller version in your lovely blues. Yes, yeah. Um, I noticed that. And those little dots on them, put up a little bit of glossy accents on them. Oh, just wonderful. Gorgeous. Yeah. I um, really like them. I keep saying I've got a favourite, but then it's like, no, because I like the next. Yeah. I can't Until you start that. using it, and then it's like, oh, no, I like oh, no, that. I want to use that I one. Like oh, that one. I'm gone. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, they're lush. They're absolutely lovely. Now, if you do want those three, you can get that bundle. Um, just £12.99. pence. So, again, um, it's up to you which you look at as a freebie if you're getting the bundle, but you're getting freebies. Um, if you want those three on their own, that is 836 seven five three and you can see all the different variations i think with these it's one of those uh, collections dead easy to use easy to cut out mm -hmm. never ever go out of fashion because obviously we're talking florals yeah they're a big statement bloom that's what it is um, and also to point out where well, you do actually get a booklet with that collection as well oh, lovely. with i think it's five different cards in there to make that's fantastic I like that because you've got inspiration straight exactly. away. Exactly. When you open your box and you get it home, I didn't want you to stand there and go, oh, what do I do with it now? Yeah. 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 Um, yeah. That's so good. I've As put in there a little inspiration guide. It's literally step by step for about five cards. That's one of the cards that's in there and I how love to that. do it. Yeah, that's beautiful. It's the polyplates. The polyplates are, I mean, look at that. I that's love another that one that's in the booklet. Well. <laughs> that is gorgeous. That's your little honeycomb, so you, just, you can see how it links up dead easy. Yeah, really that easy. looks really effective. And that is beautiful. Those polar plates, again, you see, your yeah. solid stamps make such an impact. But that's an easy one we're using up your scraps in your mm. scrap box. Yeah, but it yeah. doesn't look it, does it? Same with that. That's just gorgeous. Uh, coloured in there. See, look at that. Yeah. That's so see, pretty. For me, that is really difficult to do because I, I struggle colouring in. Yeah, yeah. Um, but actually, this set, it's that easy to colour in. Yeah. It, it's just... You know, yeah, I love it's that. It's pushing I, my boundaries as well, actually, this set. I think that is so pretty. Um, OK, £44.96, well, you've got a massive saving, but be part of a Chanda Freedom. If you're a Freedom member, uh, remember, you're joining for 5 97 uh, It's a brilliant price. You don't have to cancel it. You can keep refreshing it. It means you're getting discounts, but you're not paying your postage either. So with that, not only are you getting a massive discount, but you're not paying any postage. So literally, you take home, today is £20.23, and £23. nothing else added on top of that. Seven one. 0456 is your item number. So that's a brand new collection. Absolutely gorgeous. But we have got a little favourite um, that our Kim's brought back for us. Then again, really nice inspirational words. And these will match with anything. They'll definitely go with what we've got today. As you can see, if I just do that, you can see they're way bigger than the stamp set. So the packaging, I'll let you see the packaging, but I wanted you to see that because they're much, much bigger. And you've got things like make your own magic, inspire, dream big, follow your heart, positive. Um, and think positive, stay positive, be creative. <laughs> um, I really, really like them. And then, and then your other set as well. These are good because obviously great for cards, but I like them because they're good for your journals, your art journals. They are, they're just the impact, they've got that boom, they're on the page, it's, yeah. it is, it's lovely. And I always like my words, on me, you know, my art journals, I like my words. Mm -hmm. So these are good, you can, you can fill any page with these. Yeah. It's, um, it's a good day to have a good day. Yeah. I like that one. Yeah, I like um, that one. But with these as well, I tend to not put a greeting on my cards. So I won't put a happy birthday or yeah. best wishes or something on there. I would rather put a sentiment on there, so if someone goes, I really like that. Yes. And you can just pop it on a frame on the wall. Yeah, absolutely. Yeah, it gives them that option. Yeah, it keeps it so, yeah, it's an everyday kind of thing. I love that. And that is way bigger than the, um, yeah, than the actual stamp plate. That is beautiful. But again, how simple is that? That is just that big balloon flower. Yeah. I've masked, okay, I've done a little bit of masking on that one. So that's like the next step up. But it's yeah. simple. You just whack it on the page. It looks yeah. dead effective. It looks really beautiful. And I mean, with these, they do make such a good impact. Um, if you do want to get hold of these, only £19.98. £19 you are saving a massive £6 this morning. And if you're going for your big bundle, the brand new bundle, you can put it in your flexi basket. 345-393 is your item number. Now, we've got some mud earth. Um, 
<laughs> Murder. Uh, with your MDF frames, these are really handy because obviously your blooms are going to look gorgeous in these and they make a really good. If you're um, using these for your home decor, they look absolutely beautiful. But I love that they've been changed into books. That looks really cool, <laughs> doesn't it? Well, I was trying to think, you've, got, you've basically got the front and the back, haven't you, with your yeah. frame? So what else could I do with it? Well, let's turn it into a book. Yeah. I like that. And have you punched it with just like a crocodile? Yep, absolutely. Just popped yeah. a book ring in there. Um, and then I started to have a bit of a play. So you can see how far I got with that one. Just oh, playing with my big so blues. Cool. Yeah. That um, looks just playing different techniques. Beautiful. Um, and then I just thought, you know, we're, we're just going to keep going and keep building on this. Yeah, yeah. I really like that. You can like see where that. I got up to. I started to doodle and I thought, no, if I, if I carry on doodling, that's me lost. <laughs> uh, yeah, I'm not doing no, anything else. We're done. Uh, <laughs> yeah, yeah, stop done. with the doodles. <laughs> that is lovely. And your pages are absolutely beautiful. Thing but is with have, these. They are simple pages, though, to do. Yeah. So one's embossing with brush oak. Um, another one's just distress oxides. So they are really simple. Yeah. But they look amazing. They look really effective. that big statement flower. Yeah. And I love the panels. Obviously, the panels are within um, the beautiful book, and you can do so much with the panels. Obviously, now I can't stand it up. I'll just hold it. Um, <laughs> but the panels, the bits that pop out, then you can decorate. Absolutely. How pretty does that look? Yeah. When we were having them cut, I thought, I was really cheeky. I said, I want the middles as well. Yeah, mm. yeah. So, well, you, want the, uh, you only wanted the frame. I was like, nope, I want the middles as well so yeah. that we can use them. Definitely, because that gives you that no dimension. No bit goes to waste. Yeah, they're beautiful. Really like those. Only £10.99. Now, you are getting four frames here. So that's a set of four, plus all the, the little elements when they're cut out. And this is thick MDF. It's lovely quality MDF. You can see it's all been sanded properly, beautifully finished. That is really good value for money. If you're making to sell, these look really good because obviously your frames, it's your home decor. Um, that is seven, no it isn't. It's 474-628, your item number. Once they're gone, they're gone. So please make sure you get those in your basket. Now, last but definitely not least, brushios. 40% of the stock has gone. Um, once they're gone, they're gone. I mean, brushios are one of those products. They are addictive. They are the coolest, aren't they? They are, but it's the simplicity of them. You literally yes. need a spritzer or just water and a paintbrush, and you have got so many different things you can do with them. Yeah. Um, for me, it's the cheats way of painting, because I'm going to actually show you on this first demo we've got. Um, to actually paint with them is so easy, and you get all the different... Um, shades within that colour as well yeah it's just it's just wonderful yeah wonderful I, product i i I, oh, I just love brushes. I love brushes. <laughs> they just, I, I just love them. It's the, it's like you say, it's that being able to paint dead easy, but it's, I just find them exciting because you never know kind of what you're going to get. Absolutely. It's just, and I don't even look at the pots or the colours. I like to just see what happens. <laughs> um, yeah, I've got little stickers as well. So you can pop the little stickers on the pots, which is actually quite handy. So yep. you're getting the beautiful turquoise, you're getting the purple there, you get the Persian blue which is absolutely oh come here you you little <laughs> fiddly one um you've got your beautiful persian blue you've got your scarlet yeah prussian did i say persian you've got <laughs> your scarlet you've got your hold on that's that gamboge one. gamboge that is my absolute yes. favorite color yeah it's that the, is amazing it's isn't the it? base isn't it it's the coverall it's the one to go to yeah i love that one and the emerald is beautiful oh. Perfect. Oh, these are stunning. Now, half of the stock has gone. You've even got your spritzer. This is such a good price, 25 99 But get this in your flexi basket as well, because obviously buy your stamps, put that in your flexi basket. Such a good price. 345-755 is your item number. Right, all right, Kim, we better get demoing then because <laughs> we're half the stock gone. What are you starting today? I'm going to start with some brush up. Hooray! <laughs> <laughs> I'm going to do a really, really simple... Um, card with this one. I love this one. It's a bit of a, it's a cheat. <laughs> Don't tell anyone. I, I will, I, I love doing this technique. So dead simple. I have got um, a cut down 8 by 8 card. Super. I've got my brush out, so I'm going to use, I've got to use my favourite, haven't I? I've really got to use my favourite, Gamboge. And then I've just got a little tiddler piece here. So I'm going to pop that at a jaunty handle because obviously I don't like things Strikes. neat and tidy. Yeah. yeah. And I'm just going to... Sprinkle a little bit of brush out round edge. 
just like that. Less is definitely more when it comes to brush out. And then I'm just going to spritz. Now, if I spritz like this, you're just going to get little pools. The key is you want to be up here. You, you want a good distance between your spritzer and your paper. So just give it a quick spritz. Beautiful. Look like at that. It's gone round the edges as well. So that's, I like, okay, just I'll like shut that. up for a minute. <laughs> yeah, I like that. So what I'm going to do now is I'm just going to take that piece away because we're going to use both these pieces. Amazing. And I've got a faux frame. Oh, I won't put that on the table because I'll end up staining the table. And I'm just going to give it a quick blast in my heat gun. I love that because you've created a background and you've created a frame. Exactly. Mm, that's a good technique. It's a dead sheets card, this one. Literally takes a couple of minutes. You probably spend more time drying it than you do actually making the card. Yeah. It's, I it like quick. it because you're not wasting anything because I'm a, a bit obsessive about that, aren't I? Know. So it's I love my scrap busters. My scrap drawer at home is overflowing to the point now where I moved it up from a little tray to a big fat drawer. I thought, right, <laughs> if I fill this drawer, that is way too much. And I filled it to the point where I cannot physically close my drawer anymore. <laughs> and so I am scrap. on a bit of a scrap buster of a mission at the moment. I like doing that though, I like getting all the scraps used up. Exactly. Um, those brushes are limited stock, if you want them you have to check your baskets out. Now limited stock, gutted, um, <laughs> less than 10% <laughs> remaining, I'm not surprised that price is ridiculous. 345755 is your item right. number, once they're gone they are gone. I have just, I'm just dabbing mine to hurry it up a little bit because there's nothing worse than watching me today with a heat gun for the next <laughs> few minutes, there we go. See you don't, you'd just be able to let it dry naturally though, wouldn't you? I do, I tend to leave them um, on the side. Yeah. So I'll look yeah, at that and go, mm, hang on a minute, oh I'm going to go and play with something else and do yeah. something else while I'm at it. Right, so you can see I'm going to start building up my frame now. Beautiful. I'm going to start on this piece, so I'm just going to trim it down a little smidgen. And that's the gambo in it, is it? Oh, that colour is just... Gamboge, yeah. Gamboge. Gamboge is Never wonderful. been able to say that. <laughs> Oh, they've technically sold out, folks. I am so sorry. That was very, very quick indeed. Technically sold out. I do apologise. I can't even say if we can get more back. We will, but uh, remember to check your baskets out on your flowers as well, because obviously Kim's going to be using these in just a few seconds time. Yep. So you can see how that's going to come together already. I've basically got a card yeah. ready there. Yeah. Right. So well, it's next good, up. Looks good, doesn't it? I like that. Just a bit quick, isn't it? Yeah. Right, so I'm going to grab my big bloom. I love this big bloom. And this, oh yeah, that's a pretty stamp. Yep. The only thing I'd say with this one is, I'm a bit of a um, impatient Annie. Yeah. Yep. So I tend to just go bish bash bosh, try and get it done. Actually, make sure you ink it up. Yeah. My, the worst thing, because it's such a big stamp, Yeah. I don't spend my time inking it up long enough. Yes. Yeah. yeah. Does that make sense? Yeah. So take your time, make sure you've actually got the ink on it. Yeah, don't just rush ahead and, and go for it. So I'm yeah. giving mine a real good press there. Lovely. See, I do like stamps Ooh, like that because that's I missed easy. The pot. <laughs> it's easy to cut out as well, isn't it? Absolutely. And it's a great one for um, your shading as well. Uh, for shaping, not shading, shaping. Yeah. And shading. And shading, if you wanted. I like that. It's a lovely flower, is that? It's beautiful. You can 3D them as well, but I forgot to bring those ones. I know where they are, they're sat on my desk at home. <laughs> Decorating uh, my desk, so I'm so just going to do you? one leaf. I'm sure quite a lot of my stuff sat on my desk at home. I'm <laughs> quite nervous about unpacking my bag later. <laughs> right, so we have just got our big bloom. Now, to paint with brush out, so, so easy. I'm going to do a big red flower. Beautiful. So I'm going to use scarlet. The pins, of course. I would be, when I were over there, I thought, what's the pins for? You even give the pins to put in Absolutely. the lid. Absolutely. Now, the key with the pin is, once you've popped your hole in, so you put your sticker on, you pop your hole through, yeah. and you keep your pin in there. The beauty of having that pin in there is, if you get a bit of spritzer happy, yeah. I tend to, um, no moisture is going to get in there because yeah. it's all nicely sealed. Yes. Because um, once moisture gets in that little pot, it's going to start to activate, and you don't want yeah. that because these pots last forever. Yeah, yeah, they do. They last <laughs> ages, don't they? Right. So I've got my brush over here. Yeah. I've got my water over here. Okay, okay. Ooh. And I nearly had a stamp base flying out the window. <laughs> so I'm just going to pick up a little bit of water and just drag it from the edge. This is what I was talking about before, that it just does all the blending for you. So you can see I've hardly activated any yeah. brush out there at all. Just going to come in and give it a quick paint. 
And it's so, I mean, the, it is such a rich colour, isn't oh, it? Oh, absolutely. They are just beautiful, beautiful. It's because it's raw pigment. Yeah, yeah. Right, so I'm just getting a real base down on here. And it does, I mean, they blend brilliantly, don't they? They do. It's not looking that great at the moment, but bear with. We trust you. We'll get there. <laughs> it's one of them, isn't it? Yeah. And that hasn't been embossed, that's literally just stamped, Just stamped. Isn't it? Oh, I don't emboss on telly. Oh, no. <laughs> Skin for trouble, oh. that. <laughs> I've only just been brave enough to start doing it during our Facebook Lives, so, you know, to do it on telly. Building up for that. Um, yeah. <laughs> maybe <laughs> well, no, in the three years. <laughs> <laughs> I maybe, maybe, maybe in a year or two I might, <laughs> might, might, might drum up the courage. No, I tipped a whole pot of brush out over, not brush out, embossing powders over once. Wasn't a good day. <laughs> so I've now have got a nice base that thing where it, um, you've put the embossing powder on your Versamark pad by mistake. No, but I turned my clear ink black the other day. Oh, that's easy. That was impressive. Yeah. I love that one. Well done. Right. <laughs> so I've got a nice base on there now. I'm going to start. I'm just going to grab a bit more water, and I'm just going to go further into my raw brush. Out. So you can see it's now coming a bit darker. Yes. Yeah. Yep. Yeah. And then I'm just going to follow those lines. It's so easy, it isn't is. it? And the blending is in. just beautiful as well that you can achieve. And then you literally just keep going round. Look how rich that is. And so because it's only one pot as well, it's um, you know it's going to be the right colour palette. You know the the you know the the colour is going to match perfectly. And then if I think, oh, I've gone a bit too dark, I'll go and pick up my water and I'll just start to eke it out again. Yeah. But actually, I quite like it quite dark, no, so I'm going to go like back that. in. Yeah. And let's get some real colour going back in there. Look at that. So yeah. now I'm going to almost my raw brush out to just get that real... Look at that, I mean... Yeah. It's easy, but dead effective, isn't it? It's what brush out does. Yeah. Brush out at it And the flower, I mean, the stamp is amazing because it's a good open stamp. That's why it allows you to do so much with it. Whoops. <laughs> I've just turned the table red. <laughs> this yeah, is why they that. never use bright red. Because <laughs> it goes everywhere. Right, let's do the same now with our leaf. Again, it's going to be really simple. A little splot on my table. What I should say, on some of your mixed colours, just give it a quick shake um, before you use it. And what that'll do is just mix your pigment, because some of the pigments in there are a little bit heavier. Right. So if yeah. you, if, for example, you go to use your gamboge and it is just yellow, that's because all the red and stuff's just dropped a little bit because right. it's your pigment. Yeah. So, just check it on my paper. Oh, look at that, too dark. No. Not good. Let's take it back a bit. There we go. I didn't clean my brush properly, which is why it's looking a bit yakky. Quite but don't like tell that. anyone, will you? It looks nice. It's a nice <laughs> colour. <laughs> That's a bit of red and green at the same time. So this is the emerald green. And I'm just going to, again, just come in. And, and again, that. with that beautiful emerald green, you've got your yellows in there. You know, you've got your different colour tones within that green, haven't you? Yeah, there we go. So how quick was that just to yeah. do? Beautiful. Two little bits of colour in. Right. I am a mucky pup. I leave all my bits and bobs stuck around. <laughs> right, let's move on to this bit, shall we? So all I'm going to do now is I'm going to grab this piece. I'm going to grab my sentiment. So I'm going to use smile because that'll fit on my piece of paper. Lovely. I could use one of my other sayings, shouldn't I? Should we do inspired? Because it does do seem inspired. inspired. Yeah. The one that's looking at me and saying, use me. That's on that beautiful big set. It is a favourite that's been brought back. And you've got loads on there. And they're nice big stamps as they well. Are, so I think this inspired is probably one of the smaller ones out of the, yeah. the set. I'm just working out which way I wanted to do it. Now I want to do it up the side here. Yeah, I really like that. We've got inspired. Let's see if I can find my B. Because, you know, I'm, I'm really organised when it comes to my stamp. Uh -huh. you know. <laughs> nice font as well. Um, if you, do, we, want, if you do want these ones, £19 and £98, it is these ones. Um, they are busy already. If you do want them, you have got a lot of sayings on there. Um, and, yeah, brilliant. Brilliant for your card making. Brilliant for your journaling. Fantastic if you're... Um, you know, you're making something just because, not just because it's a birthday or something, but just because you want to send a lovely card to somebody to cheer them up. £19.98 is your price, saving £6. 345393 is your item number. Back to Kim. Right, so all I've done is done a bit of doodling, because it, it's not me if I don't doodle. Oh, I like that. Yeah. Cheeky bit of doodling, it always Absolutely. finishes it off, doesn't it? 
and again down this edge as well just to emphasize that you know what we spent all that time making this beautiful frame around the edge yeah you know all of what was it about five minutes or five seconds yeah that's i the love one. that frame that so that's going to come in like that because i do that you know when i'm spritzing and stuff and i like to catch the the excess mm -hmm. so that's the kind of thing i do but to actually use it on the card looks proper nice i like that a lot it was to be fair that whole tech well that whole idea came from one of my scrap pieces. I thought, oh, I love that frame idea. Yeah. How have I done it? And then I just sat, you know, when you overcomplicate things, yes. I should have really um, dried this, but anyway. Um, when you start to overcomplicate things and think, oh, I need to do that, I need to do that. And then I just sat there and went, you know what? No, I don't need to yeah. do any of that. I just need my piece of paper that I want to cut down and that's it. Yeah, yeah, you scrap. You it scrap. looks absolutely. So good. And if you size your card right, you get your front, you get that piece out of one sheet of A4, and then yeah. you get your card out of the other. Amazing. Yeah. So looks what I should have so done good. is just with this, giving it a quick blitz with the heat gun. Beautiful. Um, I tell you what, there. because of the simplicity of the, the shape of the stamp, they are very easy to cut out. I mean, and because they're nice big blooms, they do make a real impact, don't they? Yeah, I'm making this look harder than it actually is. No, nah, it's not. very early, you know. I'll blame I can't even see. No, they're beautiful. <laughs> they are, and that was the thing when I was designing it. I kept thinking, you know what? I just want simple. I want what does spring mean mm. to me? Because this is our spring collection. So what is spring about? Well, you know what? It's about those big blooms. It's about seeing those daffodils in the in the fields, isn't it? It's about just colour. happiness in seeing that flower. Yeah. And like you say, colour. Yeah, absolutely. Um, so I went for simplicity because as well if you're crafting at the moment you're probably wanting to get out in your garden aren't you and get, yeah. it, get it tidied up a little bit yeah so that's going to come in about I like there them because, oh i love that i like it because you can stamp on your decorative paper it's going to show you can Absolutely. stamp in the stamp to add like extra texture and stuff can't you so you can do so many different things within that stamp absolutely and um, that was one of the things i started to um when i was playing with these i was like right i'm going to start doodling and i started mm. you know messing with my texture papers and I, I had to stop myself because it's like, no, I want to show how simple the flowers are. Yeah, yeah, absolutely. It right. works so well. On that background, it looks so good. I'm making a right mess of my desk. <laughs> no, you're not. Right. <laughs> you so, haven't seen a mess until you walk you in the other room and see mine. Is, I should have really trimmed that down a little bit more, but hey, look at that. How simple is that? If you wanted to bling that up. Do you want to give it a spin? Um, oh so so that's it so we can see that that's perfect that's better oh that is so beautiful just like that that is so but beautiful how simple. a little bit well what simple do you use? but so effective three pots of brush mm -hmm. and, and that a little white bit of card. card a few minutes ago that was just white card yeah. that's lovely kim we're going to let you set up for another demonstration i really <laughs> like that that is so gorgeous. Okay, it is busy for your spring collection. Please check your baskets out. We are approaching 40%. These are brand new. You've got a massive saving, an absolute massive saving. It is the first hour, you know, come on. I mean, it's only half seven in the morning. We should all be asleep. <laughs> Nearly was. Um, it is half seven in the morning. Please check your baskets out. Kim is back up at 10, is it 10? At 10 o'clock, um, which is generally the busier one with our lovely Hayley but this is already really busy so please check those baskets out we've already had one sell out okay so let me talk to you about these beautiful blooms let me show you some of the gorgeous finished samples because honestly the stuff you can do with these so you've got loads of stamps within the stamps you've got these beautiful flowers and all different sizes you've got your background stamps that you can build up so many different types of backgrounds and the lovely thing is you've got your poly plates now now the poly plates will allow you to create so many different effects. They'll allow you to really maximize your color and play with your products in different ways, which I absolutely adore. Your flowers look good. You know, they make really, um, they make a statement, but they're bright. They're really happy, aren't they? I mean, look at that. I love that. 
because that is a really simple card, but it's so effective. You've got your background, you've got that beautiful honeycomb, and then just cutting out that flower. I mean, imagine the big flowers on shrink plastic, and then you, you know, shrink them down to diddies. I love this one. That is one of my favourites. I think that is so vibrant. And then with the, the black and white there, it just looks absolutely beautiful. To show you a couple more as well. So easy to cut out, so easy to layer, so easy to colour in, whether you're paper piecing with these, whether you're using uh, your brushes, maybe you're going to be embossing them, maybe you're going to be stamping another stamp within the flower to create that beautiful texture. Maybe you're going to be stamping the flower onto your air dry clay. I mean, you've got so many different techniques that you can achieve with these. And the bright, the beautiful, the cheery, they're absolutely spring, aren't they? And you've got a lot for your money. Now, you can get separates, but obviously, I'm just going to show you my favourite card. I love that. I love that. It's just so effective but beautiful. Really love that. Um, so, you've got your choices. You could go for that set. If you went for that set, um, again, only £18.99. You better go in for the bundle, though, because the bundle, you're making that £17.50 saving if you're a Freedom member. You've got flowers, you've got sentiments, you've got the big poly plate as well. You've also got on the next one, and the honeycomb, again, of course, um, the next one. Now, you can get that one on its own if you want to, £12.99. Remember, the stamps are way bigger than the packaging so don't let that fool you they're not didions you've got some big stamps there and um, you've then got that huge poly plate these are cool they're really cool you will play with these and honestly these are the backgrounds for so many other stamps as well 12.99 if you want to go for it on its own and then you've got the set of backgrounds now with these there's so many different types of backgrounds you can create um, whether it's going to be grungy mixed media or of course whether it's going to be pretty you can achieve that with those could get them on their own but the best place to get them is that bundle the bundle massive saving obviously be part of a chand of freedom because you get a better serving and of course you're not paying for any postage 710456 is your item number first flexi is just 20 pounds and 23 pence i mean that is so affordable 410456 is your item number 40 percent of the stock has gone brand new 40 percent of the stock has gone now i will be quick and just remind you those sentiments because those sentiments are busy i'm really pleased because they're big they're bold but they're happy aren't they? They're really good positive sentiments. So make your own magic. Dream big. Be positive. Um, you've then got say nice big stamps and they do make such an impact. You've got, and I like that, no rain, no flowers. Obviously you need a little bit of rain. I mean sometimes, I'm not going to lie, it feels not like rain, it feels like floods. Doesn't it? Do you know what I mean? It's like, oh, for goodness sake, stop with the rain now. Please, could we have some flowers? Um, <laughs> um, think, hold on, I can't read that one. Uh, think, be, hold on a minute. Yeah, I'm, I'm reading here, but um, choose, choose happy. Think happy, be happy, get it. <laughs> Happy thoughts. At first I read it as one sentence. That didn't flow. No, Leona. <laughs> <laughs> I thought that was my brain. Um, choose where your energy goes. Oh, good grief. <laughs> uh, now, I really like these. These are fabulous. You're getting both sets of stamps. You've got a lot of stamps there, actually, all together. I'll have to have a count later. You've got a lot of stamps there. And they are really nice statement. There's 19 stamps all together. Good set statement stamps for nineteen pounds and ninety eight pence. Three four five three nine three is your item number, and forty percent of the stock has gone. Oh, it seems like whoever's buying the biggies buying these as well, which is rather lovely. Popping them in that cheeky basket. Um, now, if you do want to get hold of those, three four five three nine three is your item number. I will be dead quick and just remind you of those lovely frames. Half of the stock has gone. We are talking about those wonderful MDF frames. Um, 
dead easy to use but they're that kind of thing i love a good frame because it does make you look at it differently as well you know it makes you are you going to put things behind it are you going to allow things to sort of escape all over the frame which is definitely the way i'd be working with it because i like things like that um they look good whichever way you're sort of viewing it as well so obviously this one's been stamped in but do you know what i mean so when you're turning it they look good whichever way but how pretty does that look and they make such good gifts. You know, if you're using these uh, for home decor pieces, they're selling your crafts. They're really nice to sell, because as soon as it's home decor, you can charge a bit extra, can't you? Um, I love that you're getting the plates, and of course, you're getting the back. Um, so you get the main frame, and you get the back separately, and you're actually getting four sets. So that's with the frame and the background. And of course, the little book, that Kim did is just gorgeous. Literally just punch in with your cropper dial to pop the rings through and then you can decorate it however you want. You know, you can use anything, but doesn't that look good? That's Obviously with the stamps, it. eh? That's what we've just done, yeah. effectively. And that looks, I really like it. Creating those frames just looks so effective. Really, really beautiful. <laughs> um, now, if you would like to get hold of these, four of these for £10.99. pence, Such a good price there. Uh, 474 628 is your item number. Um, OK, let's get straight back to Kim and see what's up next. OK, Doug. Um, I'm going to play with one of our poly plates. So what I've done is I've got the mini poly plate. Now, it isn't really that mini. If you look at that compared to the size of my hand, it's called a mini poly plate, but it's the size of your hand. Yeah, it's huge. It is big. That is, that's the mini, so imagine what the big one's like. Yeah, it's so, even bigger. It is. <laughs> Surprising, that. <laughs> um, size of my head. It isn't. No, not quite. It's a good small. Um, so I've got my poly plate here. What you'll find is they are quite sticky to start with. You can hear it squeaking. Not good. So I'm just going to give it a quick spritz. Okay and just rub it over. Now, the reason I do that is, one, because it's photopolymer stamp, so it's going to pick up any of the dust that's around. Yeah. 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 They have yeah, a tendency yeah. to do that, do our stamps. Yeah. Most yeah. stamps do, to be fair. They pick up any dust that's in... In the air. That's the word I was looking for. <laughs> <laughs> I was going for the galaxy, but that's something completely different. <laughs> and the um, dust in the galaxy. I mean, that would be well cool. And you're picking up galaxy dust. But because it's on a detail stamp, you get away with that because it's only little bits that you want mm. to actually stamp. Whereas on something this big, if you've got big lumps of dust, you're not great. You're going to see it, aren't you? Right. So I'm going to use my Distress Oxide for this. I want big, bright colours. I've just got an inky pinky mark on my paper. So we Distress Inks, you can add them both at the same time, which is great. As long as you start with your palest ones, so you don't contaminate your ink. Of course. Yeah. Yeah. So all over with my yellow. We're going for big and bright. I think we need that this morning, don't we? Big, yes. bright, wake us up. So I've got fossilised amber, and oh, I can never say this one, so it's the other one. Is it persimmon? That, that's the one. Yeah. I can never say it. So you can see, all over the first one, then dab the second. I'm just going to, oh, spritz, very gently. What you want is bubbles, not rivers like I've just put there. Never mind. It'll still work. It'll still work. And I love this. There we go. And we just lift it off. I did overwater that one. It we still always say looks good, though, <laughs> We always it? say it takes three attempts to get it right. <laughs> that I was like one. it, though. It's even, even. And you see, that's really important because getting the water right when you're first doing this, yeah. it can be tricky. So it's important to, to show that it's not a big deal. It is. But what I tend to do is I will stand back and I just... Like that. Yeah, yeah. And it that doesn't even look like you've got water on there, does it? No, so I'm just going to press that one there. And I love it because you can see the colours all merge. I think that's why I enjoy it, because it, it's, it's like that. Ooh. Yeah, yeah. You know how you were saying about picking the dust up from the galaxy? That's I mean, these all look like little galaxies or little moons and little suns, don't they? You know, the way that everything <laughs> sort of merges on them. The other thing, I mean, with your, your poly plates, because there's so much you can do in, you can ink them up and then use another stamp to pull ink off, can't you? Exactly. Um, you can use it... Um, so your kiss stamping techniques, like you say, so ink another stamp up, put it on there, yeah. and get your reverse stamping going as well. What I like to do is, if I create something and think, oh, I really don't like that, don't like the look of that at all, I'll put it to one side. Yeah. And then, you know, in a few days' time, you sat there and you're going, oh, I just need a bit of something that's this colour. And you look through your scrap box again. Yeah. The I'm, mega I'm, scrap yeah, box. Yeah, great scrap box. <laughs> um, and you just sit there and you think, actually, that, that I hated the other day. Yeah, just now perfect. it looks good. Yeah. yeah. As long as your colours 
They don't even have to go together. So I've got yellow and orange there. My favourite ones to go to are cracked pistachio, peacock feathers, and either picked raspberry or wilted violet. Beautiful. That combination, wow. Yeah, just and, your faves. Yeah. And you were talking about doing the galaxy. Now we've got a circle poly plate that yeah. I know is on the website. Yeah. Um, if you do that in oxides on black card, amazing. It looks amazing. It does. Yeah. I'm gonna just pop that one there. Oh, I could have done with thinking that up a bit more. But you can see where I'm going, can't you? Yeah, that's so cool. I think I'm going to leave that there. Um, half the stock of the collection has already gone with these. If you do want to get these, remember Kimmy's back at 10, but half of the stock has gone. Right, so, should we use Big Bloom or Little Bloom? Big Bloom. Big Bloom, okie dokie. So I'm going to do another one with this poly plate then. I'm just going to ink it up again. Because I like the Big Bloom. It is, it's, such, it's a happy stamp, isn't it, like mm. you say? I just like working on the bigger these bigger plates just because you can do so much. And I think once you get into think Ooh, I didn't spritz that one. Can you see how it went all bobbly? Ah, uh, yeah, yeah. I think once you get into playing mm. with these, then you start experimenting, don't you? You do. And we do have some set colours that we go, right, if you're unsure, use this, this and this. Yeah. We also have other ones that, you know what, just go and play. Yeah. You've yeah. got you will have um, I think everybody does. They will have a set colour the palette they go to. Yeah. yeah. So you will have probably three oxides or inks in your mind that you know work together and you know you're happy to use. Mm. Pop them on your plate as long as you go palest to darkest with your inks, not your oxides. Ooh, never with an oxide. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, oxides one at a time or else you contaminate. Yeah. Because they're a bit, you know, temperamental those <laughs> ones, aren't they? I mean, I'm terrible. I'd, I'd, I'd be slapping them all on done. <laughs> <laughs> you know, <gasps> but it's not just, don't think just oxides. I mean, think about your watercolour pens. Absolutely. You'll be able to use your pens on. Yep. Obviously, you know, you're going to be using these with your embossing powders. So you're going to be, you know, creating some beautiful embossed effect because you've got that big space, haven't you? Yeah, absolutely. Um, the other thing I like to do is with your stencils as well. Yes. Yeah. Yes, of course. When I'm feeling brave. Yeah. <laughs> 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 right, so I'm just going to ink this one up again. Now, you could line him up, but I'm not going to because that means it takes a couple of minutes to line it up, doesn't <laughs> it? You know, you've got to think. Can I just say, you know the murder frames? Murder. Um, <laughs> the MDF frames, they are now limited stock. These are going to be our next sellout. Um, you've got four of them for £10.99, pence, limited stock, less than 10% remaining. Um, gosh, at this time of the day as well, quarter to eight. Uh, 474628 is your item number, limited stock, so please check those out. What I would say, I'm, I'm lining up here in case this didn't stamp properly, is you would make sure that it's perfectly dry. Mine's a bit soggy yes. still, so, you know. Right, okay. And it is quarter to eight in the morning. Yeah. So, you know, I'm, yeah. I'm lining the excuses up here. <laughs> Oh, I do that, and go. it's perfect. Yeah, there we go. Do you know it what? Works. See, I'd love that, because as soon as you put a frame around it, it changes the whole look of it, doesn't it? Yep. And I could now go back in with my inks. Yeah. You know, I am one of them that, no matter what card I'm working on, I have to use a bit of a doodle. Yeah, get yeah, me, yeah. Get me doodle Always pens out. Fast. My white doodle pen in there on oh, the line. Oh, yeah. I'm not. I'm, I'm, I'm stepping away. You're I'm, being good. I'm, I'm being good. Right, let's go for another word, because I was going to do... Be happy and smile. Should we do that one? Let's do one? that one. I was going to do off that stamp set again, but we've already seen that. We don't want to see it again, do we? No. no we've got so many others to use. Have you seen this? I'm taking over. I'm spreading down the counter. <laughs> it looks so tidy <laughs> compared to mine, though, at the minute. That looks that's beautiful. What, that's what I mean. You haven't seen the desk I work on at home. Woo. To be I fair. Think we're all the same, though. Well, I always end up, my desk, lovely and tidy, and then I will start to work, and you end up getting smaller and smaller, don't yeah, you? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, it drives me nuts. Yeah. Um, can I just tell everyone, those mudder frames have gone. They <laughs> have sold out. It is our second sellout. If you do want anything, you do need to check your baskets out. It's a busy morning here at uh, my chamber. Forgot where I work then. Um, <laughs> Um, oh yeah, I stopped myself on me, huh? Did you hear that? Um, <laughs> um, please make sure you do check your basket out if there's something you want. So all I'm going to do uh, is, I've just grabbed my little chopper. Put that down. And I never measure anything. I don't know about you, but I... I, I don't measure. Uh, 
a special, it's I don't know. Too short to measure, it. isn't it? Mm hmm Absolutely. And I do like, ooh, I've just put a big black inky pinky on there, mind. <laughs> You get the idea, that's the main thing, get isn't it? Yes, love. Yeah. Doesn't matter if I just put fingerprints <laughs> right, left and centre everywhere. Oh, black inks. I always have black smudges. Black ink gives smudges everywhere. I didn't even cut that properly, never mind. <laughs> just don't look too close, it'll be fine. We can't see it, love. Yeah. Don't no one'll see it. He's zooming in on it. Do you know he's <laughs> such a monkey for that? Always oh, if you tell him that something's not right, he'll zoom in on it. <gasps> Honestly. Right, oh, so I am quickly going to cut out my big bloom. Evil. I have to be careful with this one because it keeps calling it my big bloomer. <laughs> and it's not. Uh, my big bloomers. Oops. I really like that. See, that is, it's just such an easy background, but lovely, isn't it? What would look nice as well is, have we got two minutes for me to just? Sure. We've got eight minutes, in fact. <gasps> really? That's gone super fast. I know. Tell you, isn't it? Magic could tell her. It's like we're on, um, yeah, on super on um, fast forward, isn't it? Yeah, I can cut out better than this. I'm just. Mm, I tell you, worst cutting out ever. No, nah, it's lovely, and it's just such a, a happy thing to cut out. All what I big, tend to do as well ones. is, if you've noticed, when I'm putting out my petals, what I tend to do is actually cut down a little bit further, not to the centre, yeah, but just a smidgen back, so that let me see if. Let me get a speed up here, and then we can get a little bit of shaping going on this yeah. one, shall we? Yeah, it's nice, actually, because you can just cut in a little bit more, can't you? Yep, cut in a little bit more, and then you can get some real nice shaping going on. Normally, I grab my pokey tool, but I know I've not brought that with me, so I'm just going to use a pen. Beautiful. All right, there we go. I've done that one. Just grab my pen, flick it forward, yeah, and then just... Make sure it's dry, though. The amount of times yeah. I've done this recently, and um, my petals have been wet. Uh, and just ripped them off. Ripped my petal off, how oh, rude. You don't want that, do no, you? No, you don't want to rip off petal. That's not spring. No, that's... <laughs> I don't know what that is. I don't. <laughs> Halloween. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Right, uh, so we could pop that on there, and it'd look really pretty cool. Nice. But yeah. That you looks... know what? Let's go back in, shall we? With there you go. Look, it actually looks quite creepy, oh, doesn't it? That way. <laughs> looks really pretty. What I'm going to do is just grab my big bloomer again. Aye. Make sure you ink him up properly. Do do do. Not to self. Yep, no, it's self. <laughs> Could you tell? <laughs> yeah. <laughs> and then we are just going to. Could have probably done with a bit of a, like a. Maybe a brown or an orange ink for this, but... I see where you're going. That's yeah. a lovely idea. Honestly, they make cracking backgrounds. Let's see how fast I can ink this one up. Or not ink it up is the problem. Yeah, that I like that. I do like doing this. I think I've got another demo like this a little bit later on. See, I'm not inking up in places, but it doesn't matter. I won't matter. tell anybody if you don't. And I like that. I like not going over the, the top of the ones that you've stamped. It looks really effective. Yeah. So I'm just going to throw this one, what do you reckon, about there? Yeah. Yeah, just there. Yeah, because you need your three, don't oh, you? Oh, absolutely. Yeah. Three, five, seven, anything that's odd. Yeah, yeah. We like odd. We like odd. That's it, or jaunty. Yeah. Odd and jaunty are our friends. <laughs> that looks so cool. Let me just wipe my table, because I'm not a muck mucky pup, am I? There we go. Right, so all I'm going to do is grab a white base card, pop that onto that. I'm not going to glue it because, well, oops, inky pinky again. Beautiful. That goes on there like so. And then, what do you reckon? Should we have him up in that corner just yeah, like that? Yeah, that looks lovely. And then a gem, a bit of glossy accent in that. Oh, your uncle. look at that now. That is so bright, isn't it? It's cheerful. That is <laughs> lovely. Yeah, I absolutely <laughs> adore that. Um, yeah, they're just happy, aren't they? But simple. Happy. Be happy. Really simple. And smile. Thank you, our lovely Kim. I wonder, do you reckon we've got... Right, I'll be dead quick. Shall we... Will we have time for, like, a technique or something, do you think? 
Would you like to do <gasps> that? Go on then. Let me grab a piece of paper. Boom. I'll I'll tell you sixty percent of the stock has gone. If you do want this, sixty percent and this is brand new today. I love the poly plates. There's so much you can do with them. I just think that that kind of thing that once you get them home and start to experiment. So obviously, yeah, use your distress, use your oxides. Um but use your pens, you know, use your, your wonderful uh, brochures, use your spritzers. If you've got spritzers of different colours, use those on them. You will get really, really um, experimental with these. Use these on your gel plate. Can you imagine lifting the colour or printing the colour onto a gel plate with the poly plate? You know, using your stencils, whether you're stenciling over the top, whether you're actually put your stencil down and then put your poly plate over the top. You know, there's tons of ways you can use them. And then you've got all your beautiful flowers as well, which are dead easy to cut out. Your backgrounds, which will allow you so many different layers and so much texture. £44.96, two payments, £20.23. And and such a good price. Right, back to Kim for the last couple of minutes. Right, back I'm going to use no <laughs> So I'm going to use some oxide. I'm going to go really quick on this one. Beautiful. Probably not the best colour combo, but it's what I've got on my desk. So I'm just going to plop some... Oh, look at that. ...ink on there. You notice I'm not going like that because you end up with a square because your oxide's dip in middle. Yeah. Drives me crackers. So what you have to do is give it a bit of a smoosh, a bit of a squish like that. Just give it a little bit quick, a little bit of a turn. Beautiful. Pop that there, give it a quick spritz. Look how Ooh. bright that is. It looks amazing, doesn't it? <laughs> You could have just stamped that straight away, so I'm going to pop that on here. Lovely. Right, and this is where I send my colour co Oh, why that? <laughs> yeah, it's always the way into it. There you go. Sella. Do that one. Right. Perfect. Now, oh, that's so cool. make sure you wash between each layer. Look how bright that is. That looks good. See, now that looks good just as it is doesn't it? Yeah. I love the way the inks are distributed as well, you know, and it's got those little gaps. That's so cool. So all I'm going to do now, I'm just using the edge of my ink pad. Yeah. And just popping it on there. Oh, I nearly put the wrong... I tried to put an ink pad on top of an ink pad. And you haven't spritzed this one, have you? No, I haven't, because I want, I want those lovely defined lines. So I'm going to pop that on there. And it's easy for overprinting. Absolutely. So I'm just going to do that. What I'm going to do is to make sure they come out. I'm going to sw right. just push it over. Only because I've got dodgy thumbs and I can't always press. Yeah, yeah. So I'm just going to give it a quick press, just like that. And then she says, look at that. Boom. Oh, sorry. That's so cool. That's yeah. just using the edge of your ink pad. Exactly. That's well cool. But imagine um, if ink colours actually work together. Yeah. It'd look even better. Oh, no, I like them <laughs> colours together. I'd pick those colours to work together. Absolutely. Oh, cool. Oh, gosh, yeah, because that green is just divine. Uh, I did. Twisted divine. Citroen is beautiful, too. Oh, mate. See, I'm really <laughs> pleased we ended on a technique. Boom. And I love that because, like, within a second, can you imagine when you've got these home and you're playing, can you imagine how many techniques you're going to get? And, and it is just a case of digging out your different inks, having a play. That is it. Maybe you are going to doodle on them with a water pen and then actually, oh, there's tons. You just need to get your... Um, delivery to your door because two thirds of the stock has gone. Be part of a, be. Oh, there go all the words. I did so well. Uh, be part of a chand of freedom. You're saving seventeen pounds and fifty pence. You're not paying postage either on any of your orders, and you've got flexi, which means today for the full collection, twenty pounds and twenty three pence. So affordable. Seven one zero four five six is your item number. Now, our Kim is back up at 10 o'clock with our lovely Hayley, who's looking lovely still, I like that skirt, our Hayley. Um, so, uh, sorry. <laughs> um, so, she will be back up. Um, and you've got loads more techniques, our Kim, I Perhaps. presume. Yep. Marvellous. Thank you ever so much. Oh, thank you. I love our shows. I, re I love polyplex. I love seeing what they can do. And that splash of colour, Kim, we needed that. We did. 
happy, shiny, bright morning. Yeah, yeah. Oh, love it. That green. Um, yeah, thank you, our lovely Kim. Okay, folks, check your baskets out. Um, don't miss out on these, but most importantly, do join our lovely Kim with Hayley at 10 o'clock. Right, I am going to get myself set up because I'm back with you at 9. Uh, but we've got our wonderful abs and the all and crate gang and a little me coming up next. So funny. <laughs> You one day special. Honestly, everything over there looks fabulous. You've then got me with Hero Arts, and then our Kim is back in the building with loads more gorgeous um, demonstrations. Don't go anywhere. Stay tuned to Chanda. Hi, I'm Charmaine from Dolly Dimples, and I've been crafting since I was a little girl, and I have a massive passion for anything crafty related. Dolly Dimples is a fictional character in Dolly Dimples Town. There's uh, whimsical characters, fantasy characters, mythical characters. There's so much going on, so much happening in Dolly Town. And it's a fun place to be in. Our products are all hand-drawn. That makes them quite unique because you've got that quirkiness about them. We have decoupage, backing papers. We have templates for 3D objects, stencils in the mix. We have dyes and lots of other things coming to you soon. Make sure you tune in for the Dolly Dimple shows on a chanda and have some fun. Hi, I'm Hazel from Pink Frog and it's Pink Frog's 13th birthday. So I hope you can join us where you'll find lots and lots of new ideas, hints and tips and some great products that we've got to share with you. Make sure you don't miss the celebrations Friday the 12th of March at 6pm through till Sunday the 14th of March. I'll see you there. Hello, I'm Hayley and you might have seen me presenting here at Hachanda. Well, I've always been an avid crafter behind the scenes and have been given the opportunity to share some of my favourite products with you in a monthly show called Handmade by Hayley. I'll be covering lots of areas of soft crafts like quilting, dressmaking, sewing, knitting, even printing your own fabrics. I'll even be bringing some items from my own Handmade by Hayley range. So I hope you'll join me, let me inspire you, and maybe you will discover a new craft in the process. Exciting news! For the fifth year in a row, Hochanda has been awarded the top accolade of Platinum Trusted Service Award from FIFO. These awards recognise businesses that deliver exceptional experiences as rated by you, our customers, and we're honoured to have been selected. The Trusted Service Award means you can shop with confidence based on the reviews from over 60,000 Hochanda customer experiences. Thank you for your independent reviews. It means a lot to us. Hi, I'm Pat and Mark from Totally Patched. We're a family-based business here in Shropshire. We've been established for about 20 years. The, all of our kits uh, come pre-cut, meaning all the fabric is cut for the actual people who want to make the items, whether they be um, cushions, bags, quilts, or anything else you want to cast your creative memory or mind into. Most of the kits we produce, we design ourselves. The design process is usually inspired by the fabric itself. We use only use great quality fabrics, 100% cottons. So, whether you're a beginner or an experienced sewer or quilter, we hope you've got something for all of you. Make sure you come and watch us on Hachanda.
Hello there and welcome. Well, I am really excited to be spending the next hour with you, Sals, because I have got the most incredible hour ahead of me. We have got a whole hour of creativity and we're talking all and create. We are looking at the March Mega Collection. It is an amazing bundle. I will go through all the finer details in a few moments, but I'm not here by myself. I've got to introduce the fabulous Abs. Good morning, Abs. You're a long distance from me this morning. Good morning. Yeah, we're far, far away, but... <laughs> We're close. <laughs> Looking forward to the hour. Now, I have I to say, you've done it again. What an amazing deal. Uh, thank you. Yeah, and I'm really, really pleased with this release. I'm happy with everything. And um, I couldn't be more proud of the team and all what they produced. It's an amazing, stunning collection, different style, different size, something for everyone, yeah. whatever their style. Well, this is the thing, and you'll notice again, we've got an amazing amalgamation. So many wonderful artists in the design team, everybody involved with All and Create, incredibly creative. But what we've got here is an amazing deal for you, where you've got three designers from the team coming together to bring you some amazing new stamps. Now, we're going to be focusing on Tracy Evans, because this is your um, details on the screen, as you can see. We've got lots of different ways of getting hold of these, so we're going to be jumping up the information on your screen. The way for you to get hold of everything, if you want, in, is already up on the screen there are some huge savings on there so much so that the saving if you're a freedom member is actually the cost of the Tracy Evans collection that I'm going to be sharing with you in a few moments so if you're a freedom member I would consider that before you start um, looking at anything else because it's an amazing deal now Tracy's collection is where we're going to start today and this is a beautiful collection I mean she has so many different styles this is the thing that I love now you've got five stamp style, um, sets with these ones you've actually got 61 stamps in total so there's a lot of stamps there. Some of those things that we know and love from Tracy. I mean, Tracy Abs is so good with her botanicals, with her flowers. She loves her garden and she loves her designs, <laughs> obviously. Um, she, she has amazing um, range of designs there. As you can see, hand-drawn images uh, mixed with other imagery. Um, something unique. Yeah, it's really absolutely beautiful. beautiful. Perfect time of year as well with regards to these because, of course, they are beautiful springtime flowers if you choose to make them that way because of course you're the designer you're the creator with these you can make them in whichever way you like now if you're wanting to go for these by themselves they are available at the bottom of your screen 82 pounds and 95 pence but as i mentioned the saving on that march mega collection means that you are saving if you're a freedom member the cost pretty much of that collection there so that is something worth um, thinking about because what we've got is we've kind of got an amalgamation of three designers coming together in that mega um, collection the March mega collection so Tracy's designs we're going to be looking at those during this particular hour. details at the bottom of the screen if you just want those but how do you get that saving well let me explain tomorrow we're going to have a fabulous a mega deal with regards to the next bundle and this is focusing on abs and the wonderful um Bipasha. i mean there's some absolutely beautiful designs in here so we will be looking at these in closer detail from tomorrow at six o'clock but they are included in the collection now of course you will get the savings that you would normally be getting with regards to those in the bundle but i'll break it down again in just a few moments and then as we edge a little bit lower on our display you'll see the fabulous Janet. Oh, Janet has got such an amazing style. I love this kind of doodly caricature that we get from Janet. I mean, she's so clever. She's so clever. I like that whimsical style. I love the cuteness of them. And I like how, um, as you say, each time she's um, bringing more characters to yes. extend the family and extend the range, and there's always something nice. So, and each time, a different theme. For example, here we have the material girl with the sewing there. We have the cats, we have the garden, yes. we have the lot, lit, 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 lit love, we have um, the happy and choose to be happy, and and also the set of the gentleman, because yes. the previous release we did the, uh, the housewife, yes, the set I of remember, four ladies, yeah. and now we did the gentleman. Do a bit matchmaking. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> I love it. And it's so true. I mean, those little characters, many of us can look at those. The little lady holding the cat straight away, I think, are my friends Jackie and Samantha, who are very much cat ladies. And it's kind of, you get that connection. Even though Janet doesn't know these people, well, I'm presuming she doesn't know these people. She might know Sam and she might know Jackie, I don't know. But they are perfect with that particular stamp. Now, of course, that brings us nicely to your bonus stamp if you're going for everything. Because how would you like a little Leone? Well, our little Leone could be coming home with you if you are going for the complete. I love that little face there. 
absolutely adorable. Now, the only way you can get hold of this particular stamp is if you are going for the March Mega Deal, the details of which are up on your screen. And it is, I mean, favourite, favourite. It's, it's, it's my favourite, favourite. You can hear us saying it, can't you? Um, and, of course, absolutely perfect um, if you wanted to get hold of that within the bundle. Now, swap the details around on the screen. We've got the Freedom Members discounted price then. Now, the reason we've got this up on the screen is because it's the way of getting the biggest saving. So you've got three flexi buys as well on this particular one. But let me explain. You've got savings on each one of these three different bundles that are bringing to you. So you can go for them individually, you will get those savings, but those savings are carried forward into our March Mega Collection. But of course, it's a March Mega Collection. You want more than that, don't you? Of course you do. So in addition, you are getting an extra, extra £11 saving, which means everybody is saving at least an extra £34. But, and it's a big but, if you are a Freedom member, you will save an additional 10%. So what that means is that £35.96 is an addition to the three different savings, which means you're actually saving £82.04. That is absolutely amazing saving, isn't it? And you'll get everything, including a little Leone as well. Adorable. But that saving actually equates to this bundle because this is Tracy's collection. So if you were going for Tracy's collection by itself, then the details have popped up on your screen there. So that is actually, um, well, you're saving more than that on your, your mega monthly. So you're saving £74.66. I mean, that's, if you're a Freedom member, that's what you'd be paying for that. Brilliant price. But the fact that you are getting that and saving probably another kind of, well, another £10 or so, I suppose, isn't it? If you are going for the huge, there's a lot of sums, there's a lot of numbers. But all you need to know is overall, if you're a Freedom member, you are saving £82.04 and, and you've got those three flexi buys, but you have got 130 stamps. Absolutely amazing. I haven't even mentioned the washi tapes that you're getting in with these. Absolutely amazing examples here. And abs, I mean, this is a really extensive bundle, but so many different variation styles. I'm just grabbing hold of any of the finished samples that I've got in front of me. I think these ones are predominantly traces, but there's so much you can do with these. Absolutely, so many things you can do with these. And they work beautifully together as well, so you can mix and match. And as I just mentioned, with those washi tapes, it's just perfect finished touches for your project. Yes, yeah, absolutely beautiful. And this is lovely because you can kind of almost build your own garden with these. It doesn't have to be your cards though, of course. What you could be creating is things like these wonderful little journals. It could be seed packets that you're creating, some wonderful sentiments in here. And obviously the opportunity with some of the other stamps that we've got on the show for you to build up these beautiful backgrounds as you can see as well. Absolutely amazing value for money. Beautiful designs, absolutely incredible results. I mean, Joe, that is beautiful. I love the purple used there. Absolutely amazing. You can see the depth of this one. But do you know what? Do you know what this hour's missing? Could do with a happy hour, couldn't we? As if we're not happy enough, though. Eh? Now, have a look at these. These are brilliant. Now, these are your happy hour deal. So, with these, you only have up until 9 o'clock to take advantage of them. They are incredible backdrops for you to use in so many ways. You're saving a tenner on these. Bring them right the way down to £9.98. A little over 50 minutes for you to take advantage of these. So, 272301. Absolutely brilliant. But you know what? It's a very special hour. I think, what, I mean, pff, one happy hour? Ah. <laughs> We laugh at your happy hour. We want two happy hours. So we have. That's what we've got here. Now, these are amazing. Again, beautiful designs. Again, Tracy involved with regards to the design here. Absolutely amazing. Now, that what's happening with that price? That's not the right price. We're going to get that changed for you. You're actually saving £12 with these. So it's £20.98 you're going to be paying for this one. We're going to get that all sorted out. But do make sure you're taking advantage of these. The item number will be exactly the same. So if you've jotted that down, don't worry. But we will get it updated. We've got to do things on I say we. I'm just a dear standing. I'm not doing anything. Um, but our lovely Molly is going to take care of that. So there's a lot to absorb. There's a lot to think about with regards to this amazing collection we're bringing to you. So I think it's time for us to pause, reflect and look at some amazing finished samples.
absolutely beautiful. Amazing. And that's just the tip of the iceberg. Imagine what you're going to be able to create with these when you get them home. Now, how many of you eagle-eyed viewers out there have spotted something with the packaging on this? Or NABS has just drawn my attention to it. I didn't even notice, I'll be honest. Now, when you look at the packaging for your little Leone stamp, you will notice that the phraseology, the wording of the word favourite here, um, that's the American um, way of spelling it, isn't it, Abs? The designer is from the USA. But if I turn that round, you will see the actual stamp is the British spelling. So you don't have to yeah, worry about that. Yeah, which means they have the perfect spelling for the there British. There you go. So with this particular version, you get an extra two letters because you get the two U's. So what a bargain, <laughs> eh? <laughs> I love it. Now, if you're wanting that stamp, then you need to be going for the complete bundle that we've got up on the screen there, which many of you are doing. So, so the details are up there on the screen. And don't forget, three flexi buys means that you can ha add anything else in and spread the cost. And that goes for the happy hour deals as well. Now, with regards to this particular one, the price has come down. Of course, we had a little bit of a wobble with the price, but it has been dropped down now to £20.98. So that roughly equates to £7 extra on each of your three flexi buys if you fancy adding that one it's a really nice set with that particular one the other happy out you're loving this i'm not surprised i mean less than a tenner and such a useful set of stamps this one again if you want to spread it over the cost it's around three pounds and 33p ish um, on those three flexi buys because I can't divide nine pounds and ninety eight pence but I know that's what a tenner is divided by three two seven two three zero one if you're wanting to get hold of those absolutely amazing very useful set and they work so well alongside your fabulous March mega deal rapidly approaching 40% of the stock of this huge bundle you're getting so much within here and I can't wait to see what abs is going to start creating with these talking of which how you doing abs what you got planned I'm doing very well and I got some um, a series of tags to create a mini book at the end. So I have here Lovely. some tags and then at the end we're going to join them together and create a mini book. So Wonderful. I'm going to start um, stamping um, some of these um, new designs. So let me start with here yeah, the stamp set 451 in the bucket. So I always take my acetate and see if it's to the left, right, a little bit up, just to have an idea what I'm going to get. And once I'm happy with the um, when I'm going to position my stamp set, I just put it in my acrylic block and give it a good layer of ink. I'm using here VersaFine Claire permanent ink because I'll be adding some um, colors later and spraying some water and more details. So that's a good layer, should be fine. So we'll be roughly here. Such a pretty design. Yes. This is um, it's a really cool it's one. It's called in the bucket this one. Yes. I like I like it. <laughs> Now, of course, if you're going for the March Maker Deal, you will get that one automatically. But if you're wanting to go for the March collection at the bottom of the screen, equally so, you will get it in there. But of course, you are getting the bigger saving with the details with your little Leone stamp. Oh, that's nice. And that is perfect. OK, so just let me give it a wipe with my stamp aside. So that's the first image. So I will be doing um, different stamping. I will be stamping with... Um, for, um, how to say with VersaFine ink pads, permanent one. I'll be doing also some um, VersaMark just to have different textures this time and a different look. So at the end, my mini book would be all um, different and interesting in terms of in terms of textures and details. So I have here another um, stamp set from the A41. It's a good size stamp that one. So let me take my um, tag and then always use my acetate just to see um, if I want it. I think I want it also toward the right here, somewhere this way. That's good. And yeah, as I said, I'm using the Versa mark here. So a good layer as well. Okay, that should be enough. Now just swap the details around on the screen there. Um, obviously Tracy's collection is available by itself, £82.95. But if you are going for that March Mega Collection and you're a Freedom member, you are actually saving um, more than the cost of this particular bundle. So do consider that. Three flexi buys, of course, on your March uh, mega deal it does break that um, cost down a little more so. Um, but do consider that before you check out your basket for any of these individual collections. Just bear in mind the biggest saving is with that biggest bundle. Okay, 
this out. I put my layer of um, Versa Mark. I'm going to use some green for that one because I think that leaf will be better and green will be beautiful. Oh wow, look at that detail. See, you see it even nice. better this way. Uh, a bit more here. And then the bottom part of the set as well. I think that is perfect. Now, I covered most of the design. Let me just get rid of that one. Good. Um, give it a quick hit. Do I show you the other stamps that you're getting on that set as well? Because it is a big A4 stamp. And when you look at an A4 stamp, sometimes you might think, oh, everything is all joined together. But not on this occasion. You've got those different stamps there. And they are huge. Absolutely huge. You saw. You see the one that um, Abs is working with at the moment um, here. And then, of course, you've got the fabulous ones with the butterflies feature on there. Multiple layers. And you'll notice elements that kind of cross pollinate. So these circles with the numbers in there, you'll notice them on all of these. So if you do want to work on a larger canvas, then you can do that. And everything ties in together. Now, if you're wanting this particular stamp plate by itself, it's at the bottom of the screen. It's called Through the Meadows. It's £24.99. But it is part, obviously, of your deal, your um, Tracy Evans collection if you're going for it that way and it is also available um, in the big bundle that we've got on the screen if you're going for it by itself 60% of the stock has gone so just bear that in mind if you are going down that route for the individuals then some of the stock can kind of start diminishing quite quickly when we're not keeping an eye on them how's that looking abs look at the green here how it's popping out oh wow you see that stamp is amazing and then i'll be adding some colors here later as well so that's two tags okay. now what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna do um this stamp set where is it uh can't find the third one yeah back to the same one but i want to use this design this time i want to use that beautiful um design stamp set there but before using it straight away what i want to do is i want to actually i'm gonna do it I'm going to leave it for now because I had an idea. So I'm going to do, I'm going to just use one of the pick and mix the A4 what we have in the show. I just oh, want yes, to stamp yeah. the vase, that the vase here. Nice. I just want to stamp that one and then put those a flower inside. So this one also is available. We have a nice um, pick and mix on the show today. We do indeed. We're bringing the details up for you. And this is something that we regularly have um, on our website that you can shop for at any time. But you can see you go oh, pick and mix. Three designs, there are loads to choose from, absolutely loads. So best way for you to see these is to jump onto the website and have a little look. You will see all the different designs. You've got a £25 saving with these and you can see you've got a huge selection here. So the one that Abs is working with, if you do want to go for that one, you will find it tucked away in there and of course if you're adding those in alongside your um, your mega um, deal your monthly march mega deal then of course you've got your three flexi buys and you can spread the cost of those as well that's the benefit of going for that bumper bundle it means that you can add things in and spread the cost of those items as well thanks abs okay so this is the daisy elegance if someone wants to know which stamp set i'm using from the pick and mix this is the daisy elegance it's an a4 one so i just stamped the um I say here the face and I just took some ink off that I did not want to have and I'm going to put it somewhere in here. And we do have also the acrylic blocks on the show. I was just about to mention the acrylic blocks because it's quite a unique way of stamping those out with those big plates. As you can see, I had some ink here on the side, but it doesn't matter because I'm going to bring colours later and I'm going to add some um, more details so it will not be a problem at all. So, putting that stamp set aside and now bring back my stamp set and then put those flowers in here. Ah, clever. So, it would be a little bit, my tag is smaller but it doesn't matter, I'm still going to put it in there and then add some other leaves from the other stamp set. So let me bring my um, border acrylic block and then stamp just part of that. Um... Lovely, and the, the smaller of the blocks is available in the bundle at the bottom of the screen with your A4 as well. I've actually got both of them here, they're huge. So always useful, you regularly see abs working with these. Um, now, they've been out of stock. Um, in fact, they've been out of stock for nearly a year. My goodness. Yeah, for quite a long time. Yeah, we couldn't get been. any more stock. We had some stock. So the last time we got stock was over a year. And then we were just trying to cope with that stock. But then at some point, we didn't have any left in stock. And we had to wait a long time before we be, available, uh, be able to order more. 
but it makes sense to go for these because obviously you different sizes of your stamps can work on these and you've got your large acrylic block there it's very flexible so you'll regularly see abs working with that and flexing it to get the detail that he needs both of those come to you for 21 pounds and 98 pence so again if you do want to add those into your flexi order spread the cost of those over three payments as well so I'm just I didn't, a line just to guide me to go on that face and then I know what I'm doing. Also, um, while I have um, on the same tag, I want to add more details. So I already the design in there, filled in our um, layers. I want to bring the other stamp set that we have also on Tracy's collection, which is um, the name that I cannot pronounce. If you can help me with that. I don't know what's it on this one. <laughs> it's a 452. Yeah. Let's have a quick look. And here what I want to use, I want to just put some leaves here next to it. So I'm going to go maybe for that one for now. Did you find it? Yes, a strontia. Strontia. Yeah. I think Trace is doing it in purpose each time, bringing those names. <laughs> I think she's making them up to make it difficult for us <laughs> to say them. <laughs> so I have here the leaf from that stem set but um let me bring my acetate again just to make sure i'm doing it in the right it's always like it's really kind of a nice um to have that acetate to use it to know yes. if you want to put it this way or Beautiful. maybe actually this way is even better and then that joking apart and um, these are flower names so what you can do if you wanted to which i think is always a nice feature is to go off and find a little information about the particular flower and maybe include that print it off on a um, word processing document and perhaps stick it inside of a card or on a tag so you kind of got the reference point and the imagery of the flowers there as well yeah. that looks like it was, it was meant to be a stamp together the way that you've done that yeah amazing. and this is so far as you said it's just like uh, black and white we did not introduce any colors yet and i'm creating already my um, beautiful pages now i'm going to do the second leaf from the same stamp set Actually, not the the leaf. I'm going to use this flower because I thought if I put that one on the side, it will look good. Oh, sorry. That one on my acrylic block, and then you can either you can put it here, kind of another vase on the side, or maybe on one other side here. It will look good. So. Just that part in there. Oh, I have some ink left, so I'm not going to waste any of that one. Just put that flower here. Yeah, there you go. Looks nice. So that is one tag done. Another tag. So we have three so far. Now let's move to another quick tag. We're going to add more layers later, but um, I need to do all the main stamping. And then once we add the colors and everything, we can introduce more stamping at the same time. Okay, put that one here. Now this time I'm going to come back to the A4, the large one. I'm going to come back to the A4 and I'm going to stamp this one with the other butterfly. Bring my acrylic block and then use the same um, way of I do it is just put here the acetate and see when I'm going to have my design. And again, another one from that A4 stamp plate that we were looking at a few moments ago. Put the butterfly t shirt on, especially. <laughs> <laughs> and this collection, all the stamp sets work really well together. Okay, so I want to do something like this here. It is nice because like you said, they work together because they've all got those kind of little connections, the little circles, the text, the numbers. Yeah, and the butterfly there is amazing. Mm. It's a really, really nice design. So I'm just making sure I don't miss any details. So, okay, I think it should be fine. Yeah, perfect. I have some ink left here, so I'm not going to waste anything, as always. And I'm just going to do some stamping here. So it's a nice continuity. Yeah, see? It's a beautiful right. in there. So, this is another tag. This one, this stamp set, as I said yesterday, this stamp set is, um, for me, a finished piece. You have the focal point, you have yeah. the texture, you have the background mm -hmm. elements, you have everything. I'm not going to add any more stamping in that one. This one is only finishing touches and some colors. Okay. 
and then one more and then we move to the next step which I'm going to stamp the um, one of the main one here which is the the one with the circles Lovely. and let me put that tag aside and then just use one part just that part here and the butterfly will be on the sides Uh, so sorry, what did you say? Yeah, that way. And again, those blocks coming into play, they're at the bottom of your screen should you need those. So, a good layer of ink for this one. And then do my stamping. There you go. Lots of you adding goodies into your basket. Um, don't forget this amazing deal is brought to you over three flexi buys. So when you come to check your basket out, to, you've got the option of spreading the cost because you can do that quite easily. Um, it doesn't have to be that one-off payment. So if you're a Freedom member, you can see there's £74.88 is the price. It's around the same price if you were a Freedom member and you're just going for the Tracy Evans collection because, of course, Tracy Evans is the artist that we're focusing on during this particular hour. Well, the hours for today. And then 6 o'clock tonight, we'll move across to Vipasha and Abs collection. And then on Saturday evening, um, it's um, Janet's turn and we'll be looking at all those wonderful wonderful designs from Janet so uh, yeah a lovely collection all brought to you together but if you're wanting to go for Tracy's collection we've got the details on the screen and you will get the stamps that we're working with at the moment and you've got 61 stamps in total these are the stamps that Abs is working with at the moment so we're going to have a closer look at these um, but just to let you know over half the stock has gone which is why we brought the details up to let you know monthly make a deal there you can see um, um, that brings that price and that flexi buy payment down to 60, uh, 74 pounds and 95 pence which is pretty much the same as the first flexi Flexi buy payment if you're going for the complete collection, which I'll tell you about in a little while. But so, yeah, it's just one of those things to think about when you come to check your basket out. Yeah, I was about to stop here for the stamping, and then I found that there's one tag left next to me. So, okay, oh, I'm not going to wait. Make use of it. And I found this next stamp also next to me. It's also the next bundle on the, on the, uh, the counter oh, there. Oh, yes, um, that, that is, yeah. one with the, um, the February release, which is an amazing stamp set as well. So, I thought, like, well, I did not use this. I used the background, I used the sentiment and the others, but I did not use this house before. So, I said, okay. Come here. <laughs> <laughs> Does it make sense? The tag is waiting nice for you. Heart. And look at that beautiful, yeah, um, the that beautiful. Um, now the details are at the bottom of the screen. So if you do want to get hold of the heart grunge stamp that Tabs has just worked with, um, it was the February um, monthly make a deal bundle that we bought to again the artists that we were mentioning there during March as well. Absolutely brilliant collection. You've got um, your pheasant featuring in there. You've also got that gorgeous alphabet set, and of course you have got um, the heart all coming together again from Tracy. Now you may well have got hold of these last month with the deal but if you did miss out on that where they are back again 50 pounds and 97 pence bringing you all three of those and again if you want to add that in with your um your flexi order of your march collection you can do um if you're going for the the mega the mega mega um, bundle then of course you have got your three flexi buys on that one so of course you can spread that over three pence you've got what, what was the saving on that one sorry a three pound saving all those little savings do add up don't they so it's worth thinking about yeah, so I'm just uh, quickly hitting that because my Versafine here um, was very juicy, so um, I don't want to have all the smudge around it. Okay, what I'm going to do now is I'm going to bring start introducing some colours. So I have here my tags. Let me show you all the ones that we did today. Do we do, do more? Yeah, there you go. So we did those six tags now. You can do more. I just focused on six, and then you can do more if you want. Um, they all look different, and each time they have. Um, but there's a continuity of the theme. So now I'm going to introduce some colours. Should we start playing with this one? Lovely. And of course, this is the one where Abs has taken one of the stamps from the A4 Pick and Mix alongside the Tracy Evans um, oh, I definitely need stamp. a little bit here because I can see it's wet, still mm. juicy. 
I'll quickly show you some finished samples with regards to this. I know Abs is still now to, uh, going to be choosing his colours, but it, it's amazing looking at the stamp that Abs has got. I can't wait to see what he's going to do because there's so many different variations from the design team already just using the same stamp. Gives you different results time and time again. So each one of these, I think, um, are featuring um, the elements um, within the, the, the particular stamp set. So you've got your circles, your butterflies featuring in here. Again, more circles and butterflies coming together in this particular one. Different colours different variations different focuses with these because of course within this particular collection you're getting 61 stamps incorporating things like your stencils your medium um, paste and things like that all coming together and of course that fabulous set um, with the the little bucket of flowers in there as you can see again and the gorgeous little butterfly so just a little kind of idea of some of the ways um but we're going to stay with abs because of course he's chosen his colors i wonder if it's green going to be one of those colors that you work ah, with. sue and the green will be sue <laughs> so um so i start to, i want as i said before i will be adding more stamping more layers and more backgrounds but i'm going to use them now with the um, background stamps that we have in the mega bundle okay. uh, background but those i'm going to stand them in different colors so now we start introducing oh, okay, different right. colors so we have that nice um beautiful a7 stamp sets Lovely. If I can open it now. There you go. Now these ones are useful sizes now. I think Bipasha's the artist behind Yeah, this, this one is Bipasha, yeah. Now we'll be focusing on these ones tonight, six o'clock. We'll be focusing at, on your second monthly mega deal, featuring the artwork of the Abs, obviously who's with us, and the Pasha as well. But of course you will get them with that saving that will be released at six o'clock. So why wait? Make sure you're going to get hold of them by placing your order for them now. Similar sort of situation with regards to Janet's artwork. On Saturday night, we're going to be uh, looking at those, focusing from six o'clock onwards. Um, but again, if you get involved now, you will be able to take advantage of the savings that will be released um, at um, five o'clock, um, sorry, six o'clock on Saturday. If you're looking at going for those as sets by themselves, then you need to wait because, of course, obviously, you're going to get the savings when they are launched. So I'm just, um, so I put some layers of this just oxide, so I inked with the red and the yellow, and I just placed some water to have that nice watercolor effect and just add in um, some details here to my background. Nothing perfect, Ooh, just yes. bring in some details. Um, some left maybe here. Nice technique, that one. I like it. Yeah, just add in some to bring that yellow and that um, red around, I think. Let's see if I still have any more ink. Yeah, I do have more. So whatever left now here, just to have that nice texture. They already brought some colors to my um, background. So that's one. And then what I want to do now is I want to take the, um, the second one here, which is the, um, the diamond, Lovely. scripted diamond. Let me put that one here so I don't get, start losing everything in a second. There's a lot of stamps to keep organized. <laughs> <laughs> so now I'm using the diamond and I'm going to take this background here now. And the colors for this one will be slightly different. So I'm going to go with the, um, the peacock feathers and obviously the twisted citron, the green now. So I'm going to add my green. I love this um, shape, the diamond is really nice. It would work well with your stencils that you bring to us with all the different shapes yeah. on this one. Yeah. And actually, because you mentioned that, I can say something. Oh. This shape, the stars and the diamond, everything, they will have matching stencils. Oh, will they? Oh! Yeah. They okay. were meant to be released all together with this yes. collection, but with all what's happening now, it was not easy to get hold of all the stock oh, on time. Okay. Hence, they're yeah. not here and yeah. why we're going to push well I, i'm saying we're going to push the release for the stencils and the dies to a further day i don't know the date yet because but when we, we got it, the stock we did we did say yeah it yeah. will have how i'm really really hoping very soon so um once we get the stock we will um confirm the date and everything oh, yes. so probably beginning of april fingers crossed lovely okay so here's some this detail so here, bring in that yellow, green, well, a bit of yellow as well, because they got mixed Similar there. technique, but it looks totally different with different colours and a different stamp. 
Yeah, so, and also it looks like we're framing that um, mm. focal point in there. So here I put too, too much water, so here you can see better the stars because there's yes. less water, but here too much. But I, I like this watercolour like, kind of um, effect that I got, it's still nice. Sometimes it's nice to kind of over stamp, isn't it? And you've almost yeah. got that echo Absolutely. of design in there. So, um, I'm going to bring that one quickly because now the water is dry, and I'm going to bring this time a, v a permanent ink. Okay. And I'm going to work with the stars because that's the three that I picked here. And I'm just going to ink just a part of it, not all of the stamp sets, just like this, and then start playing around to kind of frame that work here. And now I'm using um, the permanent ink, because I don't want this one to move, but also because this colour is a little bit darker than the, the ones I used with water. So kind of bring that red there. It's and nice because then... these are kind of solid elements now. Yeah, so and then the minute you add some details really frame that um uh how to say that tag the tag and everything okay so i'm adding here the big star and the other one next to it there you go oops you can really get into the nitty-gritty with these stamps obviously um you can use them with the block but you don't have to yeah, you can. For the small ones, I always like using them straight away with my hand just okay. to get something not perfect and something just nice. So, okay, this is what I'm doing here. So, and then we have the other tag here we start working on before um, with the embossing powder. Oh, yes, yeah. So what I start doing here, just before the show, as you can see, I start bringing some colours. Nice. Just using my um, watercolour pencils. So for example here, I have my Derwent Ink Tense. I pick two different greens, one light, one red. And then I start highlighting all those, um, all the circles. You can also go with that last circle here, or you can just leave it as it is. And then what I want to do now is I want to add some, um, for example, for this one, I start with the black and then I introduce some colour, but because this one I started already with colour, yes. so I need to bring a little bit of black. And I said, because we have <laughs> also with the hard stamps that I use, there is this one, the alphabet, That's right, which is, is really, yeah. really good. So I thought I'm going to stamp it on a black piece of paper and introduce the black different way this time instead of stamping straight away in black. Wonderful. Now we're just going to do a little bit of a recap because we've been very busy. Lots of people adding things into their baskets. We've got some updates to do as well. So we're going to pop back and see Abs in just a few moments. But let me give you the details of obviously Trace's section of that um, amazing deal. And this is a brilliant deal. Over half the stock has gone. Lots of you gone for it and the way here. And then there's lots of Tracy fans out there. So you'll be adding to your collection with these ones. Now the elements are available individually. But of course, if you're wanting the saving, then going for it with that March complete collection price is the best place to do it. Everybody's going to save at least eight pounds with this one, but even more so if you are a freedom member, you are saving sixteen pounds and twenty-nine pence. We've also got your three flexi uh, flexi buys, flexi buys of twenty-four pounds and eight. I think I'm getting my flexi and my me me mega mixed up there with my flexies. But your uh, monthly mega deal, obviously, that's what we're getting. This wonderful collection at from Tracy for eighty-two pounds and ninety-five pence. If you're not a freedom member, but £74.66. pence. Now, of course, this does fall part of your, your um, big collection, but let me just hone in on one of these. So your large um, A4, this particular one that Abs has been using, through the meadow, um, rapidly approaching 70% of the stock has gone. £24.99. pence. Obviously, the way that Abs and the team bring these collections to you, you can kind of dip in and dip out of whichever suits you most. We appreciate that um, it's, it's a big bundle. It's a substantial price on there. But, of course, shop to make sure you are getting those savings and also getting the elements that you're wanting. So £24.99. Don't forget, though, if you are going for this collection as a Freedom member, you've got your three Flexi buys. So £24.99 you'd be paying for this particular one. But if you're going for your mega deal with your March collection from Tracy, you've got your three Flexi buys on that one um, so that will actually it's worth comparing because you'd normally if you're going for this one by itself you'd be paying 24.99 but the details will pop up in a moment on the screen as a freedom member it was around 20 it's around a similar sort of price actually um, with regards to getting this over your three flexi buys so here we go it's coming we've got a lot of different prices there there you go 24 pounds and 89 pence so it's actually 10 pence cheaper on your payment that you would be making today if you're going for this as a collection you'll have two further payments to make 
make. But rather than just getting that one stamp plate that you pot uh, potentially were originally just going to go for, you will get everything and everything works together so beautifully well. It kind of extends the usability of that initial set you were thinking of. So it's a good way of thinking about it and something worth considering before you check your baskets out. 900201. Now I'm going to show you the mega deal the, uh, with everything, all three different art, sorry, all four different artists featuring in there. But before I do so, I need to give you a little bit of a reminder of our happy hours because at the top of the hour we kicked off two happy hour deals. You've only got 20 minutes left to take advantage of these. They are going to go up in price. Now this has been a very popular one. We've got £12 saving with this one. Really good value for money. Lots of elements that can be working in here. Lots of botanicals. Again, something that Tracy is so well known for. She does it so well. And if you're wanting to get hold of those two sets together, £20.98. pence. But we have got another happy hour deal for you as well. This one is actually less than a tenner. Brilliant value for money and a very popular one. It's better than half price deal, as you can see there. So those two stamps together, um, again, beautiful designs. This time we're looking at designs from Vipasha. And if you're wanting these ones, they are just £9.98. pence. So take advantage of those. Now we showed you earlier on um, an A4 um, pick a mix. Well, we've got another pick a mix for your borders. So you can choose any five of these for £39.95. You're saving £25 with these. There are a huge collection of different um, stamps in there. So if you've got a wish list, if you've been watching the shows and the specific border stamps that you've got in your little list, then I'm sure you will find them in that pick and mix. Two flexi buys there is just £19.98 for you to get hold of any five of those. Some really good designs in there as well from all the different artists. But of course, we are featuring our March Mega Collection but over 40% of the entire bundle have gone. So many of you taking advantage of these, so many of fans of all of Create. And what we've got here is an amalgamation of four different designers coming together, as they did last month. So if you went for the February collection, then you certainly will be wanting to consider this one because this will work alongside. Very distinct styles with each of these different artists getting involved, but also artists have got different styles within themselves. Now, during the shows today, we are concentrating on the artwork of Tracy Evans. And here you can see that beautiful collection coming together that I introduced you to just a few moments ago in the details are at the bottom of the screen but what it actually equates to this March mega deal if you are a freedom member your saving is going to pretty much pay for your Janet's um, sorry for your um, Tracy's collections all right confuse myself then because we're looking at Janet's now Janet's got a lovely collection that's been released this is going to be concentrated on from Saturday evening at six o'clock but you can get hold of it now um, with the saving that you will be getting on Saturday you also got Janet's amazing artwork in a little bonus stamp that that's going to come to you as well. This is your little Leone. Every crafter should have a little Leone. And what you've got here, you've got a lovely stamp set. Then let me just turn it around to the side so as you can see. Now the packaging on this one, you can see you've got the American spe um, spelling of favourite there. But let me just flip that around to show that the stamp itself has actually got um, the, the UK version of that one. So you don't have to worry, it is spelt correctly. Absolutely amazing. I haven't shown you the washi tapes either. You're getting seven washi tapes. So down at the front here, you can see some of those. Um, and I've also got some up here. Different sizes with regards to these. In fact, I'm going to bring them all in together. So shall I just kind of pop those side by side, just so as you see. So you're getting all of those in there. Um, and yeah, <laughs> kind of a bit precariously placed there. But you're going to get those in addition to the collection. And that is the way that you're going to be able to get hold of those um, if you want them. Because I think they are available individually, but not in with the stamps per se, as I've been showing you. And then, of course, tonight at 6 o'clock onwards, we're going to be concentrating on the Pasha and Abs collection, which is brought together, as you can see here. And we're seeing little elements being brought forward because, naturally, they all work so well together, which is why we've got them all together as that amazing deal. So if you are wanting to get hold of yours, the details are on your screen. Freedom members, you're saving £35.96 in addition to the different savings that you've got from the different sections. And Freedom members overall, you are saving, it was £82. £82.04. Pence. Four pence makes a difference. So you are going to get, obviously, that saving. And if you bear in mind, Tracy's collection, if you're a Freedom member, you are going to be paying £74. So it's actually paying for that... And you're actually getting an additional £7.39 saving for the pleasure of it. 
lots of you adding Tracy's collection into your basket, which you can go for at the bottom of your screen there. But how about getting that as a bit of a bonus? How about not paying for that one because it's part of the bundle? Well, that's another way for you to consider. And the three flexi buys on this one means that that first payment is going to break it right the way down. So if you were looking at getting hold of Tracy's collection by itself, then you'll probably find it going to be paying around what you were expecting to previously. Now, of course, Janice is the artist that we're concentrating on during this hour. We've seen some lovely finished samples. Oh, Tracy. <laughs> Extremely names. <laughs> Janice. No, I meant Janet in the first place, but yeah, all the names, everybody's name, and I'll get the right name eventually. That is a lovely design, isn't it? If you like a very traditional style card, then that is a beautiful one. You can get truly creative with these. Heather has really gone to town with all the gorgeous colours featuring in here as well. So nice way for you to actually use your um, swatches um, to, to give, kind of give you an idea of what you've got in your collection. The artwork, I mean, it's brilliant. Even if you're just using it on top of a background that you've created, and we'd all have huge sashes of those, don't we? And then introducing the artwork and then playing around with it. Absolutely beautiful. And of course, you have got those fabulous phrases and, and, and letters, which Tracy does so well again. But uh, yeah, she's known for her botanical, um, botanicals. And these, I mean, this is brilliant. Jo has taken just one of those stamps there. I love the way that she's built the depth up with this one as well. But you have got the most incredible stamps. Showing you those just simply from the stamp plates there and then adding a little bit of colour, you can see the kind of results you can get with these. Absolutely amazing. And of course, this is Tracy Evans' collection, her part of the March Mega Collection. If you're wanting Tracy Evans' collection, at the bottom of your screen, you've got the details there. But of course, if you're going for it as part of the huge deal and you're a freedom member the saving outweighs the cost of that particular bundle you're actually saving it over seven pounds imagine all of this delivered to your door as a freedom member for 74 pounds and 88 pence you're going to have so much fun absolutely loads love it we've had a picture should i share a picture with you now this is from cheryl oh this is lovely and I love this idea. Now, this, of course, is working stamps, working with stamps that we've seen previously, because, of course, you haven't got your hands on these particular ones yet. But what a lovely card. I love that one. And it shows you, again, how the different um, artists work kind of cross-pollinate. Straight away, you can see Janet's um, artwork there. And I think the bottles there, I think those are Tracy's bottles, if I remember rightly. Um, love it. Thank you so much. Thank you for sharing your artwork as well. Um, so uh, we're going to head back over to see Abs because obviously the rest of the show, we're going to go back over to Abs. We've got about seven minutes left now, um, Abs, with regards to um, time for you to demo. So how are you getting on? I can see that okay. you're busy adding colour. Yeah, I, just, I was just adding a little bit of colour here, as you can see, just a little bit of colour, just so uh, to pop my leaf here and you can see it better and you can make it look more finished and I was doing the same thing here on that one so what I did while you were doing um, the recap um, so I did exactly the same way I stamped before um, nice. just different yeah. colors but this time I used that beautiful stamp set from the A6 where you have this all this texture and all this details so I just went with two different colors and then I started coloring my circles to make them pop more what I did also um, um, yeah is the stamp set here so I start this is that one I did before because I'm um, doing the show I was adding yeah. the colors so what I'm gonna do is just going to add the colors now around so they start coming together very well oh something else i was doing is um the alphabet stamping it on um black cardstock okay i was doing that one so what oh, i yes. did is i stamped with a versa mark and i put white embossing and um, powder to get letter like this can you see oh, now oh nice yeah i don't know if you can see the embossing oh it's not showing the screen but yeah, you can see here all nice ones and they already did many letters so we have the a for instance we have the t the e the n the b different letters and then what i want to do is each tag i'm going to give it a letter okay so instead of putting numbers like tag one two three i'm going to put letters Never, for them yes. and also it's bring that black touch also to my project so here just uh, a nice idea of um, using the alphabet differently and I like the font of this one, and I like how each letter is different. And and the alphabet is the set that we've got with the pheasant and that fabulous heart in there as well, isn't it? So um, it's uh, the bundle that um, obviously that we saw last month. It was the um, part of the February mega collection. You may well have missed out on it, so I will show it to you in a few moments. But uh, yeah, you can see it obviously fabulous alphabet and the heart that we saw um, abs working with earlier on so uh, yeah i'll show you those in just a few moments because you've got lots of stamps within that set again tracy coming to her own with her artwork so if you want in the alphabet set just very very quickly let me show you. you've got your full alphabet there 
They are individual stamps, so you can stamp out as few or as many as you're wanting to with those. You've also got the lovely heart, the elongated heart that we saw Abs work with, but then you've got your other elements that complement it so well. And then finally, you've got the wonderful pheasant, as you can see there. Beautiful, very useful one to have as well. Um, so yeah, if you're wanting those, you can add them in with obviously your bundles that you've already got in your baskets. Okie dokie, absolutely. And Matt, how are you getting on over there? So what I'm doing here now is I lost my, um, I can't find my, how to call it, the, um, the stem that I use using the, the diamonds. I can't find the stem oh, set. Right. Oh, cool. I, I told you I'm going to lose it in a second. <laughs> so what I did moment. is okay, I, yeah. I'm going to replace it quickly with the scripted semicircles. It's also okay. part of this new um, uh, March release. Lovely. Um, the mega bundle. So I'm just going to make sure I'm going to put it here next to me this time. <laughs> and that one, because I was working before on this one the one that I worked about when I did the colors I forgot I did on the one that I stamped before the show right. so I'm quickly gonna add some colors in here and texture so I'm bringing um, some colors from the same images can you see this alphabet how really really um, add a nice touch to them yes yeah I like that idea the letters rather than numbers clever idea yeah so just let me put it aside and then I'm gonna do now some um, colors so I have here some yellow and I'm gonna try to put a little bit less water this time so you can see nicely those um, can see well those nice um, semicircles. So I put here the um, yellow first and I'm going to put a little bit of the seedless um, preserves colour here. Not that much, just too much with the colours that I have here on my picture, on my image. That's, I think that is enough now. Well, if I add more, you can always come back and add more of the first colour. So let me add some water. So I'm spraying from a distance that so I will not have um, a lot of water. Okay, so that should be fine now. And let's add those uh, nice textures in there. Oh, nice. Some in there, a bit of here, some. Nice, because um, within the Mega March collection, you've got the stamp that Dabs is working with. There's also a corresponding one, which is kind of like your, your, your negative of that one as well. So the two together look brilliant. What thought must go into building these collections up, Abs? Sorry? A lot of thought must go into to building these up. Just commenting on the fact that you've got the, the, the solid semicircles as well as the, the yeah, open Yeah, so this one, um, this bundle that we're launching today on um, the my collection and the Pash collection at 6pm today, I will tell you more um, later, I will tell them more about, because um, we work together and we wanted to do something that worked together, so everything matched. Nice idea. Because in, in the past, if you remember, I did the hexagons, I did squares, you I did, did triangles, yeah. and we did, um, what else, what did I not mention? And the square, uh, circles, yeah, yeah. The lots of circles and lots of dots. Um, lots of dots actually and totally dotty and this time we wanted um, to have more shapes and then Bipasha said oh I will do something to match yours then let's work together on a collection and nice. this is how we came up with this um, release okay so I'm just doing a little bit in there and stick with that letter here and whatever letter because I can put them in any order later I want this tag so you don't have to yeah. be all here. So I'm just trying to focus only on these stamps. Obviously later you can add some embellishments, you can do more colours. We have here those circles. So that large, um, so the large, how it's called, sorry, what is it? The, um, the large A4 we have on the show, we stamped already... Um, we have that beautiful oh, one yes, with the border. Yeah. So yesterday what I did is I cut all those circles separately. Got you, yes. So, and I did not use all of them, so I have some spare here. So you can also use them to decorate the rest. Obviously here it needs more colours. It needs yeah. colour in everything. Absolutely, and then you yeah. can add those circles. You can add your circles here on your tags. Or you, you can add them. Um, yeah. And you have also those numbers from, um, we have the numbers from the stamp set. So you can also add them. I will see where I'm going to add them here. And while I'm still on that number, I want to get, I did yesterday, I stamped some numbers and letters, part of the background. So okay, I'm going to use yeah. this stamp set from the show today. Just to finish touches. As in this hour, so what I'm doing is I'm showing you um, a different, um, how to say, I'm showing you a different um, ways of using the stamps and how they work together. And of course, um, after the shows, we take my time to finish them off with all the 
coloring and all the small embellishments and all the other details like I usually do when I'm here in Hachenda. I love it. Now we're down to the last minute and a half of the hour. And don't forget, Abs is going to be back at 12 o'clock, so I'm sure he will share with us um, about everything that he's doing in between the hours. And that, unfortunately, I'm going to be working with Abs again during that hour. Very, very busy. Lots of you taking advantage of um, the huge deal, which is all four of those designers coming together. Lots of you taking advantage of Tracy's collection as well. Lots of you taking advantage of those happy hour deals as well, because don't forget, they are going to go up in price at the top of the hour as well. Um, very, very quickly, just let me just refresh your memory of the happy hour deals. You've got obviously the one that is less than a tenner 9.99 better than half price deal with this particular one it's going to go up in price in a little over five minutes um, you can add that in to your flexi basket which whatever you're adding in in there with regards to the rest of the show and then of course you've got your other one which is your a4 stamp plate and this particular one if you're wanting this one you've got a 12 pound saving on it 20 pounds and 98 pence so uh, yes do come back and join us at 12 o'clock how's that looking abs we're down to the last 25 seconds of the so hour right it's here. I just add some uh, those letters here. Can you see the number five, nice, seven, yes. six? Some numbers around, and that's not everything. So always missing now is some colors. Take my time. Do a nice layers of colors, and then you can add, for example, your butterfly if you want to use it Love to it. your oh, tag. Look you at can, that a little Or you later. can add it here. Or of course, with colors, you have some flowers. You can Beautiful. add any um, details and do the eight tags the same Thanks, way. Up. The lovely Leonie is coming up straight after the break with Hero Art, so make sure you stay tuned. I'm back then with Crafty Roo, um, the lovely Kim, looking forward to that one. And then we've got a little bit of Rowan Dean coming up after that. Exciting news! For the fifth year in a row, Hochanda has been awarded the top accolade of Platinum Trusted Service Award from FIFO. These awards recognise businesses that deliver exceptional experiences as rated by you, our customers, and we're honoured to have been selected. The Trusted Service Award means you can shop with confidence based on the reviews from over 60,000 Hochanda customer experiences. Thank you for your independent reviews. It means a lot to us. Hi, I'm Sarah and I'm Vicky. We are the Stamping Sisters from Stamp Haddocks. We'd started our family run business in 1992 when we were importing rubber stamps from the USA. But now we design and manufacture them all here in house in our shop in Bedfordshire. We make grey rubber stamps and we make them as deeply etched as we possibly can so that you can use them in many different ways. On our shows on Hachanda, we like to give you lots of different techniques to use with the stamps, different ways that they can be used and ideas. We hope that we can inspire you to get out your stamps and have a play. Look at all the different designs we've got. We've got Christmas, we've got scenic, we've got cute and furry. There's something for everyone. Make sure you don't miss the Stamp Addict shows on Hochanda. Flexi order has arrived at Hachanda. What is Flexi order? When you place an item on Flexibuy in your basket, you qualify for Flexi order, which means any other items you add to your basket will also be included in your Flexibuy payments, so you can spread the cost over multiple monthly payments. After your first payment is made, your entire order will be dispatched. When you add at least £60 worth of any items to your shopping baskets, either online or on the phone, you'll qualify for our Flexi Order offer. This means you can spread the cost of your order over equal monthly Flexibuy payments, offering you the extra flexibility when you shop with us. Flexi Order, making your shopping experience with the Chanda easier. Kay Fassett is a distinguished artist, designer and author who has used his background in knitwear design to create an expanding range of bold and beautiful fabric prints for the patchwork market. Join me on Hochanda where I will be bringing you a wide selection of beautiful fabrics at fantastic prices.
Hi, I'm Gina Barrett from Gina B Silkworks. We're a family company specializing in traditional crafts for the modern maker. Most of our products involve textiles and age-old techniques from button making, lace making, weaving, and other forms of passamentary. I hope you'll be able to tune in to the Gina B Silkworks shows here on Hojanda. Hi, I'm Emma. And I'm Pam. And we're from Quilters Trading Post. We've been open since 2007, so we're coming up to 10 years now. We started our business um, in Cambridge, really, with a long arm quilting machine. We decided we wanted to make a proper business of it, so we bought a shop in this area. We soon grew out of that because we became successful and we bought a school, and now we're in the school. We have four parts to our business. We have the quilting service, we run workshops, we sell patchwork and quilting threads, fabrics and notions, and we do patterns and books. That's our newest thing, and our favourite being our crafter's carry-on. We've really enjoyed being on Hochanda. It's um, made us famous, really. We've got lots of people who now come into the shop and tell us that they've seen us, and that they've enjoyed the demonstrations, and they've watched us over and over again. Make sure you don't miss our shows here on Hachanda. Hello. Hello and welcome. It's been dusting. I mean, I haven't ever. Um, it's lovely to have your company. Now, we have got the fabulous Hero Arts. Um, I love this brand. I've loved Hero Arts for years and years and years. Um, in fact, in fact, when I used to work at a shop in Ozzle Twistle, quite a few of you will know that. Oh, that went such a long, long, long time ago. That was before any other telly. And um, we used to order Hero Arts stamps there. And honestly, they were up there with one of my absolute favourite brands. Um, they brought so many different stamps designs out but we've also got dyes we've got the most cool stencils and the inks now their inks are gorgeous they've got a beautiful color palette the white is amazing Be beautiful beautiful inks as well so do get ahead of us have a little look see what we've got uh, we have got two shows today I can't remember my second show but I'm, I when is it oh thank goodness for the hype she said seven I'm like I have to be here till seven <laughs> It's 5 p.m. tonight, which is quite long as well. Uh, but, yeah. <laughs> um, so I've got another show at 5 p.m. tonight. Um, but make sure you check your baskets out. I mean, yeah, fantastic designs. Now, what a lot of this show is about is loads of different sentiments. We've got some beautiful stamps. The stamps are top quality, but all different sentiment stamps. So let's start here. What a fabulous place to begin. Now, as I said, there's a lot on here. You've actually got, we haven't got how many, but you've actually got tons of stamps on here. Um, and I love the fonts. These are really good design and a really good uh, style so your first one you have got so we've got hello there you've got just for you sending smiles I love that sending smiles uh, thinking of you you've got grateful you've got thank you you're special you're my sunshine I love that one love you best wishes miss you and um, so you've got loads of stamps now in that one alone does it say how many there are so there's 11, 11. So there's 11 stamps in that one. And then the next set, we have got, um, Jimmy will count. <laughs> uh, so we've got happy birthday. It's your day, blessed with deepest sympathy. Uh, good luck. I'm sorry. Get well soon. Happy anniversary. Um, and there's 10 in there. So 21 stamps all together. Um, and what's that other one? So proud of you. I love that. Um, and the, they do make um, fantastic cards. You can add them to things, like with this one. You're special. Um, so it's your birthday, but you are special. The stencils, of course, are all the stencils on the show. They do emboss beautifully. It's your day. Um, absolutely stunning. And you've got some really nice fonts. I'm not sure if it's your day. It's in this one, actually. Let me just have another quick look. It's your day. Yeah, it is. Trust Jimmy. Trust him. Trust him. Jimmy put the samples out. I didn't, but he put them out. Um, but, but 
How oh, God, yes. Yeah. So if anything's wrong, we can just blame Jimmy. Oh. Um, <laughs> for life. Um, but you can see there that beautiful sentiment. Now, if you do want these, only twelve ninety nine. You've got twenty one stamped all together there. Nine nine seven two nine zero is your item number. Obviously, I'm carrying over all the cards because the cards I'm going to be showing you again for the stencils. But I'll keep them in the pile so I know where to put them back again. <laughs> okay, next. Now you've got two different options in this one then again tons of sentiments now your first one your beautiful everyday messages now these are so sweet i like these a lot because you've got some big sentiments here but just something lovely and these are nice if you are um using them for your your journals as well so you've got dream big you've got shine you've got everything will be okay i like this because these are so um so for now you know that everything will be okay, that positive reaffirmment, you know, the um, affirmment, um, the, the positive vibes in this one and the reminder that it's going to be okay, it's going to be okay. I love the hello with the little flower on it. I think that's super sweet. And you've got loads of little extras. So you've got your flower, you've got your little sunshine there as well um, and your little heart at the top as well. And that, I love this one. Hold on a minute. Hello, beautiful. Hold on a minute. There it is. Isn't it now that pretty? I really like that set. I think that's gorgeous. Only £12.99. So that's your first one. That's your everyday messages. And the other one is your affirmation. Um, so I'm just making sure they're the right way around. So this is your affirmation. Um, yes, no, that's your affirmation. I thought so. And that's your everyday me These are your everyday messages. That's your affirmation. So this is your everyday messages. Sorry. Um, so you've got. I um, I just feel like giving you a card. Do you know what? I thought that said a cold then. Uh, giving you a card. Uh, let love shine. You've got hugs, sending smiles, uh, celebrate, thinking of you. But the sending, of course, is separately. Friend, hello, and thank you. Now I love this one. I think that is such a handy stamp set to have. Uh, so let me just get this the right way around. So that's your everyday and the other ones, your affirmations. I really like these. I think they're the kind of stamps that you'll use time and time again. And I love things like your, your friend on there and the sending, you know, sending smiles. I think that's lovely. Sending hugs. I just think that is so, again, it's really good that you, you've got stamps like that that can cover so many different occasions. Now, it is here reward, so of course they are coming over from the States. Um, so if you do want these, um, you only have to wait till the 31st of March. And I love this, Dream Big. And the You Are Beautiful, that's in the next stamp set, actually. But I really like that, and I love that stencil. Um, you've got that one as well. Thanks, friend. Friend. Love that. I, I really like the friend stamp. It's real and a friend. Um, you've got the shine one, which is just beautiful. And then your wonderful affirmations. Everything will be okay, which I love. I was going to put flowers on there, but I, I ran out of time. I'm not going to lie. <laughs> um, £12.99. pence. You have got a choice, so whichever one you fancy. 314236 is your item number. Now, the next stamp set and this is lovely you are loved this is a really good one for every every occasion any occasion no occasion and i think that's really important there's loads on here and again we haven't put our many on which is so annoying because uh, there's so many on this stamp set it's really annoying that we haven't got the the quantity um you've got i am thankful you are part of my world you make this world beautiful um i'll stand by you Aren't Aren't they gorgeous? My neighbour, my friend, I'm here for you. I've always got your back. Your kindness doesn't go unnoticed. See, I think this is just so lovely. We're better together. Um, and then we are all one. And this one's lovely as well because with this set, you've got you are beautiful, you are value, you are needed, you're appreciated, not alone, love each other. I just think that is so nice. A little globe there. You make this world better. I'm with you. Caring is everything. Uh, you 
have my loving support. I think for now, for these days, I think this, if anything, I think this, um, you know, what we've all been going through, I think it's really reminded ourselves to, to look out for other people and to remind other people that we're there for each other because we're not seeing each other all the time and we can't take each other for granted. And I think it's really reminded us not to take things for granted. I mean, how many life lessons do I need? Uh, but, oh, for goodness sake, stop with the lessons. Uh, but I think this is a fantastic way of, of sending those cards just because, you know, or putting that extra sentiment inside. I think it's a really nice stamp set is that and there's tons of stamps on there. I know I'm always going to do some counting in a little while but it's beautiful and look now this one I really like that. Oh Jimmy's on 39. Molly's Molly's going to have a double check. <laughs> Not that we don't trust you Jimmy. Um, Jimmy you're beautiful. Um, <laughs> I love the sentiment so you can mix and match it. See see with this one I think that is beautiful. So you've got the happy birthday, but then consider this card a hug. Isn't that nice? So someone you send a card to that you're not going to be able to see, but you can send the hug in the card. And that one, you make this world beautiful. Isn't that just such a gorgeous sentiment? I really like that stamp set. I think that is just so gorgeous. Only 89. And I love the little people as well. I think that is really, really sweet. And it can be whoever you want it to be. Absolutely not gender specific. <laughs> uh, 933145 is your item number. Really like that stamp set. Absolutely beautiful. Now, the dies, I really like these as well. Um, because they're really uh, the bold. They're just dead simple to use and it does mean you can use these with lots of other things which is gorgeous and um, so you've got that birthday and I mean look at that sentiment it's just got such a beautiful flow to it but because you've got birthday it allows you to to mix and match it with other sentiments which is really nice really really like this one so you have got your birthday I've got my other one there that's just and just cut in black you know it looks so effective Beautiful, very short, but I love the flow of it as well. And then, of course, you've got your thanks. Thanks. Thanks, friend. <laughs> thanks, friend. Uh, which, yeah, I love it. Absolutely love it. A really nice dies there. Now, for two dies, £15.98 is your price if you'd love to go for those stencils. Oh, my gosh. Now, you have got a pick and mix with, um, no, Yes. <laughs> Have you? You've got to pick a mix with these. You're picking any two stencils. The choice is yours. This is such a hard choice. I am not going to lie. This is a hard choice. So you've got at the top your beautiful flowers. Let me see. Let me try and get. And that is called Spring Sprig, which is that one there absolutely beautiful the next one that we've got is your gorgeous poinsettia now it's poinsettia but i don't think you have to use it as poinsettia as you can see there absolutely love that one the next one is beautiful the sea and the sky this is absolutely divine Oh, there we go. Sorry. Sorry, um, because my eyes were over there. Um, that's your beautiful sea and sky, which is wonderful. Now, this next one, I haven't managed to use it, but I've started working with it. I love this one. For some reason, it reminds me of like a Van Gogh or something. I love that. I think that is just amazing. That's your starry night. Oh, starry, starry night. Um, now, the next one is your wood grain. Oh, I was working with this, and I don't know where I put my background with it. Um, just bear with that's your wood grain i left it over here i love the wood grain one look at that look at that mmm beautiful so that's your wood grain next now this that is one of my favorites what's that one called spiral i love this i wonder i've only just started but look at that honestly and that's a mop up from it Oh, 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 the next one is my diamond, which is, again, I love. If I were going, if I could only choose two, I think the spiral and the diamond would be one. I, I would be one, <laughs> and then I'd choose them more. Um, but that's your beautiful diamond. I really like that. That's a favourite. Next is the ornate floral. This is gorgeous as well, though. They're all gorgeous. I've just cut that one down, so that's your ornate floral. Look at that, though, when I've cut it. Oh, I love it. Isn't that beautiful? Beautiful. Um, the next one that we've got 
is the Art Deco Lotus. Now, this is just beautiful. Where have I put that one? Um, that one. Now, I've, I've cut this one down so you can't see it as much, but I've got backgrounds in a minute that will show you. It's a really nice one, that. I love the open space with that. It's beautiful. And then we have got the butterflies. And this is just gorgeous, your butterfly circle. Now, you can see that one is your butterfly circle. Uh, let me show you some just random backgrounds. Now, Random backgrounds I haven't done anything with yet, but obviously, you know when I'm stenciling, I, I clean my stencils and all this malarkey. So I obviously, for every one card, I always have about 12 backgrounds. But it, I love these. Uh, isn't that just gorgeous? And look at this one. That is cleaning your stencil. Doesn't that look good? Really love it. That's another one, cleaning your stencil. I just absolutely adore these. Love the diamond one. And you see your poinsettia, cleaning the stencil for your poinsettia. Cleaning the stencil. So nice. Now look at that. Mm -mm -mm. Isn't that beautiful? Beautiful. See, there's so much you can do with these. Oh, you know me. I'm a massive stencil fan. But you've got so many good stencils here. You need to be checking your baskets out. I showed you those before, didn't I? Yeah, I showed you those. Did I show you those ones, though? Because I like that. Whoop. Look at that. Cleaning your stencil. Yum. Oh. Nothing better than stencils. Um, right, check your baskets out with those really beautiful stencils. You've got so much to choose from. My favourites, if I could, right, definitely that. That is one of my favourite favourites. Love that. I love that movement. That one, though, oh, man. That is, they're my two favourite favourites, but then I love, oh, the sea in the sky is beautiful. It also looks a little bit like an eye, which I really like. I love that one, and yeah, and the sea in the sky, I'd probably go for as my next two. Oh, it's so hard to choose, though, isn't it? Honestly. Um, okay, check your baskets out. Only £12.99 is your price. Now, the inks. These are lovely. You've got to pick and mix with these, so it is up to you. So maybe last time we had Hero Arts on, uh, maybe you got a few then, maybe you're building up your collection. Uh, they're gorgeous, are these. They are uh, reactive ink, so you can use them with um, your water to get stuff um, and to get them moving, but, but they're also going to dry permanent, so you can use them with all sorts. And the colour palette is gorgeous. What I've done with this is, yeah, I've done it right way around. So that one is um, obviously blended. That one's direct from your pad. So it'll show you the, the richness of the colour. And honestly, that blue raspberry, for instance, stunning. The splash pool party, that apple green is lovely. The fog's a lovely colour as well. You've got so many good colours on here. Really, really beautiful. Look at your key lemon face. Mmm, that's beautiful. You've got lemon drop. You've got creamsicle, fruit punch, taffy. Um, you've got sea salt as well. Now, the sea salt, this one, it isn't pink. What the sea salt does is it's um, a white one. So when you put it over the top, it, bl it, it obviously blends it down, and then that's over black cardstock, um, sponged, and that's over black cardstock direct to pad. So it's a really good ink pad. You've also got the black there. Now, the black is, you might not have sea salt. Oh, no, it's sea salt. It isn't black. Ignore me. Uh, that's the sea salt. So that is a white ink pad. And it's a really, it's a lovely ink pad, is that. Now, if you do want to go for these, you're choosing three for £18.99. pence. I absolutely love these. 672-673 is your item number. Now, check the website out. Obviously, you've got tons and tons of choice. Um, Hachanda.com. And, of course, we're talking quality. It is Hero Arts. Hero Arts have been going for years, absolute years, um, and they've been pioneers in the industry as well. Um, so they have got loads and loads of experience, and, of course, everything they bring us is top quality. If there's anything you want, check your baskets out. The stencils are super busy. So if you do want any of the stencils, um, you know what to do. Do not miss out on these. Um, please show your baskets out. If you've got pictures, maybe you've already got Got some of these I'd love to see what you have got now maybe me I've left this open to just playing because obviously you know what I'm like I, I go off on tangents so I thought I'm just gonna play and we'll see what occurs so first things first and one of the techniques I absolutely love and I am gonna use my favorite stencil which is that one 
Uh, one of the, uh, the techniques I really love is using um, a texture paste. So I'm going to go in with my Stamperia and my cream paste. Obviously cream paste you can use for all sorts, but it, of course you can use it for a texture paste. So just popping a little bit of texture on here. Okay. Like so. It's a nice thick texture paste at first like this and I know it's a white texture paste but we're going to be adding colour to it boom okay your stencils are super busy and I'm not surprised oh they're beautiful can't have too many stencils in life they're one of my favourite favourite things the stencils okay so that's my good old texture paste on there. Now I'm going to use uh, powders. Now I know we've just had on with our Kim, we've just had on some brushios, uh, brushios. If you manage to, <laughs> brushios, if you manage to get them, amazing. I've got Lindy's, um, I love these. Uh, oh, they're so nice and the colours are absolutely divine. Um, I love the pigment powders on this. It looks so cool. You have to leave it to do its thing, but when it's dry, it's seriously, seriously cool. So you get your pigment powder, you literally get a soft brush, you don't need too much, you're tapping off the excess and just sprinkling those on. Now, what I love about this, every time it's going to be different. You're never, not sh uh, you're never sure what you're going to get. And it doesn't really react until... Um, until it starts drying because your texture paste is, is a wet medium it'll go on it won't react as though it would with water you know like with water it's like an immediate pow with this it's more gentle and I love that because when you look at it afterwards honestly when you look at it the day after you'll be like oh my god that's so gorgeous it's so addictive is this technique so don't um, don't try and rush this one Pop your powders on and then let it do its thing. Just trust the magic. See, that's a good stamp. We haven't got that one. Trust the magic. Okay, so pop that on. <laughs> that will be on my list. Okay, lift this off now. And what you're going to get is that beautiful design. Now, trust this. Put it to one side. Let that do its thing. Because what's going to happen, you can see all those beautiful powders starting to react. And you've got that texture. That stencil is so cool. I love that one. That's my favourite. We're putting this to one side. So then, while that's there, of course I'm addicted to cleaning the stencils. Um, what I'm going to do, however, this is when you get reaction. So I'm going to spritz onto my cardstock. I'm going to put this flat onto the cardstock. Because it's flat onto the cardstock, it'll start reacting. Um, I'm just going to take my, my good old doodah, what's it, roll over the top. And then um, it is a brayer. Thank you, our gyms. Hey, Jimmy knowing the, t the the stuff, the the words. Jimmy knows the words. I'm just saying my thing. I'm then going to use a spritzer. Now, I've got the new Pearly Winks one, which is gorgeous. You pop a colour. I'm loving these, loving these. So I'm just going to pop a little bit in. I am putting a little bit of card around me because I do like to not waste any of the colour. So popping the card around me. And I'm just going to aim for that beautiful pop of colour, not too intense and I'm moving that on the floor because otherwise I will end up standing on it like that and then lifting this off these are all, I like all these because these you keep um, for, for other stuff I'm then going to take this and obviously go over the top because I've spritzed it so there's going to be print on there so you've got Excess on there, which is lovely because I've still got movement. Lift this and then boom, look at that. How gorgeous is that? And you've still got texture. You've got all that beautiful movement from the inks, which looks gorgeous. You've got the yellow going in between as well. That is so, so pretty. Again, leaving that because look, you've still got ink on here. Then this is why with something like this, you move and move, you, you keep going. Keep going until there's nout left on it. Okay, so 
popping that down again and I'm going to bring another card over the top. This time I've been using my watercolour, this time I'm going over with um, Super Smooth. Pull up my Super Smooth and look at that print. Isn't that just beautiful? I love that because now you're really seeing that print come through. And I've still got ink on here. And I do just keep going and keep going until I have nothing on. And I, <laughs> that sounds dodgy. Um, and it's just so beautiful because you can get so many prints. Just have a little look at this. And again, look at that print. Isn't that just beautiful? Absolutely beautiful. I love these because out of this one print, I've got so many variations. It's ridiculous. And there's still ink on there. So now, because I've got so many prints, what I'll do now is just spritz this. And do you know what? It's held on so much, or the colour's held on so much, mainly because we did have that um, the medium. And that helps hold a lot of the colour on the actual stencil. So now, when I clean this off, like so, and this is my last lift. But then look, even the last lift, you've got beautiful colour on there. I'm going to roll over with that to pull off excess. But doesn't that look pretty? So that's a really soft print, which I absolutely love. So from that one print, okay, you've got that one. You've got this one. I hope, can you see this, Bob? On my screen, it just looks really, really bright and white. It just looks white on my screen. But can you see that? I mean, look at the colours. The colours are just divine, aren't they? They're absolutely beautiful. Look at that one. See, look at all the different prints you've got. And remember, we've actually got the textured one as well. All of these are from that one print. Okay, so let's take this one first of all. Let's work on this one. So I'll give this one a quick blast. In fact, no, I'm going to work on that one because I know what, well, I don't know what I'm going to do. But give this a quick blast dry. Now, having to blast it dry because obviously it's a bit damp at the minute like so. I love it because I can still feel a bit of texture on that as well. It's just beautiful. Absolutely beautiful. Now, what I'll do is, let's just, and I would normally faff with your matte and layers, because your matte and layers will make it a lot different. It'll make it pop and stuff like that. But just for time, we're not going to faff as much with matte and layers as we would do. I am going to cut a little bit down. And what I do quite like every now and again, especially if I'm doing cards, because I don't do many cards, I kind of like quirky angles with my cards. So when you're chopping it, chop it at quirky angles. And it looks, it just makes it look a bit interesting, like so. And then, when you actually come to layer it on your cardstock, don't layer it so it's straight down. Do you know what I mean? And it makes it look really quite interesting. Just cutting that one off there, like this. So now, I've popped it on. So I'd pop it on like that. So you've got quite a cool little, um, you know, little background there, which looks really cool. And then when you come to matte and layer that again, if I show you, I'd actually put another colour under there. But when you come and matte and layer it again, you've got all these really cool little angles going on. And I'm going to do, there is a lot of movement without much effort. You know, it is literally just trimming your card down. Um, so, it, so it gives you all that beautiful sort of movement which I adore. There we are. And then, so you'd have that layer. You'd, I'd, I would 3D something on this one. I wouldn't just do it flat. But I am for this, just because um, I'm not faffing with 3D form. Because we want to play with colour, don't we? Not form. And I've only got half an hour left. Where does time go? Okay, so inks. Now your inks are absolutely gorgeous. The gorgeous, gorgeous quality of these. So if I just move a bit of that. Now your key lime face, I mean, I love them all, but look at this. So I'm just making sure I've now on that. But that key lime face is beautiful. And with these colours, I mean, I've used my brush or uh, my Lindy Stamp Gang uh, colours, but look how that just works with these colours. I love the key lime as well. It's absolutely 
stunning. See, doesn't that look beautiful? It just brings it all in, which just looks so cool. So just now, a tiny bit of glue on the back of there. Bring that one in. So we've got, I want it more quirky than that. So we've got our lovely quirky background, like so. And then, isn't that beautiful? Sorry, Jimmy. So then we've got our beautiful quirky background. And then, look, boom. As so, honestly, as soon as you bring that in, bang. That is such a good die. They're wonderful of these. The, the thanks and the birthday are just fantastic. So I'll just glue this down. And I'm not going to spend ages gluing. Time, 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 time. So we've got our lovely birthday, which looks absolutely divine. And then let's put a sentiment on. Now, you've got so many sentiments to choose from. I mean, it is incredible. But I must admit, this one, this is, I love this. I, I just think there's so many beautiful stamps on this one. And there's some really, really nice sentiments. My neighbour, my friend, is lovely. I'll stand by you, which is gorgeous. And things like you are appreciated, you're valued, you're needed. I think that is so, so lovely. Um, it works out less than 50 pence a stamp. How many stamps are in this one, did you say? There's 39 stamps in here. Really, really like that. So I'm just going to really simply just get a piece of white cardstock. Um, it is, this one is my uh, watercolour cardstock. Because it's watercolour cardstock, I'm actually using my stamping platform because I don't trust myself. Um, <laughs> just because um, I know what I'm like. It's live telly, watercolour car stock. If it's going to go wrong, it's going to go wrong here and now. So let's see. So it's birthday, but um, I'm thankful you're part of my world. Oh, it's so nice. Now, I'm stamping on a big piece of card. There's no way I'm stamping on a big piece of card and only putting one stamp. That would be daft. So while I'm doing one, I might as well do three, because why wouldn't you? Because then you just cut them down afterwards, especially as I'm using my stamping platform. It's, it's the way to use it. So pull that up. Now, I'm going to use, let's see on the colour. I was just going to use black, but actually, because I'm using stamping platform, we can play about with um, design. The colours I have used will match so many of these. The blue uh, raspberry is divine. I mean, you've got so many beautiful colours in these. They look amazing. So, just bring my blue raspberry. Oh, you're all with me. Blue Raspberry is the most, uh, one of the most popular. It's gorgeous. Which is in the lead with them? Oh, Blue Hawaii. Look at that. And Sea Salt. Sea Salt is a cracker. See, that works, doesn't it? I really, really like that. Like that so much. Uh, you've got we're in this together. I'm thankful you're part of my world. Now, what I'm then going to do is just give it a little bit of black but because i'm using a stamping platform it allows me to be quite specific so i can just very gently touch my stamps like so i might have a little bit of ink where i don't want it but i'm not fussing about that too much you would normally you just lift off the excess where you don't want it sometimes it looks quite nice though but then going back in and you've got look and it just highlights it gently but it highlights it oh I love these um, okay now because I'm on my own I am going to have to tidy these up sorry I know this is a boring bit I know if I had a presenter I'd be like I could do this after but I'm not leaving them on my stamp platform because I want them in the right place. I'm being really good and tidy. I like the way this opens as well. I know this is stupid, but I really like that, that that's um, part of one, so it's like a little folder. I really like that. It's a really simple thing, but very effective. It's, it's the silly little things in life, isn't it? And it, that make it a bit easier. And that absolutely makes it a bit easier. So with this one now, all I'm going to do is get my big old scissors. And I'm going to, I love that one. I'm grateful. Um, I am thankful that you are part of my world. I really like that stamp set. I really like that sentiment. And it's easy. That one you could actually cut into two different... Um, you know, you could cut apart if you wanted to. 
Now, I would normally matte and lay this on black. Because um, of time, I'm not going to. And I love it because now you've got those set as spares. And that's really handy. Having them already cut, having them already stamped is super because then you can just put them to one side and they're always there for you. I'm using my intense black and just going around the edges just to make that pop a little bit. Oh, it's okay, our lovely Hayley. She did say, does she want to come in? Oh, Hayley, you're so sweet. Thank you so much. Don't you worry. I'll, I'll be all right. I'll be all right. That's so lovely. So, that's nice, isn't it? Um, okay, so next, you have got there. So, I am thankful you're part of my world. So, we're going to put my happy birthday... <laughs> Katie, this is for you, man. I'm going to pop it. Oh, decisions, decisions. <laughs> you can have this as a very early card. <laughs> now, where to put it, that's the thing. There, hold on. Yeah? Yeah, yeah, like that. Beautiful. I love it. Isn't that gorgeous? And, okay, something like that took me ages, but I have got about 12 different backgrounds as well. So not only are you making loads of backgrounds, you've got extra sentiments, but you've got a really beautiful card that's utterly achievable. Now, please check your baskets out with these. Um, I'll tidy up while I go down the counter. Boom. <laughs> uh, no, have a look at the website because that's where you're going to find absolutely everything that we've got for your Hero Arts. Hero Arts are, yeah, they're such a good company. I mean, you've got so many beautiful, beautiful elements to play with. You've also got quality and i think that's the thing with um with hero arts you know you're going to get good quality so do not miss out on any of these if you've got any questions email in studio at tachanda.com but obviously with these um all you need to do is pick your favorites and decide what you're going to go for i definitely recommend that big stamp set that's my favorite favorite and then there's so many of your beautiful uh, stencils to go for as well be part of a chand of freedom and then you don't have to pay any postage on anything you have a look at that way i just have a cheeky drink of water <laughs> hockey cokey Sorry, I need to just find out which... I've moved my cards, didn't I? Oh, I don't know which or which. I think this is right. Yeah, that's right. Boom. OK. Ready. Phew. Right, we'll go back through. I will be quick and then I can um, get back to demo. So your first one, again, absolutely stunning. You've got really beautiful... They're all really strong and they work together. You know, like this one, sending smiles ju just for you. But that is going to work with the big stamp set. You are my sunshine. I mean, that is one of the best stamps, isn't it? Love you. Miss you. I love the fonts as well. They're gorgeous. Absolutely gorgeous. There's about 21 stamps in this set. You've got happy birthday. Um, it's your day. Blessed. Uh, with deeper sympathy, which sadly we do need. Uh, good luck. Um, and then um, I'm uh, so proud of you. I love these. And again, they mix and match with the stencils. They're going to mix and match with the beautiful dyes that we've got on the show. I mean, the exquisite absolutely exquisite if you do want to go for those you're getting all of those 21 stamps for 12 pounds and 99 pence extended delivery so they are going to be going out from the 31st of march 997290 next we have got for you um again really really positive stamps now you've got a choice so you've got your everyday messages first of all and you see they all work together so you've got friends so maybe from the other set You've got love you, love you friend, which I really like. You, when you've got them all, you are combining them. I love that one. I just feel like giving you a card. That's lovely, isn't it? And then you've got sending hugs, sending smiles, celebrate, thinking of you, hello, and thank you. And I do like you've got your extras. You have got the butterfly and you've got the lovely little heart there. And then this one, oh, they're so cool. The good big stamps. And, of course, you've got some beautiful... Um, 
and different fonts in there. So you've got today is the day. Uh, this is your affirmation one. You've got dream big. Everything's, everything will be okay. I think that's very, very important. And again, you can mix and match them. So in that one, like you can have that one inside the card. Um, everything will be okay. And that one, or that one, everything will be okay on the front of the card. And then inside the card, sending hugs, can't you? I, I, I like that you can mix and match these. I think that is really important. And yeah, the fonts are just gorgeous. You've got your friend, which is lovely. You've then got your shine, which again is beautiful. And then your last one, everything will be okay. I really like that. And you can colour that in as well. I didn't, uh, but it's a lovely one for colouring in. Only twelve nine nine, but you have got a choice. Three one four two three six. Next, um, you've got your You Are Love. Now, this is lovely set again because definitely my faves because you've got so many on here. Did we? I can't remember. 39 stamps. Wow. Less than 50p a stamp. Uh, yeah, these are cracking. Definitely my favourite favourite. Um, we're better together. You are loved. I believe in you. Um, which is this, I'm with you, which I really like. I'll stand up for you. Um, you have my loving support. Caring is everything. I love the little world. I think that's lovely. But the, that's one of my favourites. You are beautiful, valued, needed, important, appreciated, not alone, which I think is lovely. Consider this card a hug. I really like that one as well. Um, yeah, just think it's full of really beautiful stamps. Um, and I just think... Love is love. Uh, we're all one. Just lovely, isn't it? Your kindness doesn't go unnoticed. I think that's an important one as well. You know, I think that's a really nice one to send to people because sometimes people, you know, they forget how much they're appreciated. And things like that, you know, you can use for any occasion or no occasion, which I like. I like stamps you can use for for just anything, you know, it doesn't have to be for an occasion. Um, and that, you see that one in there, you are beautiful, I really like that. Just in the sunshine of that, um, of that stencil, you can tell this one's my favourite one. Love it, absolutely love it. Um, if you do want to go for this, 933-145 is your item number. Absolutely exquisite. And then, of course, you've got the dies. Now, the dies, really gorgeous. They make an impact. I mean, they've got that wonderful font. It's just such a flourish of a font. But it's easy to read which is really good. Um, they cut out wonderfully. I mean, they are really good quality dies, but they're big as well. So they make an impact, but obviously you can then mix and match them with all your stamps. So they've been designed beautifully to go with your stamps. If you do want your dies, um, 7548.06, only £15.98. pence Stencils. I mean, these are just divine. Um, so much choice. You've got the beautiful garden one, which is lovely. So that's your spring uh, stencil, which is lovely. You've then got the poinsettia, gorgeous. This one, yeah, favourite. You see in Sky, that is such a cool one. And again, very arty, starry night. Absolutely stunning. It's so Van Gogh, isn't it? It's so nice. That's one of my, that's my favourite, favourite. The wood grain, really handy stencil to have is your wood grain. It's one of those that you'll turn to again and again. Oh, my other favourite, the spiral. Love that. Anything that will mess with my eyes. <laughs> I love that. I think that's great. Um, you've then got the diamonds, which is stunning. Love that as well. Oh, love it. And then you've the ornate flower. And this one looks beautiful when you've done it. Uh, sorry, ornate floral. That is such a gorgeous, gorgeous stencil. Next one. That's good, your Art Deco Lotus, because there's lots of ways you can use that. Great for doodling inside as well. And then the beautiful butterfly circle. That is gorgeous. And you can die cut that, like I were messing about with die cuts, like cutting the outside and cutting the inside of it. I'll just show you loads of backgrounds, because obviously you saw the cards when we were going up the counter. So I'm just going to remind you of some of the beautiful backgrounds you can achieve with this one. I mean, that's basically what I were doing before um, in the demonstration but all the different um, prints that I got from that one uh, beautiful um, print. I love that. I love that. And that's using the gorgeous ink pads that we've got on the show, which looks amazing. In fact, that's using the inks. 
that's using the inks that we've got on the show and they are just exquisite in fact nearly all of these i think are the inks on the show if the truth be known i mean this one is i love that i absolutely love that and this i love that as well beautiful um now if you do want these well let me just show you my spiral because i love that oh yeah so beautiful and that one's one waiting for the paste to dry Oh, I love it. Uh, 224196 is your item number. You're choosing to. The choice is yours. £12.99 is your price. And then we've got your inks. Now, these have been really popular, and there's so much you can do with these. They're in a, a reactive ink, so it means that you can layer them. It means you can create loads of different backgrounds. In fact, I'm going to pick a couple of them in a minute while we go through the colours. And you have got so many different beautiful colours. Now, um, just bear with while you're looking at the them. let me just get this because I'll show you um, because you can create so many gorgeous gorgeous backgrounds I mean it is one of those see it's one of those that you can do so much with what's my favorites I love oh there's too many there's too many I really really like these mmm the fog is lovely but I do like the bright colors love them don't they layer beautifully um, so which is popular Lemon drizzle, lemon drizzle, um, the creamsicle, that's popular, and that, yeah, the blue raspberry, that's lush, and then the blue Hawaii, stunning, absolutely, and thistle's very busy as well. Um, the beautiful, they're only £18.99, they are water reactive, so you can do tons of different designs with these, 672, 673 is your item number. Now, obviously, if you're part of a Chanda Freedom, um, it's only costing £5.97 £9, um, for the month. You do not pay a postage on anything. That is such a deal. If you do want to join Freedom, please make sure you get that in your basket. Here's a little clip to tell you more. Have you heard of a Chanda Freedom? Did you know that as a Hachanda Freedom member, you could be making savings on every order you place? For just £5.97 a month, you will benefit from selected Freedom member discounts and complimentary standard delivery on every order you place. You will also receive our exclusive Hachanda Freedom members badge, regular newsletters, giveaways and crafty updates. If you shop with Hachanda more than twice a month, then Freedom is for you. Don't forget, your Freedom membership is flexible, so you can pause it if you're going away or you can cancel it at any time. So what are you waiting for? Give us a call or head to the website, quoting item number 888888 and join Hachanda Freedom today. Hurrah! Right, okay, let's get playing with ink. Now, with your inks, I mean, they are, um, um, you can blend them. Oh, I didn't put my what's it my bob on my glue pot uh, oh oh you don't want to be doing that do you you can blend them you they are water reactive you can stamp with them oh uh, you could do so much oh you can do so much with them i'll be uh, i'll pop it to one side and hope for the best um, you can do so much with them, but the colours are gorgeous. So what I'm going to do, start with my blank piece of paper. Let's get some sponges out. Um, and let's get my lovely little... I like these sponges for this. Um, so, and hopefully my sponges are clean. I did put them through washing machine, you know. But I can't remember the ones I put through washing machine and the ones that I didn't, which doesn't help in the slightest. Okay, so, ooh, colours, colours, colours. Right, I want to go for... I'm going to go for the yellow in the centre. Okay. So, let's go for yellow in the center i'm not going center of the card don't know why i'm going here i'm using watercolor cardstock there so bringing that out my sponge is um is leaving bits which is a bit annoying but it's right so look at that straight away it's a really nice yellow is this one it's lovely um I've then got uh, the yellow is your lemon drop, and it is so sunshiny. It's so, and look at that creamsicle. Oh, that's so lovely. So bring in the creamsicle. Oh, these ones weren't the ones I put through the washing machine. Isn't that beautiful? <laughs> now, don't worry about trying to achieve a smooth blend. That's absolutely fine, because it looks like a sunshine, doesn't it? So nice. 
It does look warm, doesn't it? Do you remember sunshine? Um, it wasn't that long ago, really, was it? And it will be back. It's funny, isn't it? I mean, we had an amazing summer and then we talk like we've never seen sun. Mind you, my heating is broke at work, at home. So, yeah, man, it's so cold. So, at the moment, I'm feeling like I really, really could remember sunshine. It hurts me. It hurts your heart. You've turned the heating off. When I went to visit my mum, and I, I know I've told you like this, but my mum were like, oh, we put the eating on for you specially. And they were like, are you having a laugh? You live up the north. I'm so, what's happened to me? I've lost my roots. I've lost my roots. <laughs> I don't know what I've become. Right, OK. So I'm just layering that colour. And I mean, look at those colours. They're just so beautiful. <laughs> Uh, I'm just, it's ridiculous. I do now, it's funny. I've got, I, I go home and I put about three layers of clothes on. I found my hot water bottle and a wheat bag. Uh, so I've got a wheat bag and a hot water bottle, fluffy socks. I've got skiing socks, don't even ski. I've got skiing socks. It's ridiculous. Okay, so really like that. Already love that, okay? Beautiful, beautiful background, and it's all utterly achievable. Let's see now. Oh, I've got that many beautiful... Um, oh, I don't know which to go for now. So many, so many. Oh, look at that. See, that works so well, doesn't it? So what I'm going to do, I'm a bit annoyed that my sponges aren't very clean, but bring that on and now the water reactive so that means with my water spritzer i'm just going to spritz over the top like so okay and then let it do its thing and it might be a bit subtle because obviously the colors i've used but hopefully we'll get oh i can see it working yes so let it do its job let it do its thing i'm going to take off a little bit and lift off the stencil and then hopefully, can you see a little bit? Yeah, look, look. Oh, it's like magic. Let's hope I've left it long enough. Oh, some haven't come through as strong. Some haven't come through as strong. So what I'm going to do is actually, it does look good. Oh, I love this. And I love it because it's, it's one of them again that's quite uh, you need to be careful not to and this is where i've always been really bad i've always oh now it's really reacting um it's you have to be careful not to saturate it because if you saturate it too much the water goes under and then you don't get the the detail so you haven't to saturate it which is where i'm bad i am terrible when i'm spritzing i've always been the same um i get a little bit excited and a little bit carried away and i put too much water on but you can see the colors coming through it's quite subtle that oh but isn't that just pretty it's so pretty i love 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 that love that okay yeah well happy with that really happy i want to use a stencil in reverse as well so you've got it that side but look look i'll cut these down so obviously i'm going to be changing it but say you used it in reverse so if i then took my yellow pop my yellow in there like so with my dirty sponge i should get a clean sponge shouldn't i because that's going to really bug me i don't want to waste time rummaging for sponges if the truth be known so then they it's right it'll be right let's use that i have got clean sponges a three minutes 40. i have got another show folks at five o'clock and by then I'll be wide awake. Well, I won't, will I? <laughs> I'll tell you what I did. So, um, last night, I were, obviously yesterday I had my one day special. So this morning, uh, so last night I had to prep this when I got in. I mean, I'd already done some prep, but I had to finish my prep off. So I prepped till about midnight. And I forgot her on early's. And then, and I'd text, I was texting Paula at midnight. And obviously she wrote and fast asleep, but I was texting Paula at midnight. And then, you know, when your little voice in your head goes, you're working tomorrow, kid. And I, but I, I, I thought, you know, I thought, yeah, yeah, I'm on air. And, but then it, your little voice goes, no, no, you, you're presenting. Little voice. And it was like, oh, oh my gosh, I'm presenting. And so I looked at my schedule like, oh, I'm presenting early. <laughs> but 
So I remembered this by this time, it was quarter to one. So I remembered quarter to one that I were on early's, but forgot to reset my alarm clock. So I remembered I were on early's, but still had my alarm clock as though I was coming in for seven. Not that I were on air at seven. Ooh! So when I woke, when I woke up at quarter past six, I ran air at seven. I managed to get in the building quarter to seven with full makeup. I'm ready to go. Yep. And boom! I mean, normally that that procedure would have taken me three hours, but when you you know, when you're rushing, time pressed, isn't that ridiculous? Forgot to reset my alarm. You've made it, what, in 15 minutes? It, it is amazing, isn't it, from wake up to in the building. The things you can do when you have to just leg it. I mean, I'm not sure what my makeup looks like, so I do apologise if I look rather frightful today. But... <laughs> Oh, it's awful. It was one of them. It was like, oh, you're joking. I was so close yet so far. Now, look at that, the reverse. How cool is that? Same colours, but, and I love them both. I love that because it's dreamy. I love that because it's really bright and beautiful and strong. And obviously, look, you've still got ink on here. These are water reactive inks. So that means I can spritz that. I know I haven't got time now. I can spritz this. And I'm going to spritz my card. I've overwet that, but that's because I'm getting a bit, I'm rushing. Spritz, pop that over the top, and then, but now, you see, you've got that background going on. Just dry this off, because I know those colours underneath it, which means now, why not bring in, and I know I'm really pushing me look now, why not bring in... 45 seconds of blue. So, because we know what colours are underneath. So now, let's have a little say ready. Boom. Oh, isn't that pretty? Absolutely beautiful. Pick off the excess water and then you've got isn't that just stunning? It's such a nice stencil, is that? I obviously didn't get a chance to make it into a card because I was going to put, um, look, boom. I mean, straight away. And do you know what? I like them fluffy edges as well. Don't they look good? Okay, you will see us at five o'clock. Um, obviously, we've got loads more coming up. Don't go anywhere. Stay tuned to a channel. <laughs> Next is um, the wonderful Crafty Roo designs uh, with more wonderful demonstrations. We've then got the lovely Rowan Dean embroidery and then it's your one day special from All and Creates. Exciting news! For the fifth year in a row, Hochanda has been awarded the top accolade of Platinum Trusted Service Award from FIFO. These awards recognise businesses that deliver exceptional experiences as rated by you, our customers, and we're honoured to have been selected. The Trusted Service Award means you can shop with confidence based on the reviews from over 60,000 Hochanda customer experiences. Thank you for your independent reviews. It means a lot to us. Hello, my name's Stuart and I'm the Managing Director of Oakwood Archer. Oakwood Archer is a family-run business and my son and my daughter work very hard with me to bring the best craft items to you in the UK. We specialise in high-quality items brought into the UK from all over the world, including brands like Kaiser Craft, Stampendous and Impression Obsession. Working with Achanda is fantastic for us. It gives us the opportunity to bring all of these brands and all of these products from all over the world direct to you, the crafter in the UK. Our products include stamps, dyes, papers, buttons, trimmings, ribbons and album making kits. Just about everything you need to be a good crafter. So please, don't miss Oakwood Archer Shows on Achanda. Hi, I'm Abs from Orange Create. I've been crafting for over 10 years now and I love stamping, stenciling, creating layers, of colors, textures and creating depth and dimension. Orange Create was established in October 2016, collaborating with a group of designers and artists from all over the world, bringing different designs and products in different styles. 
We pride ourselves with high quality photopolymer clear stamp sets, dyes, stencils, washi tapes and acrylic blocks, all in different sizes and formats. In my shows at Hachanda, I hope to bring you inspiration and different ways of using your craft products. Make sure you don't miss the Holland Create shows on Hachanda. Hi, this is Els from Elizabeth Craft Designs. Elizabeth Craft Designs is a Colorado-based company. It's a family company, so husband, son, daughter all work in the company and then a fantastic team of designers because a company cannot exist without a great team around yourself. What we would like to share with you is my passion for crafts. We love all the concepts we have, so we have from cute till classic and beautiful designs. We love our journaling planner line and we are going to bring you our ideas, our passion and we hope to transfer that passion to you. So please join Elizabeth Craft Designs here at Hochenda. Did you know you can watch Hochanda 24 hours a day, 7 days a week using the Hochanda app on your Amazon Fire Stick for free? Just like your smartphone accesses an app store to add new applications, your Amazon Fire Stick accesses the Amazon App Store to add new applications. By downloading the Hochanda app, you'll be able to access your favorite craft channel on your TV anytime you want to watch. Here's how to do it. Simply turn on your TV and connect your Amazon Fire Stick. If this is your first time using the device, follow the on-screen instructions to connect to the internet and log into your Amazon account. Once set up, you'll need to open the search bar. To do so, simply use your remote circular directional dial to scroll to the search icon and select it. Now simply type Hochanda into the search bar and this will take you to the Hochanda app. All you need to do now is select download and remember it's free. Once this is added to your Fire Stick, you can move the app for easy access. Press and hold your home button on any app and then select apps from the menu that appears. Scroll down to the Hochanda app and press the button with the three horizontal lines on your remote and select move to front. And that's it. You can now watch, purchase and catch up with your favorite shows 24 hours a day, seven days a week on your TV whenever you feel crafty. Hello and welcome back. Oh, we've got a fabulous hour ahead of us. I know it's fabulous because we were here this morning, not myself personally, but Kim was here with a lovely Leone. You were so busy. We were, seven o'clock in the morning. I know, I know. It's, it's always surprising. I mean, we've got oh, loads of views. And of course, people do look out for Crafty Roo being your shows, your brand. And they have loved what you've brought to us this morning. So thank you for sharing it with us. Um, and so much so that the details on your screen, I mean, it's a phenomenal deal. I will go through everything in the fine detail in just a few moments but I do need to let you know at this stage of play after that hour that we had at seven o'clock this morning this collection is now limited in stock so if you saw the show earlier on and you were thinking to yourself, right, I'm gonna hang on I'll wait until the 10 o'clock show then I'll place my order can I suggest you do that sooner rather than later because potentially you could miss out on these and we're looking at a fabulous brand new range from Kim and pra um, Crafty Roo and we've got all the elements here with the saving now the saving of 13 pounds is because you're buying several different bundles together so lots of elements are available in pairings in little groups of three individuals but the savings that have been kind of allocated with these all come together with the bundle that we've got on the screen there it gets even better though if you're a freedom member you've got an additional saving meaning you are saving 17 pounds and 50 pence now the saving that you've got as a freedom member i think it works out as that you kind of get in one of these elements as a, a bonus so it's almost like whichever bit you want to take as your bonus you can do um, it's, it's easily transferred Terrible. Um, love these, love the design and the show this morning with Leone. I mean, that was so inspiring. Yeah, I think because they're just such a big, bold stamp, it just, it does all the work for you. You, you really true. don't need yeah. much more with it. You can use that big, bold image. Even the smaller ones, I know they're not big, but the smaller ones as well, they just, as soon as they're on your card, it's a statement. Well, That's the word it. I'm looking for. I'll uh, get there. It's a statement. <laughs> I like statement. it. Now, of course, you are going to get your poly plates with these as well. Um, and the poly plates are important because I saw you working the poly plates earlier and I thought they were it was amazing, building up a background, but keeping that background kind of in the continuity of the style of the flower. Yeah, poly plates came about because I don't like colouring in. Okay. Yeah. So it was a way of getting 
lots and lots of colour in your background and I thought hang on a minute we should be doing this behind our detail stamps as well so yes. putting them getting that poly plate the same shape as your detail stamp it means I don't have to colour in I yes. am getting better at colouring in I do it occasionally <laughs> I don't mind painting but colouring in I do struggle with um, so poly plates was my like you know cheat <laughs> but of course you can if you want to, if you are into your colouring in, then you've got your two different sizes. And these are brilliant as well because the style of the stamp, because you've got those open petal details, if you've got your pretty papers, absolutely, back backgrounds, mop-ups, yeah, all those. I've, I've been itching to um, try it on fabric as well because I think on fabric, just stitch it, yes. just a nice little satin stitch as well, that would look lovely on there. Would indeed. Now, um, I'm going to stop showing you finished samples just for the moment because we are now looking at a sold out situation with regards to these. So thank you to everybody that's got hold of those if they're in your basket good news you should still be able to check your basket out and get hold of them that is the key thing but you need to do it quickly because of course after 10 minutes they will fall back out of stock and become available to everybody now we did kind of preempt this coming into a show with limited stock kind of you don't need to be a detective do you to work that one out so what we have actually got is some extended delivery now on the same item number but you are looking at um, it's a week it's 22nd of March it's definitely worth the wait and this is because, of course, this is a UK company, yourselves. You actually manufacture the stamps as well. We do. Mr. Roo makes them all for me. I design. Um, Mr. Roo makes them. I then get to pack them, pick them and send them out. <laughs> I love it. So uh, this is the thing that I love about it. So we're going to carry on showing you all those fabulous elements as you saw there. And as you just look in there, you've got that set of three. Now the set of three are available that you just looked at. But again, different look. I mean, you've got the gorgeous florals, obviously, that we've looked at. But with these, you've kind of got what I call your kind of your, your sketchy geometrics. Yeah, our texture stamps. I, I like having a lot of, well, texture in the backgrounds of my cards. Yes. So it's a way of adding lots of depth and texture to your card, but without actually adding the depth if that makes sense yeah that, yes so yeah. you you layer it up but actually yeah. your card isn't getting any fatter yes yeah? yes um, and i just i just love the effect you get with them but in this set they're quite delicate yes yeah. so that lovely lots of blocks makes a beautiful wall you've got your dot i love the dotty lines this is brilliant isn't it i love it just as that little corner um aspect on there again it's been used alongside the flowers because it just lends itself so well it does doesn't it? Um, and it looks really nice if you just pop a little bit of glossy accents on there as well nice um of course when you're going for the complete set you are going to get those fabulous uh, poly plates which mean that you can get this kind of result which again i just love this the simpl simplicity of this design but it's so effective. Yeah, it's striking and that is just a scrap. So it's straight out of my scrap box. I just cut it down to size and that was it. You just grab two colours. So in that one, it's orange and black. It's done, isn't it? It, it is. Absolutely else. amazing. But wait till you see the next card because you have got large accents that you could be creating from that poly plate as well. This is clever. And do I spy the, the leaves being used as petals? Yep. Mum is a great one for looking at something and going, hang on a minute, I don't have to use it as that. Yeah. So what she's done is she's taken the leaf there and to me that looks like a nice sunflower. It looks beautiful. And it's good advice actually. Look at them as shapes more so yep. than what they're kind of depicted to be. Um, absolutely beautiful. Again, that border being used there bringing it all together all those gorgeous springtime yellows this is a pretty one as well I love yep. the colour so that's really simple to do it's just a big poly plate with a little bit of oxide on there very clever and this one's a clever one as well cutting up those flowers yep so um, again that's one of mum's she's looked at the poly plates within the set and she's just layered them and beautiful it's just beautiful absolutely gorgeous and have a look at this one for a power of colour absolutely beautiful and fabulous to boot as well so if you fancy getting hold of this collection you are going to be very much in good company because it's been a very very popular one as i say seven o'clock this morning phenomenally busy and then of course sold out back on extended delivery now so everybody can still take advantage of it even more so if you are a freedom member because that advantage means you are saving at 17 pounds and 50 pence you can get all of these on their way to you obviously with your extended delivery but the moment they land the moment you get them you can start crafting with them straight away and it's a nice way if you kind of looked at kind of the um, jelly plate style st um, kind of production of backgrounds and things like that and not really known where to get started this is a really nice alternative and a very affordable way for you to do it so 710456 if you fancy getting hold of these but we've got more to share with you because of course when you've made your fabulous project then it's always nice to add a beautiful sentiment now this is a returning favorite so this is one that you love you love seeing over and over again lots of you taking advantage of this one not only today but previously as well this is one that we struggle to keep in stock and i love this some really nice phrases with these ones yeah, i just think they're a nice big statement yes. on your card well 
not just for cards, it's your journaling, your scrapbooking. Good point. They really do cover a lot of bases with these ones. They certainly do. Now, with the packaging, there's a lot of information to include on the packaging. So, um, with these, the, the actual stamps themselves are considerably bigger. Um, you'll see. When I actually bring this one um, in, I'm going to bring it in alongside the stamp where you've got the magic there. The reason being is you'll see how considerably bigger they are when you're actually stamping those out. They are clear stamps. So, if I turn the stamp around, you might not see too much because they are clear. But you can kind of get a little bit of an idea of the sizing of those. So, they are good, considerable size. Um, stamps obviously I've got that the wrong way around but there you go so you can see there dream big follow your heart and then you've got all the different elements there where you can kind of build up your own little phrases as well so think positive be creative all those different elements you can put together to make your own kind of unique little phrases like those ideas but as you say perfect for your journaling perfect for your cards as well and the size of them they when you're working with large stamps as florals you need a large sentiment to be able to kind of hold its own ground yeah and like I was saying this morning, I don't tend to put a greeting on the front of my card, so a birthday or anniversary yes. or something like that. I'd rather have a bit of a, like, on that case, a saying. Yes. Something yeah. that makes it a bit more generic. Yeah. And someone could, I really like that and just pop it in a frame. And it's ironic, really, because it, 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 you t usually you'd have, like, happy birthday on the front and then these sort of words on the inside. Exactly. You're kind of yes. bringing the inside out, aren't you? And then yeah. maybe just on the inside put happy birthday. I hadn't thought of it like that, but yeah. yeah. <laughs> These are turning cards inside out. There you go. Um, live simply. And I love that. Sometimes we do overcomplicate things, don't we? Don't yeah. We? yeah, just really, you can just get away with literally like on that one, you stamp one image and your sentiment and it's done. Beautiful. And then just another one to share with you before we move on to something else. Dream big. And I love this because you've got all those different elements. And these are those broken down elements that you can put together, all sorts of different combinations. It's a popular one. 60% of the stock has gone. £19.98. pence. Three four five three nine three. if you're wanting to get hold of these. You need to get hold of these. They are going to be one of the most useful sets you will have in your stash. You'll go to those time and time again. And it might be that you're adding a little bit of embossed detail. Now, we added these into the show. I think we might have had them at 7 o'clock. But because we've got quite a few gaps, because we've got quite a few sellouts, we thought we'd bring these out. So we have got two amazing pots here of embossing powder. Love these because you've got your antique white, you've also got your clear. Your clear, always a, a useful one to have. So, of course, you've got a big pot of that one. And the antique white, what a lovely white. Yeah, it's an off white, it's more of yeah. a cream. Yeah. Um, because a lot of what we do is distressed. Yes. Yep, yeah, so whites generally on our product with our stamps it would look a little bit stark. Yes. Whereas it's it's a creamy white. Yes. It's yeah. distressed, it's like us. It's beautiful. <laughs> um, also with these we don't have huge quantities of these, so if you do want to get hold of them you need to be quick. And on the black cardstock you can see the coverage that you're going to get with these and all the fine detail that's being brought out. So obviously you can see the clear being used there on top of your black cardstock. And the other one I'm gonna just drop it in, in front of you because what you've actually got is that solid I mean that strip down there it looks like it's a different piece of cardstock that's been applied to it but it's not that's the actual embossing powder so that's the kind of coverage that you're going to get when you're working with those but you are going to get both of those together you are clear alongside um, your um, fabulous antique right there and look at that don't they look amazing beautiful 999 328 187 but be quick because it is just the stock that we've got and that's it so if you're wanting it you need to get in early and you need to check those baskets out and we had some lovely demonstrations from and our lovely Kim this morning at 7 o'clock and we're going to go over to Kim there to have a little look see what you've got planned. What have you up to Kim? Right, I'm going to start, we didn't touch our texture stamps this morning so I'm going to use that one for my first one. Okay. So I've got, I really struggle because all three of those texture stamps I really, I really like okay. and it, it's for very different reasons. So I'm actually going to start off with the lots of blocks and this is a great one because you can actually build it. It will turn into a wall so it doesn't have to be oh, okay just a few little blocks so I'm gonna go in here there we go I'm just gonna keep inking him up and we've made ink over there so this time I've just twisted it round and he's just gonna Clever. slot in yes just like that oh that's a useful one to have. except for I've not inked it there never mind Still kind of worked. There we go. Love Next it. one, I'm just going to turn it round and we're going to fill in this gap here. And then we're just going to start working up our page. So you can see quite quickly you get a 
stamp thrown at me. <laughs> <That's okay. laughs> Quite quickly, you will get a nice little wall being built. That's just really, just remember to offset yeah. them all the time. Really clever the way that you put those bits together. But well, then there weren't actually bricks to start with. You turn them into bricks now. Exactly. It could be anything. It looked nice as just a um, like a strip up your card as well. Yeah. But I do like turning this one into a wall. It was never meant to be a wall. But the more and more I played, the more this one turned into a wall. So I'm just going to pop that one there. We're nearly there. We're nearly at the top. I like the way it's cascading down. Looks good. Right. And then one last one, I think. You just need half of this one for here. Right, and then... So it looks all right, but it does look a little bit stark, doesn't it? Okay. So I'm going to grab my weathered wood. We're going to work a lot with oxides in this hour. Mm -hmm. If my lid wanted to come off. I'm going to pop a little bit on there. A little bit of water. Find my paintbrush again. And then I just want it really weak, so hardly any, um, hardly any ink. Look, more water than ink on this one. And we're just going to come in and go down the edge just like that. I'm just going to quickly right, go through. L's that you're popping in there, nice. It just starts to bring it to life, doesn't it? Yes. So it becomes a wall. I'm just going to quickly go down. You can see I'm, I'm not being too fussy. And again on this one. Just like that. And we're not going to see some of these because we're going to cover them up in a minute. Okay. Just going to turn it around as well so I'm not working over the top. Just like that. So already it's starting to look a bit better, isn't it? It looks fabulous. Yeah. I like it. So let me just grab some kitchen roll. And then, so now my dots aren't really doing what I want them to do. Okay. You know, they're not standing out enough. Right. Yep. Okay. If you go to the trouble of having dots, you might as well get them. If you can have dots, you might as well show them off. Exactly. <laughs> so all I'm going to do is on my dots, I'll do them here where we'll see them. Just a few little, and it instantly... Can you see it just That's starts. That's a clever little tip, that one, yeah. It's just a little jelly roll, pop it on there. You could then go to town and grab your um, glossy accents again. And then they become like little bubbles, don't they? Or rain droplets on yes. your... yeah. It's always so. useful to have one of those little white pens. Do check out on our website. You'll find all Oops. these additional little bits and pieces um, available on there. There we go. So it's starting to look a little bit more like white, it. white, doesn't it? Yeah. Right, so that bit's done. Okay. Not easy. doing any more on that. What I've done is I've cut another piece and just yeah. popped it in half. Okay. So you can see where we're going now, can't you? Yeah. We're just going to glue that on there. If I don't glue this piece, we... I did get my glue working. Maybe I won't. Pop it over there. So that piece is going to go on there, okay. like so. I'm now going to grab... Oh, I was going to grab a piece of card. Mm -hmm. And we're just going to stamp. Let me move that to one side for a second going to stamp my bloom because we were painting these this morning using brush out yes but I'm going to paint them this time using my oxide okay because we've used oxide in the background might as well use it in the foreground don't we makes sense to yeah so I'm just going to grab my black there we go pop it on there So this is using the lovely blooms this time. This morning we concentrated on the big blooms. It's afternoon, well, it's not even afternoon, is it? No, no not yet. No, we've been here a long time. It's only <laughs> quarter past ten. <laughs> Very early start. There we go. <laughs> I'm just going to ink him up again. So I want a leaf at least one. Might even do two. And they do, there's the reverse of the leaf. So if you wanted to... You know, you've got two different leaves on there. And again, they work nicely as well because the flow of them, again, you could use it as a background build. Absolutely, yeah. and it does look nice if you just stamp them randomly yeah. with the flower as well on there. So they almost look like fallen petals as well, don't they? Yeah. yeah. So I've got my ink on there again. I'm just going to add some water. This is where I hope I cleaned out my brush, mm, kind of. Oh, that's I'm a nice green. What green is that one? That is just peel paint. If you're going to oh. do a leaf, it's got to be peel paint in my okay. book. <laughs> it's one of my absolute go-to colours. So all I'm doing... undertone, hasn't it? That one, nice. 
Yeah. Um, what I'm doing with this one is like I did with brush this morning, I've got a base colour really, really pale. Yeah. And then I'm going in to where my oxide, I nearly said brush them, mm -hmm. um, where my oxide is more concentrated. And I'm just going to follow these lines again. So these stamps oh, okay. tell you really, actually I've got a little bit too much water on my paintbrush. So I'm just going to go back in, grab it again and just, they do tell you where yeah, to Yeah, those lines like you say, it's very useful because it gives it the curvature, doesn't it? Otherwise Absolutely. It tells you where to put that um, shading. Yes, yeah, yeah exactly. So we're going to do the same again. So really quick and simple. What colour flower? Oh, we're going to go pink because I've got a pink Ooh, card. Nice. So Perfect it's time of year for this one because obviously I'm in mean, the clocks change the weekend, don't I think? Do they? Yeah, do. do this weekend or the weekend after? It's usually around the 20th. Oh, it might be towards the end of the month actually this time around. No, it's usually around the 21st, but I think it might be the week after this year. Because I remember thinking I'm on an early, so you can guarantee that they didn't have an hour less sleep. <laughs> but I think it's the week after, so it's the other shift. Yes. So you go. I'm oh, just... I'm so sorry for you guys. I'll be thinking of you as I'm snoring. <laughs> um, so again, I've just put a base colour down, and now I'm just going to go back in with the most the stronger colour, just like that. That's really pretty. But it's it's no. It's not complicated. It's well, not it? And I'm guessing, I mean, the technique that you're using here, I mean, you could use on vellums. You might not want to add too much water to a vellum, but you could almost get that parchment look, couldn't you? With on your vellum, if you actually do it on the reverse, so if you stamp or emboss on the top of your vellum, then turn it on the back and add your colour. Oh, and okay. um, that does look really effective. I nearly sent my stamps for a Burton then. Oh, yeah. <laughs> right, so uh, I'm going to just quickly whip around these. Hopefully, I will be better at cuttering out this afternoon. No bother. This morning. Can I show everybody the size of those stamps? Because again, when we're looking at the, pa uh, the, the pack that we've got the front here with all different elements in there, it's difficult to visualise just how big those stamps are. And they are really considerable sizes. So you can see here the large flower with all that detail in there, so giving you all that element that you can work with. Love the fabulous little um, uh, uh, kind of honeycomb that you've got. It's very, very effective, that particular one. I love these. Your smile, you're fabulous, you're blooming. Love the, uh, the fact that you've kind of got your, um, your leaves and you've also got your backdrop of your leaves. So if you do want to add your colour using your ink pads, you can do. And then you've got your overlay of your leaves left and right featuring there as well. That's just the one stamp set. Of course, if you're going for the complete bundle, you're going to get both of those in there. So on this one, again, you've got more of those floors, more of those um, colour fills or, um, that you can build up. The dots, of course, featuring with these. And again, more of those leaves because for your perspective, you've got your different sizes. So that's just one little kind of segment of what you are getting within this particular make it um, or the spring make it collection so you can see instantly it's worth getting hold of because these are so useful to work with you've also got your addition just while um, Kim's continuing to cut out let me show you some of the others that we've got as well so you're going to get these now these are available as a set of three if you want in turn but these are your texture stamps so again good size stamps with regards to these ones that you are going to use lots and lots of different ways i mean i think that looks a brilliant one it almost looks like claw marks doesn't it perhaps around halloween time um, and then you've got obviously your little kind of brickwork as we're calling it but of course loads of different ways you can use it so if you're wanting to use the herring and um, the honeycomb i found this fabulous example here look at that but i was looking at this and i was thinking oh this is kind of migrated this shouldn't be in this set because it's like a it's like a tulip but look closely the leaf stamp has been used to create the petals to give you yet another flower within that combination this is the thing that we talk about look at the shapes don't necessarily look at it and think it's a leaf it's a shape that could quite easily be a petal which will give you a whole host of different flowers very usable set and at 44 pounds and 96 pence a great price freedom members you are getting that additional saving there so that price will come down again to just 40 pounds and 46 pence are you all cut out now Madea? i am all cut out i'm going to do my sentiment next lovely so i am going to grab i've only got a narrow piece of card i didn't really think this through did i <laughs> okay. It's only a narrow one. So we'll see which ones we can fit on there. I think we will go with choose where your energy goes. I think that's a good one, isn't it? Oh, definitely. So I'm going to pop that on there. I'm going to ink it up in black. My energy sinks to my feet at four o'clock in the morning. <laughs> I think we're about knee level at the moment. <laughs> there we go. So I'm just going to stamp that on there. But again, it's just a really simple card to do this one. The, oh, the trickiest bit, the trickiest bit is cutting it diagonally. Yes. And that's because you've got to be a bit precise. The rest of it, well, just go for it. So I'm just going to chop that down. 
Okay. I'll pop it onto my pink. Oops. I'm only doing it rough by eye. That's the other thing. I never measure anything when I'm cutting out. Right. So let's get this together, shall we? Lovely. So I'm just going to pop. There's my little card. I think this is five by seven. I've done it at. That's going to go on there. We're going to pop our angle piece like that. Nice. Just to add a bit of detail. I'm just going to grab my black jelly roll pen this time. Okay. Let's have a little bit of faux stitching, shall we? Ah, clever. Yep. Just like that. And there's a similar one like this done with blue and the honeycomb, I think. Yes, yeah. This is almost like a patchwork, isn't it? The, the, so that's that one. The honeycomb. Your little hexagons. It's a really easy one. It look, you look at it and think, oh, I'm not too sure about that. But then, when you start to... I'm just going to give them a bit of shape. So this time, I'm not going to roll it over my pencil, over my pen. I'm just going to... I've got my thumb in the middle and I'm just pushing it up. So okay. you just give it a little bit of shape to my flower. That's going to go on there like so. And we're going to have a little petal poking out. There we go, that oh, looks a little cute. bit better. And then down here, I would be tempted just to maybe pop a bit of faux stitching around that sentiment. But you can see, Beautiful. really simple. Maybe put that in the centre, actually. Just I like love that. that. And I mean, the flowers, I mean, you could have a whole stash of those, couldn't you? Stamped Good. and cut out, ready for you to add the colour as you choose. Kim, thank you. I really enjoyed that. Just really simple, isn't what it? What a good idea. But it shows you that when you've got the right stamps that you can use them in a whole combination of different ways. But how effective. Love that teeth one. The collection. Now, let's talk about this one because this is a bundle that's sold out. We've entered the show with a limited stock situation. Within a few moments, it's sold out. Kind of knew that was going to happen. Um, and so we have got some extended delivery stock. Now, we're only looking at about a week with regards to these. It's next Monday, the 22nd. So you can still get hold of these. But I would certainly advise you to get involved as soon as you possibly can because rapidly approaching 40% of the stock has gone. You've not just got your stamps, you've got your poly plate. Now, at 7 o'clock this morning, we saw loads of demonstrations using in the poly plate and the poly plate is brilliant because you can see those gorgeous backgrounds being built up using that it's a way for you to actually apply the color obviously you can use the stamps in their regular format but this is where you can get that element where you can see the shape of the flower coming together you can over stamp if you're wanting to but the poly plate has got the similar sort of petal shape so as you can create your flowers what it also means is you can turn them into really large flowers because of course you could use the poly plate as an oversized stamp as you can see they're using backgrounds that you've created, taking your inks to the poly plate, overlaying different elements with them and using them alongside the stamps, as you can see, to build up the detail. Or you could just use the stamps as they are. I mean, this is a, literally a fabulous card there. You've got elements all from the set. So you've got your flowers there, you've got your leaves, you've also got your wonderful sentiment there. And then, of course, you can add to the content. You've got those gorgeous additional elements with the textures, building them up to create, as you can see here, your corners. But if you look close into the elements that you've got here, they are being used within there as well to add that additional interest so it's all about lay layers it's all about adding interest and I love the way that the little petals there have been cut away to show that they're falling away if you want to keep your design quite contemporary quite simple well you can do quite easily you can build your confidence with these maybe your thing at the moment is to practice your coloring in to get those gradients of colors well this is the perfect way of doing it because the stamps have got all the detail that you need in there so it's instantly you can see where the concentration of color is and of course what Kim and it's giving you those lines to mean that you know where those colours need to be applied. And again, they're a different style flower, again being used with the stamp, but again using the poly plates in the background to echo those beautiful colours. It's a brilliant deal, it really is. You've got a £13 saving at least on this one. And I say at least because if you're a Freedom member, you've got that additional saving, bringing the saving up to £17.50. p. means that for everything, you are paying just £40. And was it 46 p was for, my goodness me, my things are starting to wake up. That's good. Um, two flexi buys at twenty pounds and twenty three pence. Um, if you are a free member, and that is delivered to your door, so you'll get both of the poly plates. You'll get both of those stamp sets with all the gorgeous floral content in there, and all of the fabulous texture stamps as well. What was that update? Sorry. 
40%. Oh my goodness, 40% of the stock is gone. Now, if you're wanting to go for them in their own little capacities, you can do. The texture stamps that you're looking at there, they're at the bottom of your screen. You can get all three of those if you're wanting those. $12.99, brilliant price. But most of you are going for the saving because you're saving just £17. Odd, is it more than covering the cost of those? And you're still getting a saving. Again, if you're wanting to go for elements by themselves, so the poly plate by itself, that is available. Um, you've also got the additional stamp set here that is available by itself. This little duo is available, but the biggest saving is by going for all of them together. Do urge you to go for those as a collection rather than going for the individuals because it makes sense especially if you were a Freedom member, because you've got that fabulous saving. Now, I've stepped away from Kim. She's just getting herself ready for a demonstration. So if you've got anything in your basket, now is the perfect time to check your baskets out. We are very, very busy, rapidly approaching half the stock. Yeah, you need to be quick with that one. We've not got huge numbers of those, of the restocked stocks, so get in. If you're watching the repeat, I've got everything crossed that you're going to be able to get hold of these. But if you're watching live, take advantage of that opportunity to get hold of those and then add these in. These are those fabulous sentiments. And I love these because they're brilliant using them just as they are because you've got loads of wonderful sentiments in there. Not just sentiments for your greeting cards, but things for um, your, kind of your aspirational um, books or your, your artwork, your home decor. Now, what you've got here is a lovely um, collection of inspirational and happy words. And let's face it, we need a few of those at the moment, don't we? Now, when you look at these, the packaging obviously shows all the detail that you've got with it. But what you will find is there's a lot of information on that packaging. So when I actually move this away, you'll be able to see that the stamps are a considerable size bigger. So here, you can see no rain, no flowers. And I know uh, lovely Leone like that one. This one's a clever one because you've got happy, proceeding, choose, or you have choose, happy, think, happy, be happy, happy thoughts, all those different connotations. And of course, these will cross over as well. So it might be that you'll use someone from the other set across on this one. And just some nice phrases, not necessarily just your happy birthdays and things like that, which potentially you've already got in your stash, but words and phrases that you maybe didn't even think you needed until you saw this set. I like that. It's a good day to have a good day. Like that one. Brilliant. So perhaps you know somebody that's not having such a brilliant time of it at the moment, then these are the kind of little cards and projects you could be creating. And as we said, it's almost like you're bringing the verse, the inside of your card to the front cover, because let's face it, that's the sentiment that you're really wanting to give to somebody, isn't it? That's the meaning. My mum always loves a good verse or phrase on, the, uh, on a card, because it's that, that's the important bit, isn't it? That's the bit that you're passing on to somebody. And of course, you're saying happy birthday at the same time, but it doesn't necessarily have to be a birthday card it can just be that little card to give somebody a few words of inspiration and positivity two-thirds of the stock has gone so three four five three nine three if you fancy getting hold of those and of course you can pop those into your basket alongside that larger set and spread the cost over two payments works out about 9.99 per payment if you're adding it into that particular bundle but I would certainly be adding this next item in as well it's not often we see that antique white and making an appearance here at a chamber so take advantage of it while you have the opportunity already a Approaching half of the stock has gone of this one. So if you're liking the look of it, you need to be quick. You're getting a good size pot. You've got 25 grams in there as well. You've got your antique white, which you can see is that gorgeous kind of off-white tone, as you can see with these. And then you've got your light, um, light tone here, which is actually your clear. Now with these ones, they've got a little bit of a fragrance to them, haven't they, Kim? They do. The, um People say they smell different things. So mm -hmm. when I stamp with the, the white one specifically, I smell vanilla. It's very okay. sweet scented. Oh, yeah, it's a bit like... Now, earlier when I smelled it, I thought uh, it was like milkshakes. Some people say coconut. So it's yeah. got quite a sweet scent to it. Um, what you do a puddingy smell to it, which probably is the vanilla, <laughs> isn't it? Yeah. What you do find, though, is if you end up embossing quite a bit, you sit there going, oh, I'm hungry. <laughs> <laughs> That's a good point, actually. <laughs> like that idea but they are just, they are scented in the, you know so if you're not into your scents mm, not quite but they're, yeah they're scented but they're not overly so i don't think you'd notice it if you'd not mentioned it to be honest they're just got you a do when you're heating it <laughs> yeah you will it, as soon as you start heating it you get an, an aroma oh i thought you said eating it no. then i thought don't eat it, it. heat no, it no definitely don't eat it i that's, won't recommend that's that that's a north thing isn't it right, so let's smell <laughs>
Oh no, I'm not getting anything at all of the smell of the, the clear. So, uh, yeah, but it's, it's everybody's different. Nose receptors are different, aren't they? So there you go. Um, do like this. Over half the stock has gone. So you've got your clear there, good size pot. And this is something else as well. If you don't get on with little pots, you know, little tiny pots. Sometimes dexterity issues are stro you can struggle with. These are good size pots that you can quite easily take the jar um, lids off. So if you like the look of these and really good value for me. You're getting a lot in there. Nine pounds and ninety-nine pence. Take advantage of them while we have the opportunity because we don't always see them here and when they have gone that's it we aren't going to have any more of these available to you so 328187 if you're wanting those pop them into your basket now time wise what sort of time have we got oh we've got about 22 minutes that's very precise <laughs> very precise <laughs> <laughs> okie dokie um i thought we'd have a quick look at oxides on our polyplate okay so you've got two options when you're using your oxide you can either spritz it or you don't and you get a slightly different appeal um, appearance from it yeah so I've, I've got the littler one out my lovely blooms and I'm just going to ink it up so you saw me do this earlier when I ink up with my oxides I put it down and give it a bit of a smoosh and what you're doing is you're just getting a better coverage onto your stamp make sure it is nice and dry though because the last thing you want is to come along onto a wet stamp and put your oxide because that's just going to damage your oxide yeah so I'm going to put that one on here give it a good press and you're little acrylic pl um, plate with these yeah just a normal stamp stamp okay. base right and make sure you, you give it a good wipe off and then oops that'll teach me not to put my rubbish in the bin once, so. <laughs> so making sure it's nice and dry so you've got quite a solid image there this one i'm going to spritz and Ooh, this okay. this is my preferred way I, I think i like the, the watercolor effects you get with it so i'm just going to spritz it just like that i did over spritz then I'm going to pop it on there and give it a quick press and you Ooh, get, nice. can you see, and as yeah. that dries you start to get those little pockets of yes. different colour you get with your oxides. So that's actually what I'm going to do with this one. I'm not going to over spritz though. Okay. So for my card, let me just give that a quick wipe. Every time you come to ink up your poly plate with your oxide, make sure you give it a quick wipe first. Okay. Because otherwise all that water onto your, your ink pad, not good. Okay. Right, so I'm just going to pop that there. It doesn't really matter because I'm going to spritz this one. It doesn't really matter about getting an equal, uh, even base. So um, give it a quick spritz. spritz that, just to let you folks know that half the, over half, I was meant to tell you half the stock, but it's actually over half the stock has gone now. So, yeah, take advantage of this kit and um, set while you've got it. Um, I'll give you some updates, obviously, as the hour's progressing, but I don't want you missing out on these. So sorry if I jumped in there. But, uh, yeah, two flexi buys. Take advantage of it while you can. There you go. So that's number one done. Again, I'm just going for really simple today. I'm not overcomplicating it. But you know what, some days you have days like that when you don't want to overthink, do you? Yeah, I think sometimes you look at things yeah. and you get a bit overwhelmed. You yeah. look at it and think, I can't do that. Actually, all I'm doing is whacking a bit of ink onto a little piece yeah, of card. True. And it is really that simple. So there's my next one. I'm going to go for my third. You'll, you'll, you'll see. I suppose you could get the kids involved with this particular oh, stage. Absolutely, you should see my two going for it. Yeah. My little lad more than my little girl because he's well, Aww. he's just wild when it comes <laughs> to stamping. So I'm just popping that one on there, and you can see you're never going to get the same effect. You kind of get a different pull each time. Don't exactly. You? Nice. you can as well. If I grab my sheet back now, mm -hmm. I just give that a quick spritz again. Yeah. Oop, there we go. I just stamp that there. You won't get a complete image because there isn't oxide all over, but. Yeah. Get. Oh, it's like a little kind of ghosting yeah, in the background like that. Yeah, a bit of a like, water effect behind yeah. it. So you can just go for it. Are there any inks we should avoid putting onto the poly place? Nope. Um, the only thing I don't really recommend is putting alcohol inks onto them because they are just so thirsty that they'll right. take that much alcohol ink that it's a waste of time. Um, you can stamp into your embossing powders. Oh, okay. Because um, we use high-grade photopolymers, so you're okay to stamp into your embossing powders. So triple layer... Yes. Your clear embossing powder. Always put a coating of an ink, whether it's clear ink or something like your Versafine on there. Onto and the stamp before onto you Onto the stamp it. before you put it yeah. in. Because all that's doing is it's giving you stamp moisture. Because yes. you're going to put it into hot embossing powder and it's just going to soak, it, it's just going to take all the moisture from your stamp. So if you've put that layer of moisture on it, it's, mm -hmm. it's acting like a barrier, isn't yeah. it, really? Yeah. Um, so when you hit your hot embossing powder, 
and can get those lovely textures. It's almost like a, a wax seal yeah, look, isn't it? it it's that it. protective layer for your stamp. It's not going to damage them at all. Yeah, I love it. Now, if you are looking at getting your clear embossing powder and you're looking for the bundle that we've got here, just to let you know, it's limited in stock now, so it's not going to last the hour. Um, if you've got it in your basket, if you're thinking of getting it, please don't leave it to the end of the hour because I think you will be disappointed. Um, so 328187 if you're wanting it. And if you're wanting it now, please check your basket out. So I've got my three little bits stamped. I'm just going to go back in. What I would normally do is make sure they're dry, but they'll be fine. So I'm just going to ink it up. And then I could stand here now, and this is where, oh, I've got to be precise. I've got to try and line it up. No, you don't. Let's go for it. Let's offset it a little bit, just like that. Okay. Because that's the bit to me that I'm, I'm having to faff. I've got, I've got yeah. to actually do something precise at this we do, point. We do kind of put a bit of pressure on ourselves when it comes to things like that, but that is just so effective. But you don't have to. Yeah, so I'm just going to ink this one up. And that's, I mean, it's a real confidence builder. So if you are having a day when things aren't particularly going the right way and you're thinking everything I touch just isn't working, then this is the kind of thing that you could be doing and you can think, you know what, actually, it is working and perhaps things aren't as bad as they seem. And that is actually what I love about using polyplates. They are that simple to use that when you are having a bit of a mojo down, yes. yeah, you know when your mojo just isn't there, yeah, it isn't... But you want to do something. Yeah, you want to craft, but you're not quite sure yeah. what. Grab your poly plate, just any of them. Grab three of your most favourite inks mm -hmm. and pop it down. And you will find, all of a sudden, as soon as you spritz it and see all those colours working them mm -hmm. intermingling, it's almost like, oh, it's fun and it, it does, it just gets your mojo flowing again. Well, the reason I was asking about them um, with the um, ink pads, because I'm thinking these sizes, if you want to do something like a, a sewing project, and you've got the right inks, like your VersaCraft inks, you can actually ink these and put them, just even if it's just onto cotton calico, and then make it your own fabric to actually make your own bag. And what I'd potentially do is perhaps take the stamps, use the stamps, um, and uh, use that detail to actually free motion work or embroider on them, things exactly. like that. There's loads um, you can do with these. I actually love, with the poly plates specifically, using um, fabric paint, because yes. you get a little makeup sponge, and. I, I do enjoy doing this. You sit there, you get your little makeup sponge, a little splodge of paint. It takes next to no paint at all. Yeah. Just lightly, gent sorry, just gently dab it onto your poly plate. Yes. And then stamp it. And the effects you get is just brilliant. And yeah. of course, poly plates are great for repeat, you know, like block patterns well, and things like that. Yeah. Yeah. So all Ooh. I'm doing now is I'm mine's I'm going. <laughs> <laughs> well, I have. I got. Um, I've just moved, moved offices. And I found a big stack of embroidery hoops, and I thought, you know what, I am Ooh. itching to stamp a few of these and start a bit of embroidery well, on it. Embroidery hoops make nice displays as well, don't they? They do. Not, they've got the practical thing, but they do look good as well. Um, folks, if you're wanting this set, just be aware, 60% of the stock has gone. The more that we're seeing with the demonstration of these, the busier we are getting, and the closer we're getting to the end of the hour. So do take advantage of those. Something that sadly you can't take advantage of now are those embossing powders, because they have gone. So technically sold out. If they're in your basket, you should be okay. If you check your basket out quickly if we do have any that people don't check out i will let you know so if you have missed out i don't want you to be too disappointed i'll try my best to get you some of those but um, sadly we're not going to be having them on the show it'll only be if somebody's not checking the basket out and if you haven't checked your basket out it's your own fault Ooh. Ooh. <laughs> <laughs> what? Okay, what I would normally do now is I'd go around with my jelly pen and I think it just adds a lovely little bit of detail to your stamp. So I've done this one. Can you see how it just makes that middle of your flower stand out a little bit better? Yep, I'm not going to do it for all of them. You get the idea. And then I'm going to grab my card. I'm going to grab... I've just got a strip again out of my scrap box. My scrap box is... Well, I was telling the only this morning, I keep thinking, right, I'm going to get to the end of my scrap box. And I never do. It just seems to grow. Well, I went through a stage of kind of organising the scrapbook into dis different sizes, <gasps> and then it ended up that it was taking me that long. I just threw it all back together again. <laughs> I was going to say that he's very organised. Right, so I've just put a strip across there. We're going to whack them on there like so. Oh, lovely. Just like that. But you know what? He's oh. missing something, isn't it? Very, very simple. So I'm going to take my dotty lines. Okay. And pop it on there. And where has, there it is, I'm going to grab my same colour so it's all nice and toned. Nice. 
So again, you're showing that you don't need to have like a craft room full of oh, stuff. Oh, absolutely not. Um, use what you've got. You will find well, anything you can use, can't you, really? So this is going to come in across here. I should have stamped my sentiment first, but, you know, I'll just make it a bit trickier for myself. <laughs> <laughs> you like to do that. <laughs> well, where's the fun in that? <laughs> so I've just stamped that on there. Pop that there. Again, I would come in now with my little white jelly roll and just pop a few little bits on here to make those little dots. I love my little dotties. Yep, so just go on there with my dotties. And then I just need to find a little sentiment for... I wonder if... I thought that if. was a sentiment then, I wonder if. I was waiting for the stamp. <laughs> there we go. That'll just fit on that. See, that's I planned nice. it. I did and plan it. And that's nice, putting the sentiment off centre as well, I like that. Yeah. yeah, wherever it fits. I actually like doing them up the side of cards as yeah. well. So that's going to go there. So I just need to find my black ink. And See, this is more like my desk at home. I can't find anything. <laughs> the sentiment details I've got up on the screen, just to let you know, three quarters of the stock of those have gone as well. It's been a busy hour again. So good to have your company. If you are wanting those stamps, then the details are on your screen there, but the stamps have got all those wonderful sentiments on. Uh, should it, they, my arms aren't quite long enough. There you go. Have a little look at them. There you go. So, of course, don't forget, these are larger than what we're actually going to be looking at, the stamps here. Um, this is kind of your packaging, so scale down a little. But you can see from the stamp that you use there, such a good size. Um, they can really hold their own, can't they, in a project? These Absolutely. They're great for your journaling, scrapbooking, anything like that. Um, to me, it's, it's not always the image that needs to take centre stage. Yes. Sometimes you want it to be the centre. So like okay. you were saying before, if someone's having a bit of a bad time, it's a good day to have a good day. Yeah. And I think this is a nice one if you're into your planners as well. Lots of us here have, have got into our planners. And I think it's a nice one to, to start the, the day off with. Yeah. It's a good day to, to have a good day. Even just sending someone a little postcard as well. Yeah. And we do a lot of um, index card swaps in our oh, group. Yes. Um, and I think just a nice sentiment on there. Yeah, really just cute. Like, so there you go. That's another oh, really, that really beautiful. simple one. We've kept it really simple today, haven't we? But you don't need to overcomplicate it when you've got good stamps and yeah. good ideas. So literally okay. two inks there. I love it. Yeah, two <laughs> inks and those fabulous stamps. That's amazing. Um, now, we've got a few minutes left, so I'm going to do a very quick recap. We'll probably have about ten minutes or so. So uh, Plenty of time. Fabulous. I'll be back with you in a moment. <laughs> now, let me tell you about these stamps. So many of you got these in your baskets. Um, if you're wanting them, please check your basket out. Over 60% of the stock has gone. Uh, that's of the extended delivery. Don't forget, this sold out very early on in the show. Um, and because we preempted it, we did kind of have a bit of a contingency. So, uh, yeah, we have got them available still as a complete collection that you've got in front of you here. Now, everybody is saving at least £13 on these. You're going to save even more if you're a Freedom member. What you're going to get is you're going to get kind of, I think there's three or four different bundles in here. So you've got your textures. These three stamps together are available by themselves if you're wanting them on their own. They're $12.99. But it's almost like you're getting those free and a fiver off as well because you're saving £17.50. So that's one of the ways that you could be thinking of that saving working for you. Next one that we've got for you is the poly plate. Now the poly plate, the larger flower, this is available by itself. Likewise, you're looking at £12.99 for this one. So again, it might be that this is your bonus gift if you see it that way. And then you're saving a fiver. Kind of get the gist of this, yeah? Whichever way you are working with this, you are saving one of these elements and you're getting some additional elements off. Now, this is a lovely one. I love this one. This has got that gorgeous kind of shadow or that, that infill stamp. And you've also got the overlay of the um, different elements with this particular one. So this one is lovely. You've got the stamp with all the flowers on there. You've got your sentiments on there. You've got those kind of little um, details. A really lovely one, this one. Now, this one is your 16 stamps for 12 99 So if you fancy that particular one, the details are at the bottom of your screen. But again... It's like that's coming as a bonus, and you've got about a fiver off as well. I love it. I love it. And the final one, have a look at this. This is really pretty as well. And this one, um, again, if you're looking at getting hold of this one, we're going to bring the details up by itself. So this one, you're looking at an 18.99. It's a larger stamp set, as you can see. It does actually come with a poly plate alongside it as well, so that's why it's slightly um, higher. So that it works out that with that you're probably paying what one pound fifty something like that. 
absolutely amazing. Love it. £40.46. and pence. If you're a Freedom member, you're getting a £17.50 pence saving and you're getting all of this gorgeousness delivered to your door, perhaps for that first payment of just £20.23. and 23p. 710456. Just need to bear in mind we are on extended delivery with this one. It's only an extra week because it's sold out at the top of the hour. So next Monday is when it'll be dispatched and on its way to you. And that delay is just because it's all made in the UK by Mr. Roo. <laughs> he does, he stands there and he makes them all. Bless I don't touch the polymer, it's all sticky and smelly. <laughs> I don't touch that side. I'll draw, I will do the negatives, I will pack them. No. Don't go near the stamp machines. That, that's, that's his world in I there. I love it. Now you're going to share a technique with us <laughs> now, are you? a really quick last card. So what do you reckon? Orange or green? <gasps> well, it's Ooh. not even green. It's twisted citron. Well, I like the twisted citron. Let's go, on, Let's go for that I was one. hoping you'd say that, actually. OK. Right. <laughs> I answered so, correctly, did I? Thank you, did. <laughs> um, I'm actually going to go back to the big blooms because this is a really, really easy one to do. Okay. I've got my mini poly plate there. I'm just going to ink him up. Did you say mini poly plate? The mini one. Okay, just I think I need to explain the definition of mini to you, because this is not mini. <laughs> oh no, he's palm size, isn't he? He's, he's you know, he's, it's a good size. he's still a good size, even though he's one of the minis. <laughs> mini in comparison with the other one, I suppose. Well, yeah. <laughs> Compared to the big one, it, it's, um, it's mini. Right, so I've just got that inked up. I am just going to go straight on and, ooh, I've got a bit of, a bit of dust on in there. Because I didn't clean him off, that's my own fault. I'm going to stamp this one randomly. I'm not even. So if you are nervous about stamping or you just need your mojo back, mm -hmm. this is a really quick one. Or you've left it too late and you need to get a card in the post today. Okay. Oh, that was rubbish. What I was going to say as well, obviously you're working with your acrylic block on this one. If you wanted to, could you do it the reverse way around and put the poly plate onto your glass mat and take your paper to it? Is that you another could. way you could do it? Yeah, just like just you like were doing that. there, yeah. If you want to. Okay. Um, that way you know you're going to get a better kind of personal impression. preference, I suppose, isn't yeah. it? Sometimes if you've got a solid air, oh, look at that. There we go. So let's do our next one. Love it. And I'm not really inking him up properly, to be fair. If, if I'm spending time inking him up, because I've got gaps in it on all sorts. I kind of like the little gaps in there, though. It kind of gives it a bit of personality. And uh, no two stamp outs will be the same. Exactly. And if you were using a stamp press as well, you could keep going back in where you colour and things like that. So again, if you want to flip it, just turn it over. To be fair, when my fingers are playing up, um, I do tend to flip it over and just give it a quick rub. You do have to be careful, though, that you haven't got any ink on the edges. That's a good yep. point. I'm going to yeah. do one more, I think. Love the colour. There we go. So I'm just inking this one up again. Just a really easy one. So let's put it somewhere about there. We need lime or um, a lemon, don't we, stamp to go with this? Ooh. Oops, I've just Proper put my finger in. Right yeah, don't put your finger in your ink like I just have. <laughs> Gives you green fingers, doesn't yeah. it? <laughs> I need them. <laughs> there you go, so let's take that one off. Oh, I didn't oh, quite go over that one quite enough. Cool. So, but I think it will still work. Okay. That's the thing, though, about our stuff. It, you don't have to be precise, you just yeah. go for it. You might as well have for fun, aren't you? Right. So, I'm going to grab my black. You can see where I'm going with this, can't you now? Mm. It's just a really simple one to do. Ooh, put my finger right where I needed to put my <laughs> ink. So just make sure you ink him up. I have a tendency with this one to not ink him up and leave little gaps. So again, I'm not really bothered where this goes. There's one. Just give it a good press. Oh, look at that. that one. It does, it makes you smile, doesn't it? Having that lovely, big, bright colour. It's so colour. effective. I mean, any of you watching at home that maybe you are a soft crafter and you, you kind of been watching the card makers and our, our fabulous experts that we have here and you're thinking, I'd love to get into it, but I don't really know where to get started. I mean, what you've seen from the demonstrations with Kim is she's kept her uh, kind of elements to quite a minimal amount. Regular cardstock you've got there, I'm sure that you'll have at home. Um, if not, we've got it on the website, obviously. And then just a simple one colour ink pad to add your colour element and then you black which is pretty much a standard isn't it to have that black in your stash as well but this is so effective so again i'm just going to pop another one in there again you want to do it in odd numbers because if you have one if you have even numbers it's one or the other you're looking at whereas if you've got odd numbers your eyes kind of moves ah clever your eyes not actually going to look at any of them mm. is it 
It's going to see them all. See, I'd buy that as a fabric. It looks amazing. <laughs> <laughs> so if you stamp it wrong, it doesn't matter. Or you can make it your own, couldn't you? Right, so that by itself looks quite cool, doesn't it? Yeah. Now I am going to stamp. So that's my background done. Don't need any more on that, do I? Mm -hmm. I could just grab a little bit of... Um, I love putting grey in just for a little bit of shading, something like that. Yes. Yeah. Or a bit of a charcoal pencil. You don't have to. So I'm just going to ink this one up. So this is the fabulous. And I love this. I mean, the scripted font that you've got with this as well. I think it also makes it feel fun, doesn't it? It does. And it's also very generic. So you could be making this a, a kind of lilac and pink kind of lacy style of card and the, the sentiment would work. Or it works with those bright acidy tones that you're working with now. Exactly. Um, it felt like spring, yeah. this one. So again, let your sentiment dry because we saw how badly I did that this morning. <laughs> Popped a giant pinky mark in it. Oh dear. <laughs> okay. I'm just going to chop this down again. So again, nothing is measured. I just do it all by eye. Now we are rapidly coming towards the end of the hour. We've only got a couple of minutes left. Just to let you know that three quarters of the stock has gone. Um, I will show you everything that's in this set in a few moments. Um, when are you next year back to see us, Kim? I hope it's 13th. not too long. The, sorry? 13th of... April. Oh, so that's not too long then, is nope. it? There we go. How cool is that? Even oh, that there is you go. I'll beautiful. do it at a jaunty angle so I don't have to get it right. I love it. <laughs> But that's fabulous, and that's if you're making your card to sell, which I'm guessing we can do with you, everything, then that's quite a generic style. So, and you don't necessarily know the particular person that you're making the card for. I think that is going to be well received by anybody. I found another card using a similar sort of technique, but cutting your cardstock up in a different way. So, all the technique that we saw a few moments ago replicated with the plate again, making it look a little bit different. That is the key thing. But of course, the larger plate that you've got, you can be quite um, directional with regards to the colour and where you're applying them and I love this little sketch doodle that you've got around the edge there it's almost like a little stitch line as well absolutely beautiful if you have just joined us where have you been we've had an amazing hour thankfully you've joined us at the point when we've still got some stock left because we have sold out of this one and we are on extended delivery now it's looking incredibly vulnerable we're at the end of the show now so this is the time when we get so so busy three quarters of the stock has gone of the extended stock now so it's one of those things, if you like the look of it and you're wanting it, you need to get involved now. You've got a week extra delivery with this one because, of course, everything is made in the UK and shipped out to you. And do go back and watch the shows and do check out um, our, our fabulous Kim on social media. How do we find you on social media, Kim? Facebook and YouTube. Lovely. We will look out for that one as well. So Craft Your Roo, go looking and you'll find loads of finished samples and I'm sure some tutorials as well. Thank you so much. Oh, thank you. 13th of April. Yes. I don't know. Put a ring around it in my diary. <laughs> I wonder if I'm on shift. I hope so. Um, now, of course, if you've got anything in your basket, now is the time for you to check your baskets out. Anything you like the look of, then be quick. We've had lots of sellouts. We're getting very, very busy. So, yeah, do check those baskets out as soon as you've got your goodies in there because I'm worried that we haven't got enough stock for everybody to get everything. So it's going to be fastest finger first, really. So good luck. Check your basket out quickly. If you're on the phone lines, then we will get to you and take those orders as soon as we possibly can. But make sure you do come back and join us after the break as well bumper bundle for a brilliant prize and don't forget freedom members you've got that additional saving that means you're not just saving that 13 pounds you're actually saving 17 pounds and 50 pence such a phenomenal deal and loads of you taking advantage of it i will see you a little bit later i'm back with you at 12 o'clock with the one day special but we've got a bit of embroidery coming up looking forward to it see you in a bit We have indeed. We've got a lovely hour of Rowan Dean embroidery. It's going to be a cracker. And then I'm back with, well, it's not actually the one day special. It's the March monthly mega deal. And it is humongous. Then we've got Julia Watts here. Have you heard of Hachanda Freedom? Did you know that as a Hachanda Freedom member, you could be making savings on every order you place? For just £5.97 a month, you will benefit from selected Freedom member discounts and complimentary standard delivery on every order you place. You will also receive our exclusive Achanda Freedom members badge, regular newsletters, giveaways and crafty updates. If you shop with Achanda more than twice a month, then Freedom is for you. 
Don't forget, your Freedom membership is flexible, so you can pause it if you're going away or you can cancel it at any time. So what are you waiting for? Give us a call or head to the website, quoting item number 888888 and join Hachanda Freedom today. Hi, I'm Jean and together with my partner Malcolm, we run a small business in the northeast of England called Crafty Individuals. At Crafty Individuals, we are mostly involved in the design and manufacture of a very wide range of red rubber art stamps, but we also have a range of background papers and mini images that are also brilliant to create with. We also have a great little team of other artists, friends, who've helped us along the way and have come up with other designs that completely work alongside our own. So do pull up a pew and join us on the Hachanda shows. We can't wait to see you there. Hi, I'm Barbara Gray from Clarity Stamp here in the UK. Teamwork makes the dream work. And at Clarity, we are designers and manufacturers of, dare I say, beautiful, top quality and award-winning craft products. We are home to the very first, the original transparent art stamp. We hand make them here in Kent and our talented illustrators are always coming up with new original concepts and wonderful artwork. In addition, we design and manufacture top quality stencils and masks. In fact, we also make precision cut reusable masks for our stamps. Since January 2017, we are also the new owners of Pergamano International, bringing together a wonderful blend of old and new parchment art. We are so fortunate to be able to showcase our newest and best products here on Hochanda and to be able to demonstrate our art ideas to you, our Hochanda friends. So if you would like to learn more about clarity stamping, stencil work, parchment art, both groovy and traditional, please, Join us, myself and the Clarity team, here on Hochanda for ideas and inspiration. Exciting news! For the fifth year in a row, Hochanda has been awarded the top accolade of Platinum Trusted Service Award from FIFO. These awards recognise businesses that deliver exceptional experiences as rated by you, our customers, and we're honoured to have been selected. The Trusted Service Award means you can shop with confidence based on the reviews from over 60,000 Hochanda customer experiences. Thank you for your independent reviews. It means a lot to us. Hi, my name's Mel and I'm from Crafty Devils down in Devon. We are a family run business and we've been established for about 16 years now. We're known for our MDF products and our mediums. All of our MDF products are produced in Devon in the UK and we have a wide variety of products to inspire you. If you watch Hachanda, you'll see us put together and decorate our designs to inspire you so that you can make your own crafting projects. So make sure you tune in to all our Crafty Devil shows on Hachanda. Hello and welcome. Marvellous to have your company. Really looking forward to this hour. I always love shows with Katrina. A, because everything is beautiful, just beautiful. But I also, I love your passion, Katrina. Because obviously, everything you make, it, it comes from you. You know, you are inspired by everything around you, aren't you? Absolutely. The seasons, the colours, mm. uh, the plants, every, everything. And yeah. that gives me a lot of inspiration. And now, I mean, now is the perfect time. 
time, isn't it? Because we can see things coming into bloom. You know, you start seeing the bumblebees and everything. It's just oh, lovely. Ab absolutely. If, even the journey here, you're seeing more birds, you're seeing, yes. you know, the, the sort of spring flowers and the, le it's the leaves, it's that vibrant green yes. that's just come in and you, you get really excited about yeah. that. It's yeah, really good. colours, all the colours. It's gorgeous. And you've, we were just chatting because um, obviously, Katrina, you've been, how many years is it now? Oh, it's, well, it's, it's a lot of years. It's, it's almost 35 years, but I suppose 32, 35. Wow. You know, but a long time, put yeah. it that way. Your back catalogue must be humongous. It, it, is, it, it is a massive amount of hours and work that yes. there. And, yeah. and you, when you look back, you see different things, you, you remember different things. Yeah. Um, uh, you think, oh, that's a really good design. I think yeah. I'll, yes. I might revamp it. I might change. It, I might just bring it, bring it back. Yeah. And you can do that because there are just, it's just so interesting. Yeah, the and range timeless. of designs Abs that I have and uh, I keep doing, and that's inspiring to me, yeah. really. Yeah, I love it. I love it because that's the thing we were chatting because I was going down, going, oh, I haven't seen this one before. Katrina, like that's not a new one. But this is it, whatever stage you're coming in to Rowan Dean and seeing the products, there'll be stuff you haven't seen, definitely. Stuff you haven't seen, like this one, because this is brand new. Oh, my goodness, it is so busy. We are approaching 20% of the stock gone already. I am not surprised. I looked at this and it was like, oh, my gosh, this is gorgeous. The colours are amazing. The patterns are amazing. Um, I love these anyway, um, the little card kits, because they're so pretty. But Katrina, I'm, I, I'll probably lie every time it'll be my favourite, but this is my favourite so far. It, these it's, are lovely. It's the, it's the colours, and these are just fabulous plants that are around now. You know, the primroses, the hellebores, the leaves, yeah. and, you know, a blossom tree. All those things are just really exciting about spring. And, of course, sparkles you can put on yes. as many beads and sequins and uh, metallic threads as you want so it's a lovely project to do oh, they're gorgeous and i love i love the ones that are instantly recognizable as a flower but i do like the more like that one the more abstract i like the abstract. absolutely adore it adore it and i love your colors are fabulous and uh, yeah this is just do you know me and look at that even when the the threads come to you i think this is where you obviously start your journey by looking at those threads because straight away you want to use them you want to to see these all build up and become that gorgeous gorgeous picture so you've got your beautiful threads if you've never done a rowan dean kit before i highly recommend these even if you have not done any sewing these are absolutely the ones for you any stitch work these are the ones for you because honestly you you make it so easy katrina to follow to learn new stitches to create something beautiful anybody can do this um you've got so you've got your instructions but then you've got all your your threads you've got two needles but it's the print of fabric as well. Let me just get this so you can actually see this. Sorry, bear with. Um, so you have got your, your print of fabrics. <laughs> there you go. And you can see, and I love this because it's a really good guide, but it's a guide, isn't it? It's, a, it's a, just a, a starting point, gets you going on the shapes that you're going to create. So, you know, a simple leaf pattern or a flower or where the veins are actually going to be positioned. You, I think that's enough. Yeah. You know, you've got, you're going to add more of your own colours. You're going to follow. The, I mean, there is a plan. When I sort of do it, there is a step-by-step -step plan yeah. to complete yeah. the design. But uh, you can add more or you can change the colours. And yes. that's, that's what's interesting about the, uh, this type of design yes. is there are six different ones yes. that you can have a go at. Yes. And that's fun You learn do. so much. You know, if you've never done it before, you learn so much. Um, you've got your six different designs, as Katrina says. You've got your two needles. You've got all your threads. You've got your organza. I mean, way more organza than you actually need. And this gives you that vibrancy, that colour, and also the layers. And then you've given us tons of sparkle in this one so you've got sequins you've got beads i mean it's funny actually because knowing like we're doing quite a lot of rowan dean shows now i know how much you love all these don't you <laughs> i've got boxes and boxes i get really inspired by a new a new colorway so uh, the the ones that are in this are, are new the yellows and the and the oranges are yeah. just new so not so cool do you know what i mean these i know when i were a kid 
um, the leaves. I used to pick these up. I'd never a clue what to do with them. This is when I was a kid and I just picked them up because I thought they were great. And now seeing them actually in the body of the work, it looks so good. Um, these are flying. In fact, a third of the stock has gone. My favourite is absolutely the leaf one. Look at that. Oh, I adore that. A third of the stock has gone. You need to be quick with these. They're so beautiful. They're tactile. Um, you're getting everything you need. You do need to check your baskets out. They're flying. Knew they would. Brand, brand, brand new today. Approaching 40% of the stock. We're literally six minutes in. 262-600 is your item number there. Now, another new, new one that we've got for you. And equally beautiful. Uh, see, this is again one of the things I remember from you. Because it was the first time I ever saw your picture or your, your needlework coming out of the frame. And I love that. And that's, that's the beauty of a, a landscape where you're looking in the foreground and you can see all the lovely plants and then it just takes your eye into that, mm. that landscape. And yeah. so the two together, it's sort of 3D, uh, but with, with parts of the design that I just love. I love the foreground, you know, when you're yes. walking in the countryside or you're in the garden, I love that, looking at the, the plants close yeah. up. But yeah. I also like that wild look. of Allport Heights is in Derbyshire yeah. and, I mean, it's quite high up, so it's quite almost moorland you know it's yes. got the gorse and it's got the uh the landscape with those fabulous yellows and uh, and the gorse colors with the bright bright yellows yeah just a, just a lovely it's just a lovely scene really yeah oh that is you've captured it as ever i mean this is what this is what uh, Katrina does it. It's like, you know, it's like taking that beautiful photograph, but what you're actually capturing are the colours and the textures as well, and it's the textures. Your work is so tactile. I mean, literally, you want to get in and touch that. Doesn't that just look fabulous? Um, they, and this is why I think it's really nice to keep these in an open frame. So you can touch. Oh, aren't they lovely? How many French knots? But gosh, that looks fabulous. <laughs> you've got to do French knots. Oh, though. you've got to. <laughs> it's the rules. Um, this is so pretty. So what you're actually getting in this kit, you don't get the frame. What you do get, you get your full instructions again, step by step, and it's going to give you ideas and inspiration. You then get in the threads. Something else that... Um, that Ro and Dean always give you are mixtures in your threads again to create that texture. So you've got wool, so you've got your your either in your uh, yeah no your Ada Ida, um, you've got that in there as well. So again, um, am I using the right word? Uh, well, it's just a cotton fabric for the background. Yeah, I was getting it's my, not, my it's Ida mixed up with the thread. Yeah, so I was getting a, it mixed up with my thread. It's not What's a counter. It's not, an even, it's, it's not an even weave. That's got a slight slub in it. Yeah, uh, yeah. So it makes it uneven. And, and it's actually good for the threads that are wool and they're good for the threads that are cotton. So you can stitch finely Beautiful. or you can use really quite heavy threads. Yeah. And it does, I mean, again, it just looks beautiful when it's finished. You've got the image printed on there. What makes this really special is this bit because the organza is already printed for you. And this is the bit that allows the image to fall out of that frame, isn't it? That's right, you just, you just treat it as exactly the same. You stitch, put it in your spring hoop, uh, and then you just stitch all the way around. And the design's connected all the way around, so when you cut it out or melt it out, it's going to stay as a, a complete shape. Perfect. And then you can uh, glue that to the mount afterwards. Amazing, I love that, because it looks so effective. You do get the mount as well. Um, which means uh, get you ready. You're ready to actually frame this. This is lovely. This is busy. 10% of the stock has gone. The prices are always really good as well. £12.95. pence, So affordable. And if you're buying for gifts, perfect. 704143 is your item number. Next. Now your beautiful delphiniums. Um, and these, this is the first time you've seen the next two kits on their own. You might have seen them before in bundles, but this is the first time we've had them on their own. Now, um, with this one, you don't get the hoops, but you can buy her the hoops on the website. And we have got hoops on the show, actually, so we'll chat about them in a moment's time. But the delphiniums are just gorgeous, the colours. Again, when you look at your threads, all the different, um, the different types of threads, you've got the sparkle in the threads as well. You've got beads, you've got the needles, the organza. And again, you have got your, your printed uh, base there. Delphiniums, I mean, again, you, you work with so many different colours, but the delphiniums, the colour of those are just beautiful. But it's, the, it's that blue and that slight purple as well. Yeah. Uh, they're just fabulous, fabulous. Uh, exquisite, exquisite. Um, if you'd love your delphiniums, I mean, look at the price. For a full kit, 
10 pence and 95 pence. That includes your needle, for goodness sake. It's such good value for money. And look at that. So pretty. Um, and do remember, if you do want your frames, please check your frames out. Because these do look really, really pretty. Now, you've got a set of three um, five-inch hardwood uh, for £12.95. pence. I mean, it's just the, the finishing touch, isn't it, that frame? Yeah, and, and well, it enhances the design, but actually mm. it's, it's easier to put together. Uh, you know, it's, you can hang it straight away. You yes. it's, it's not going to take you long to do that. Yeah, and it looks so good. I mean, these are beautiful, beautiful frames. We have got different sizes on the website, so please do have a look, because I know we've got some big ones as well. In fact, the big ones are the brand new ones, and two 10 inches. And again, they look really good. It's, I would, if you're buying presents, I'd absolutely get a couple of these as well, depending on the size of your kit that you're getting. But just... For your stash, but if you're giving these as a gift, give the frame as a gift as well, so they can make it and then actually frame it straight away. Only eleven pounds and forty-nine pence. Zero two four seven seven three. Next. Um, so if you, a senior beautiful agapantha, no, this is your agapantha. So that was your delphiniums. This is again lovely. And look at these because it, it's that movement as well. And you can see the the lovely sort of fluffiness to these, and that's the organza. I mean, the organza just gives it. That, that pop of colour, but it's also that richness of texture, isn't it? I think, and it's like, you've instantly got colour. Mm. It's like, you know, on a, a white piece of paper, and a little bit of organza just gives it a, a little bit of a lift. And yeah. texture, when you're fraying the organza, yeah. it's just instant texture. I mean, the texture looks fabulous yeah. on this. Absolutely fabulous. Again, the price, only £7.95. First time you've seen this on its own. Um, it has been in a kit before, but first time on its own. If you would like to get hold of that one, absolutely everything you need. 201-742 is your item number. And I love it because we were chatting about, obviously, Rowan Dean's back catalogue being huge. So some of these you might have seen before, you might not. I love these. Next one, your Astas. These are fabulous. They're really textured and really vibrant colours. I mean, a lot of the one that's in, the plant that's in my garden is the purpley one. But you know, this this time you you can create using three different the same background design, yeah. but three combinations of colours. So you know, you could hang them as a trio, um, or you could give them yeah. as gifts. So it's it's perfect. And they're fun, to, easy stitches. Just oh. uh, we'll be showing those in a little while. But they're you know just few French knots, a lazy daisy, and straight at the straight stitch. You can do fabulous things yeah. with a straight stitch. Tell you what, though, the colours, they look so good, don't they? I love the shape of these. I love yeah. that they look like they're bursting, don't they? It just so, imagine hanging those together. They look, oh, look at the beads. They're going to look beautiful. And uh, when you put the beads together, it makes me giggle, because when you look at those bright green, you think, where are they going to sit? But then when you put them on, it's like, yeah, they work completely, yeah. don't they? Absolutely beautiful. Um, with three of these now, again, you're getting your full pattern, you're getting your fabrics, you're getting all your threads, um, you get lots of good sparkling here. Um, is this one of the five inch again, uh, the yes. hoops? Yes, yeah. Superb. So if you do want the hoop, get the five inch to go with these. You'll need three of those um, to frame them. And it is the perfect frame. $17.95 if you do want your Astor's kit. Remember, you don't get the hoops. The hoops are separate. 946. Um, <laughs> uh, 543. Now, something that's busy. You find this online already. We love these play around packs. Look how much stuff you are getting. I mean, these play around kits are ace. This one is just bursting at the seams, isn't it? I mean, it's, it's the vibrant, vibrant thread. So, you know, you'll always get a collection of greens, whether they're wools and metallics and bright greens as it's spring colours. But you'll also get the blues for like blue belly colours, um, you know, the crocus colours, and you'll probably get a little bit of pink in there if you're thinking of cherry blossom you know that it's a nice combination of colors mm. to experiment with to create your own picture yeah yeah and I, may, I must admit I had this in my basket the other day but forgot to check my basket out oh. I know, I know how rude, <laughs> how rude, because these are perfect, not just for your kits, but there's so many crafters doing little books, 
and they're putting the stamps in, but then they're using all the and threads. The, yeah. These are absolutely perfect. And that's why I were meant to check my basket out and forgot, and you've just jogged my memory, because <laughs> that's the way my memory works. 20% of the stock has gone. 519-571, love, love, love these. Uh, we've also got for you, um, and look at this one. Oof, that's divine. So you've got your brights as well. This is your play around. You've got two different options here. Seriously, they're really hard to choose. And I think when you see them all, you'll want them all, quite frankly, because the colours, I mean, they're amazing. And also the fabrics. I mean, you give so much in these kits. It's well, I, wonderful. I think you, 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 that's, that's exciting. You know, when you open the colours, it just makes you want to start to stitch. Yes. Whether yeah. it's you're just going to experiment with straight stitch, fray a little bit of organza, or just if you're sitting and looking out the window, you yes. know, you can just work with the colours yeah. and, and practice a stitch. Yeah, you absolutely. Know, and then the, because, um, you know, you can choose the colours, you can choose uh, what you're doing, yeah. it's just exciting. It's yeah. really exciting. Oh, I love them. Um, 915244, don't miss out on those. They are really busy. Now, um, next, a gorgeous midnight kit. And this, now I haven't seen this one before either. This is really different because you've kept to that, that beautiful blue palette. I really like that. I think, I think there are so many fabulous threads available. You know, the tree is a sort of variegated mm. thread. And just having everything in different shades of blue is yeah. just lovely. But the design itself is very easy. You know, there's only a few stitches there. Uh, it's so it's a very a quick project quick to do. Quick effective. But a and bit of felt as well, a little bit of hand-dyed yes. felt there, so you can experiment with that. The hand-dyed felt looks gorgeous just on its own. It feels lovely. See, everything you get with a Rowan Dean kit is top quality. Do you even get the frame with this one? This one you do get the frame. Amazing. So you've got your frame, you've got all the threads, you've got the, um, as ever, you've got the needles full instructions. And Molly did say in me, and she said, it does look like there's a breeze going through, doesn't it? <laughs> That's the way that the, the grasses are flowing. Yeah, lovely. 154045, that's right, a number. And that's the thing, you can do that. You know, you can have you can have a cheeky bit of weather on any of these. Um, now next, the butterflies. One of the first shows I think I ever did with you were the butterflies. I know. I know. Isn't it? That feels years ago. <laughs> um, and these are just Fabulous. Now you've got three different options. You are again, I'll show you what you're going to make in a minute. But you've got three different butterflies in each each option. Then the butterflies are actually again printed on the organza. So like before, like we were chatting about, you'll be stitching on that and as ever, but then cutting out or burning out, you said. You can well, burn it you? out with, with a, a needle, a hot needle taped to a pencil and then put yeah. it in a candle and... You know, it, it, it won't uh, burn your fabrics or anything. It'll just melt the fabric gently. So, Amazing. Uh, you know, so, that's another way. But you can cut it with scissors yeah, as well. Yeah, I love it because you've got options. Um, now, you do get your little brooch backs as well. So, obviously, you can use them for brooches. You get all your fabrics. So, your choices. The first one. Um, you're getting the peacock. You get your tortoise shell and the red admiral. So, that's your first option with your beautiful butterflies. Um, the second option... You're getting the gorgeous cabbage white, you're getting the painted lady, and then the beautiful common blue. Oh. And then the last one, it's probably not that common anymore, um, the orange tip there, you've also got the small copper, and then the purple emperor. Let me show you what these look like. Are you ready? So that's your different kits. Don't they look amazing? Uh-oh, am I pushing him off then? There you go, he's flying away. Let me pop in there. There he is. Aren't they fabulous? So obviously you can put them on pins, but with these, you can sew them on any of your projects, can't you? Look great on a jacket, yeah. you know, a, a jacket, a denim jacket. Or you could put them in, if you're doing a journal, you could yeah. put them in there as well. Yeah. Oh, they're just so pretty. And these are the kind of things that just, I bet they're exquisite to make, aren't they? They're easy because you're, like, you're working the... the the, you've got the print there to, to get the shape of the butterfly and then you're work, just working with a few colours yeah. through the organza keep you working a frame and they're easy they're easy to do really quite satisfying to yeah. create yeah. that whole shape love it absolutely love them and you want to again as ever they're just so tactile um and they're proper right when you say they are proper like um ooh, yes they're 
the free uh, fourteen pounds and ninety five pence. You have got your choices there, um, so it is up to you what you want to go for. One three zero zero five. Eight. Okay, now I'm going to give you a picture of numbers because we forgot that it's really getting on with time. Um, so this one is your dusky pink lilies, and this is a big kit actually. They are really, really wow. Are these absolutely beautiful? And yeah, how much has gone? Oh no, it's okay. Oh, you're saving five pounds on this one. Uh, five pounds saving, just twenty-four pounds ninety-five pence. That is five four five zero two nine. We've then got the beautiful hydrangea. Oh, I love this one, and that's a big one as well. I mean, we've got that displayed on a canvas, and it looks amazing. Um, only twenty-four ninety-five, and it is just a really nice uh, show-stopping piece. Zero six 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 nine three is your item number for that one isn't that gorgeous and again texture texture now because i've been chatting a lot i'm going to pass right over to our katrina and that beautiful brand new kit katrina absolutely spring sparkles so it's this this i've really enjoyed doing this one it, it's easy to do but it's it's different each design is different and i think you'll enjoy working all of those so the idea is that that you're going to start some stitches that we use uh, for on the leaves here and we're going to use some fly stitch uh, and that's easier without the frame and then of course i'm using organza to create the background so the inside your instruction you'll you find a plan of what to do with the organza so that's easy to do. So the first thing I'm just going to show you is, is the, I mean, the colours. I mean, these, you know, yep. I know we've had a look at those, but I've worked the colours out uh, in shades of green and pinks and oranges, because those are the colours, you know, for this particular design, the hellebores, uh, the blossom. Uh, you'll you get lovely ideas from this variegated threads. So the magic just happens as you start to stitch. So the first one I'm going to show you this is the, is the leaf design. Oh, so the okay. leaf design, um, obviously you're going to work each leaf in a different colour. All right, but I'm going to start by just taking a small little stitch. And I find this one easier to work without the hoop. Uh, I feel as though it's easier. Then I'm going to take the thread to the outside edge. And then I'm going to go across to the opposite edge. Oh, and okay. then I'm going to bring the needle back into the middle and then as you pull that thread it almost forms a Y stitch. I've got some well, I weren't expecting you to do that. So then you take a small stitch and you work to the outer edge. I'll just get that all going out of the way. And then you're just going to complete the shape and that's all that you do. It's quite relaxing this this stitch was sort of working a continuous stitch mm -hmm. you can add metallic threads in there if you wanted to That's and eventually you're just cool going to work stitch. down the shape and eventually and work, working from uh, the tip of the leaf down to the bottom of the of the shape that and then so cool. starting off you know you can easily fasten off the threads yeah you just take the threads over there like that and they look just gonna... 3d you know when we get really close to that leaf it actually the one you've done it looks like you stuck it onto the fabric it, it's just so lovely using the different color combinations oh so i'm just gonna now put it into my spring hoop so the spring hoop so there we've got the the plastic part of the hoop on the table yeah and then you just hold the spring and then you just release that into your your, your work and that's going to keep the work taut uh, to do that so that's in, that's easy it's a five inch hoop so it's easy to hold there and we're just going to take some of the thread so once you've worked all the leaves the next task is to fill the, in the gap between the leaves with beads and french knots oh love that all right so with for, for working the the thread for the beads we've got a special bead thread so it doesn't stretch so as you put the beads on they're not going to fall and drop Perfect. And so you're just going to bring the thread up from the back. You can either put a little knot or you can leave that through. And then you're going to uh, pick up some of the beads. And to be honest, it doesn't really matter which ones you use. There are a mix of sizes, there are a mix of colours. And you're just going to pick the bead up and then you're just going to take the bead down. And that's going to create a nice bit of texture just by adding 
a couple of the beads. Amazing. So um, you're just going to pick gonna them tell up. folks at home, half of the stock of this kit has gone. It is very busy. Katrina's meant to be back at two, uh, but it is very, very busy. Can I just tell you as well, the spring hoops uh, that Katrina's walk it, uh, walk, working on, <laughs> walking, uh, that she's working on. You've got your spring hoops. These are really, really handy. And you're even getting your lovely little scissors um, with those as well. Bottom of your screen there. Um, oh, no, they're not. That's your set of butterflies. <laughs> oh, no, they're not. <laughs> there you go. Fifteen pounds and ninety-nine pence. That's six, four, six, seven, eight, five. Oh, no, they're not. Back to you, Katrina. Okay, so I'm just going to fasten off exactly the same way as before. So keep the beads, keep the beads secure. So I'm just going to show you another part of the design. So I'm just going to, this is the beauty of this, the spring hoop, is you can move it around your work. Yeah. Um, and it's not going to mark the, the fabric. Uh, if you find that um, you leave it in the frame for a long time, you can always press the back of it. Yeah. Uh, and that's just... Not, don't press it on the surface because that's going to, uh, you know, you've got organza there and you yeah. don't want to damage the organza. So uh, you can move the, the hoop around. And the next one I'm just going to work a little bit on is this one, oh, the primroses. And I've got three layers of organza on here. And I've, first of all, I have gone around the whole shape of the leaves with a ah. stem stitch. Okay. Uh, and then I'm going to cut it away. So sometimes you'll cut the organza away straight away, and other times you will leave it. But I'm going to just take a little bit out the way. And you just you can go quite close to your work. I love that stitch as well that you've done round it, because again that gives it that really lifts it off the, the base, doesn't it? It's amazing. And when you're doing these, Katrina, you, you do <coughs> always work all six before you cut them out for I cards, think so, and you? I think it means you can add, you can um, just look at your designs, because you'll get such a lot in your design. Yeah, yeah. You can keep adding and keep adding, and I yes. think that's really, really good. I'm just going to get the thread. That okay, so lovely. this time I'm just going to take a little bit of the metallic thread. Beautiful. So this one's made of six strands, so I'm just going to take one of those. Ooh, just one. Did you see that? That was Katrina actually threading a needle, like, in seconds. I mean, <laughs> just that, Katrina, it's it, it just amazing. I can't even see the eye of a needle anymore. <laughs> OK, so we'll, we'll, we've got a good needle for that because it's a chenille needle and it's got a large eye. So good. we don't want to make it a struggle. <laughs> yeah. Although Katrina is amazing at threading a needle. So I'm um, just going to do some straight stitches gone. Sorry, there. Katrina. Oh, wow, that looks amazing. So I'm just going to add a couple of bit of sparkly bits on there. Oh, doesn't that look good when we get that close up? That's beautiful because that just adds, because it's fine as well, it just gives a tiny bit of sparkle. Just a little bit of sparkle there is mm. nice. You can add some of the green beads in there if you want. Amazing. What so the instructions about. give you a sort of a basic plan, but you know, the, there are beads, you can add more than, than yeah. is there. I and love the, your you know. kits because if people, you know, you don't, you haven't got a clue where to start. People might be able to do all these stitches already, but if they haven't a clue where to start, I think you make it really easy to follow, but quite still allowing people to, to use their creativity and, and make it theirs. Well, I think that's the whole point of the, mm. doing these, is just make the stitching easy and then let the design develop. Yeah. Uh, you know, I mean, I only use about four or five stitches. Yeah. So really, nearly all our designs are the same stitch. So it's easy. It's, yeah. Once you know there are a couple of stitches, a few straight stitches, a few French knots, uh, you're there. Yeah. And you can yeah. create uh, with the thread. You know, I suppose really we're almost painting with the thread. Yes. Yeah. And I, and I think, don't get worried about it, because I think sometimes people worry yes. that it's got to be absolutely perfect on the back. Who actually cares what the back looks like? You're not going to be, you know, you won't be seeing it. Absolutely. Uh, and, you know, if you like it really uh, very neat on the back, then that's fine. It's your piece of work. So yes. uh, the thing is just to, the idea, the, really the whole idea 
is to enjoy the process yeah. of the stitching yeah. and, and keep it very easy. Yeah. Uh, and then it's the colours and the textures that will do the yeah. work for you. So they'll, it will just appear. Yeah. So where you put them all together, though, you've got That's a beautiful eye for the composition. That's the word I'm after, Katrina. I think... You're cracking at composition. I think <laughs> so. Well, I'm just going to get... I'm needle threading. My needle threaded. And I'm just going to move it on to the next one, just to show you a French knot. You know, we've nearly had a whole show and haven't done a French <gasps> knot yet. Katrina, What's what is this? We need, to, we need to do that. You've changed. So I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to change to here now. Uh, and this one, this one is the blossom tree. So again... Oh, Love that Katrina. We've got layers of organza just to create the background. We've got um, a, a very easy, simple shape of a of a tree. And so we're going to add beads there in the foreground for crocuses. Beautiful. And then the blossom on the tree is worked with a French knot. So apart from the pearl and the white beads, we're going to do a French knot. So a French knot. I've got six strands here, so that's quite Ooh, heavy. So it's going to be a nice chunky French chunky knot. Chunky French knot. So you hold the thread about a couple of centimetres away. Yeah. And then you're just going to go around once, twice, and tilt the needle so you're going to go point down, almost into the same hole, but almost like one thread over. Yeah. So as you push the needle into the fabric, it's got to be all the way into the fabric, and then just tighten that thread. And as you pull it through, just let it travel in on its own and Amazing. it'll get that lovely rosette shape. Oh. All right, Perfect. so it's just, they're just delightful to do. Yeah. Now, if you wanted to create the same thing, you can always go around once and then still place it not exactly into the same place. With it being once, you'll get a smaller knot just to create oh, and you can cover perfect. that whole tree with blossom. So there is a a shade of pink in there you know when you look at that tree it won't be all white but you'll get another shade of color Lovely. for some finer french knots and you can create that whole shape uh, really a lot of color on there yeah. really loads and that's the thing about these you can add your own touches in there but oh. i think a blossom tree or a cherry tree yes. is just fabulous fabulous to look at I love that, Katrina. Do you know what, as well, that background? It took me, obviously, you told us about your background, but when you look at Katrina's background on the tree, where's my little tree? Look at all, see, this is so cool. Look, all these are the organza. And you know, at first, you, your brain doesn't go, oh, yeah, see how you've done it. But all these layers are all the organza. That's how she's created that wonderful sort of colored, yeah, the landscape. Oh, this is so busy. Oh, aren't they beautiful? Over 60% of the stock has gone brand new. Uh, Katrina is back at 2 o'clock, but I'm not sure if these will be. I mean, yeah, they are delightful. Absolutely delightful. Um, we are going to go back to Katrina, though. I just needed to sell you 60%, and I wanted to look at the background of the tree because okay. I thought that were it. <laughs> <laughs> back to you, Katrina. Okay, I'm just going to disentangle that. Okay, now, uh, further over on the design, there's another stitch that we'll, d we, we'll do on the flower. Um, it's, a, it's a really nice stitch to do, so I'm just going to move my frame again, just to show you. Now, this time, I'm going to do what's called a long-legged French knot. All right, so this is a different knot. A long-legged French, long French knot. A long French knot. It's lovely to do. Now, this, this uh, Hallibor, they're out just now. They're just fabulous colour colours in sort of a woodland garden. And at this time, I've started with three layers of organza. I've got the blue on the background, and then I've got a purple, then a sort of a, a sort of a, I don't know whether you call it a wine colour or, yeah. you know, a maroon colour. And that's yeah. three layers. So you stitch all the way around, and then you cut off the, two, the top two layers so right. that you're still leaving um, the blue background. Ah. Because it's a really light blue, isn't it? Is it is a lovely, it's, it's a light blue, you know, the skies in the springtime are just yeah. really, really fabulous colours. See, so we'll just do a... Again, it's, it's not just your stitches that you show people, it's that, you know, it's that layering, it's that thinking about how to create depth of colour, but then how beautiful to get soft it. shading. That's it's what good. you teach us. Okay, so this is a great stitch. So this time you hold the thread and instead of going to the same place, 
you take the thread a little bit higher and there is, on the print there is a little bit of a, a circle there because these are sort of like the stamen inside the plant and then oh, you've yeah. got like a French knot on a on a stalk on a straight straight stitch yeah so I've those are that. those That's are lovely cool. to do and you can vary the length of those and you'll get that really nice and appealing hey. so that will you'll get those and you can create texture in inside the flower that's as well. absolutely so that's perfect and nice isn't that good for the flower that's absolutely perfect so the, the flowers are sort of lime green and shades and you can add some beads in there as well so they are really pretty plants and then again you've got metallic threads to create the veins in there so you've got a lot you've got a lot of colors and then of course because I'm, I, it sparkles the thing that you will do is then once you've got those you're just going to drop this, this the purpley sequins and you're going to create a diagonal design just by just with a few French knots or all all the different shades of Lovely. sparkle all the way across and that's just going to give you a lot of sparkle oh, near the flower fabulous. I love how you love your sparkle oh I do I do <laughs> definitely do <laughs> lots of sequins um it's beautiful now approaching two-thirds of the stock gone I mean when you see them come to life and it is, it, I think what Katrina, as I said, what Katrina does is, is give us so many different pointers that I, I don't see at first. You know, I don't see the, the, the layers. I, like when you look at them sometimes, you, you see your main thing, but you don't see the, all the, the layers that's got to that. Do you know what I mean? And all the different stitches and the way of using the organza. I mean, that tree, when you look at that background, it's just absolutely exquisite. And that colour has been achieved. It almost looks like watercolour, but that's been achieved with your organza. You know, that beautiful flow. Um, oh, I love this as well. And the sparkle. I think Katrina's absolutely like, gone for it with the sparkle on this one. She's brought in so many beautiful different sequins, so many different gorgeous beads. I mean, we're talking texture, we are talking colour, we're talking light as well, because everything will dance in the light. That one's amazing, isn't it? With all the different tex textures there. And then, of course, the, the wonderful threads. You know, you get the light bouncing off these because of the, the metallic threads and also, of course, the sparkles. And look, what Rick called a leggy French knot. Long-legged French knot, not legged. <laughs> I knew I were close. Close, but no cigar. A long-legged French knot, that's brilliant. Long. Oh, I don't know. Anyway, one of them. <laughs> and I love that. That's beautiful. Beautiful. Okay, these are seriously busy. £19.95. 262-600 is your item number. Please remember to get hold of your hoop set. Hoop. Um, this is so handy, especially when you're doing your work because they're easy to, to clasp on and off. And you have got those teeny nice little scissors and they're really handy as well because you've got that really nice point. So when you are cutting your uh, your organzas, you're going to need something really nice and fine to get in there. Uh, 646758 is your item number um, for those. Um, and yeah, always handy. Okay, I'm going to whip down this counter this time. So next is your beautiful Alpine hat. And this is L Alport. Sorry, it's not the Alpine, Leona. Um, the Alport Heights, and you can see the texture. Um, it's just exquisite. I love the colours. That lovely yellow. It's a really warm, rich yellow, isn't it? Um, just wonderful. That is now approaching 30% of the stock. 704143. You have got the mount on that one. You don't get the frame, but you do get the mount. So it's going to be ready for frame. And you get everything else, of course. 704143. We've then got the beautiful delphinium. So now we're talking those beautiful blues and the purples. Um, again, with your threads, you've got loads of different colours there and textures you've got the wool in there you've got the metallics and the wonderful sort of shine uh, you do get the two different needles and all your organza and of course the lovely be delphinium belphinium <laughs> the delphinium 10 pounds and 95 pence is your price four three seven five three seven your item number now the gorgeous agapanthus um and again 
it's that texture with this one. You can see the background now. And again, the background, the organza creates that really soft, almost watercolour wash. But then you've got all the wonderful threads um, that give it superb texture. And I love that you've got in there, you know, the organza's all fluffed up and it, it makes it look so nice. Doesn't it look pretty? And again, it makes it, you just want to... You just want to feel them all. Um, that is 201742, your item number there. Next. Um, do you know this is one of my favourites this hour? Over 40% of the stock has gone. I just absolutely adore these. Um, and my favourites in this hour are definitely the first one, the card making kit, without a shadow of a doubt. Favourite, favourite. But that is... Do you know what? I have done some Rowan Dean kits in the past. And I absolutely adored them. Many, many, many moons ago, I actually went to um, college like an afternoon course to do creative stitching. But I had to give up because I went and got a full-time job, which I would gutted actually because I loved it. I know, right? Why did I do that? But I, I really loved it. And I think because it, when you look at these, this is the whole reason for loving creative stitching because you can see the colours, the different movement. Oh, love it. Um, now, you want with this you are getting the full kit you don't get the hoops if you want the hoop uh 12 pounds and 95 pence and that is a set of three so absolutely perfect then they do look divine when they're in the hoops you get all sorts in there the colors are just delightful um that is five no it isn't <laughs> it's nine four six five four three seventeen pounds and 95 pence your price and then the midnight kit i like this because it's so different you know we've seen all these different colors and different pops of, of brightness but then I love this because it's just those beautiful blue tones see I've got that wonderful coolness with these again you've got such movements and the movements when you look at this and this is why I find it interesting it's not just the gorgeous uh, grasses that have got movement but can you see in the background it does look like the wind because if you're getting them all going, your stitches go in the same direction, it gives you that specific movement. So it looks like the breeze is gently blowing them. Um, it's so pretty. And I do love the, the just the fat, everything. Literally everything's top quality. And the felt is gorgeous. You get, you get, you get the hoop in there as well. £15.95. 154 And then the gorgeous butterflies. These are stunning. Um, oh, so lovely. Now, I'll show you. So your top row is the first kit. And you can see there. I think they're, yeah, it is, isn't it? Yep, so you've got your peacock, you've got your tortoise shell, and you've got your red admiral there, which are just fabulous. I mean, they look so good, don't they? Set two, um, you've got the cabbage white, you've also got the painted lady, and then the common blue. And that's the most popular option, actually. And look at the movement that you can create on those. And then the third option that we've got for you, you've got the orange tip, you've got the... Um, small copper and then the beautiful purple emperor i mean yeah they're lovely and these are just pinned onto the cushion but you might be doing that oh in fact they're they're on this one one of them's pinned on but see see look how good they look i mean that just fits in with my jacket to be fair doesn't it it actually fits in it just looks like part of my jacket in nature in nature the butterfly would actually probably try and do that wouldn't it It'd be like oh you can't see me on that boom absolutely lovely you are getting your three brooch pins as well so of course you can make them into brooches but yeah they'll look beautiful on your work uh 14.95 is your price for those now we're going to give you a quick look at the spring um play around kits Half of the stock has got, ah, oh yeah, these are amazing. And I love seeing them in real life. Because look at that. Look at all your colours. And you get all of this. I mean, you've got all your florals there. You know, this is all your beautiful, um, it is your blossoms. It is all your flowers. It's your texture. But then, obviously, you need to have your grasses. You need to have your hills. You need to have uh, your trees. Um, and that is then your leaves, all your foliage. So this is absolutely essential. You've, of course, got uh, texture because you've got the beautiful organzas. You've got your beautiful fabric. And this, in its own right, is amazing. The tweed is absolutely beautiful to work on. And the joy of doing this is that you don't need like a, a big count 
thread. Do you know what I mean? You don't need something where you can see the holes because you you are creating sort of free hand, if you will. So you can use gorgeous thread, um, uh, beautiful um, oh, tweed. You've then got loads of beads in there and more. Oh, look at the satin there. How fabulous is that? Yeah, gorgeous, gorgeous. If you do want that, it's really, really popular. Only 18.95 over half of the stock has gone. Not surprised in the slightest. 519. Five seven one. Oh, and I'm so pleased we're seeing the hydrangea in real life because this is lovely. Um, oh, and I like these uh, the bigger projects. Uh, this is again what I love about uh, your Rowan Dean kits because you might have days where you only want to do a nice little project. You might have other days where you do want to get stuck into something more sizable. And this, I mean, this has actually been put onto um, onto a, a, a frame there. In fact, it has been put onto a, a frame. See, you can see. It's been made into a, a little canvas. But, I mean, you could frame that. You could do whatever. I like it like this, though. That looks really good, Katrina, doesn't it? It's got drama on a wall, mm. hasn't it? When you do a big piece like that, it's, you know, it's a focal point in the room. And I think the, the creamy background, white, off-white background, really lends itself. Cause, yeah. You know, you can put it anywhere. It'll yeah. go with any it, decor. I love this one. I, I really like this, and it's again your use of organza. Before I saw your kids, I'd never seen people use organza like this. You know, it's just fabulous. Well, it's just a great medium to work with. Mm. You know, you can give it texture. You could make it uh, look really interesting. And yeah. I mean, look at the leaves there. You've got the, yeah. the you've got frayed fabric just to give uh, a different colour along the veins there. And you've got you know two layers and three layers is going yeah. to give you new colours. So what you, you, there's a lot of experimenting with the colours yeah. in the organza. Yeah, you've absolutely changed my respect for organza, <laughs> Katrina. Um, if you do want to get hold of this kit, it's absolutely beautiful. Zero six 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 nine three is your item number. I mean, your organza is it is like your watercolour palette. You know that layering creates different colours, it creates different depths and different tones. Um, oh, so exciting. Zero six six. Six nine three. Okay, now check that website out, sachanda.com. Everything, and I mean, yeah, look at that. All Rowan Dean kits have five star reviews, and I mean, I'm not surprised. They are so so busy. They always make sure you get top quality. Um, I mean, uh, they they make sure that they can. Um, even the tweed, I know you source your tweed specifically. You know, everything is brought to you with, with care, love and attention. Um, look, even the organza kits have got your five-star reviews. So, yeah, have a little look, see what you need. Um, I know we did get an email in as well, didn't we? I forgot to read it out. We did. We did. Hold on. D. D's emailed in. Thank you, D. And she said... Oh, wow. So, um, Dee was introduced to embroidery by Katrina when she saw Katrina doing um, one of the card making kits. That's amazing. Is this a picture that she sent in as well? Oh, that's a different one. So, thank you to Dee. So, she said she bought the kit, then bought another kit, and then another <laughs> kit. But now she's getting the, uh, the wonderful play around kit. Oh, and the Astors. Um, she says it's addictive and enjoyable. That's lovely. Yeah, I think Thank there's you. a lot of people who've got a lot of your beautiful things at home. Um, we have got a picture from Karen. Look at that. That's gorgeous. That's gorgeous. amazing. Uh, she says she loves Katrina's kits and there's such good value for money. Yeah, you're right. I mean, the, the prices are phenomenal. Um, yeah, everyone, thank you ever so much. Always, always uh, send pictures in because we love seeing what you're doing. Really quickly now, um, over half the stock has gone with your Astas. If you do want the Astas, oh, I really like the movements. That is 9465. For three, seventeen pounds and ninety-five pence. Please put your uh, the hoops in your basket as well when you're getting these hoops. Um, some uh, nine four six five four three. Okay, okay. Over to you. We've only got six minutes. I do I apologise. Uh, I feel like I've fine. talked a lot. Well, I'm going to sort of work two things at once because I think I'd like. I think they work together. Lovely. So I'm just going to show you a little bit of the asters. Okay, so the asters start, uh, uh, you have a print on the fabric and you're just going to cut out um, some little circles from the combinations of colours. And then you're going to cut out additional ones and you can place those wherever you wish. So all three start off with the three asters and then you add the other asters in a, to, in, you know, 
develop the design and you can put them in different places. Oh, All right, okay. so they're basically straight stitch uh, and there is a print for you to follow there. And then you're going to, as if you're looking on top of the flowers, you've got French knots and you've got beads to go in between the two. So you're looking through the plant and then there we've got the fly stitch that we did earlier and some little bits of um, lazy daisy. So you can build up that design really, really, um, I mean, very, very quickly. And then once you've got it to, uh, you know, you've got your French knots, you put it in the frame. And then I don't know why, I just think if you can add a butterfly yeah. to those, they can look fabulous uh, on your piece as well. Yeah, and then the butterflies, good. the common blue, I think that's a really nice one as well. Oh, so you can good. add add those wherever you wish whether it's on on my book here that you know a, a sort of a, a journal that you want to create you can add the butterfly and you can move it onto other other things as well but the the butterfly is worked on the organza so i'm just going to show you that first you so you treat the this. fabric the same right with the organza would you i mean in the hoop that looks way easier especially where the organza are in the hoop doesn't it well it the, and this is a, a different organza to the organzas that are in the orga coloured organza packs. This yeah. is a, a much heavier organza, so it's more stable to stitch on. Right. And then, uh, you, you know, just by putting it in the frame means that you can create that um, that shape. And so to start off with, probably uh, not really very many knots on the back. You, don't, you want it to be as smooth as possible. So you can wind the threads a couple of times through the back of the work and so that you're not really putting a knot this time in the work you're just going to add the stitches and you're just going to stitch all the way through small stitches to fill that shape so you're just going to blend the two colors so yeah. I've got two colors from the thread card uh, mixed together just to create a little bit of shading uh, yeah. so you know the this stranded cotton is made of six strands so you're just going to pull a thread out and mix another colour with that. Obviously the instructions show you which which colours to work with. But you're okay. gradually going to build up so that you're you're not uh, you'll cover the whole surface and you know if you've done enough, if you hold it up to the light, you don't really want to see through the fabric. You don't want to see the you don't want to really see the organza. You want yeah. to fill that with the stitching um, and just create the shape all the way around. That's and then I would suggest that as you're doing it, before you cut it out or melt it out, you, you stitch on the brooch part ah, okay. uh, so that you, it's, you've got enough work room to work and it's not going to move. So I've just gone over the body and I've opened the, the clasp and just stitch over the metal so that disguises uh, the brooch and it keeps uh, the shape of the body of the, That's of the butterfly. Tip. So that, that's, that's an easy thing to do. Yeah. I love it because that, that layering and layering, that gives it that depth, doesn't it? It makes it's, it it's nice. Good, and, it's good to do. Yeah. Uh, I and I think that. the asters lend themselves to adding that, you know, and you can add more stitches. And I always give a very big piece of fabric so you can get carried away. Perfect. And you can fill that whole shape. That's uh, perfect. Which is You've really got good. so many five-star reviews, you know, for those butterflies. 21 five-star oh reviews. Boom. That is amazing. 21 five star reviews. I'm not, uh, I'm not surprised. They're gorgeous. Um, okay, so how much time have we got? About a minute. Oh, a minute. <laughs> a, minute a minute to show you a, a bit of the spring colours. Oh. All right, so this is the, uh, you, in the spring one, this time you get one piece of tweed and you get one piece um, of the cotton fabric and you also get all these fabulous colours. So, here. This is that play pack, isn't it? This is it? the play around pack, and so that you can just take some of the designs, take an aster, you can you can look out the window and see bluebells, but you can really use the organzas, and one of the ways of using the organza is just to fray the organza, and that is just to have the organza on the biased or the stretchy part, so you yeah. just take a little piece, and then you just be a little mean to it, and just... <laughs> distort the fabric and just fray that and you're going to get lovely texture just to create a little bit of background and start the stitching. So that's how I've done that here. Oh, that's I started so nice. fraying some fabric or layers of fabric. Yeah. 
or just as the background. Just you, just have a go with the colours, and when you see the colours, you'll that. instantly be inspired. With seconds, uh, that's that play around kit. So if you want that play around kit, please check your baskets out. The main kit is absolutely flying. In fact, approaching seventy. See you later. Coming up next, don't forget that play around kit though, it's amazing. Next, um, Mr. Abbott's in the building, is getting set up for you one day special. We've then got Sentimentally Yours and then Rowindeen. Hi, I'm Paul Church from Clarity Stamp. I've been fortunate enough to turn my hobby into a career and joined Clarity Stamp in January 2016. My background has always been in crafting and I enjoy making things and sharing things. That's what crafting's all about for me, making things and sharing with others and also learning all the time. At Clarity Stamp we bring you a wide range of products from stamps, stencils, groovy and pergamano. And the great thing about that is that it covers crafters from all different aspects. So whether you're into stamping, stenciling, parchment craft, we've got it covered at Clarity Stamp. So I hope you can tune in and join the Clarity team on Hochanda. Hi, I'm Sam, and we're from Be Crafty. Be Crafty is a family-run company. Sam is my sister, and we love bringing brand new products to Hachanda. We manufacture and design all our own ranges of stamps, inkables, MDF, lots and lots of inspiration that we love to bring and share with you. If you tune in to Hachanda to join us, you'll see that mine and Bev's style are totally different. But what that does is it brings you lots of styles and techniques that you can include in your crafting too. Our ranges are increasing all the time with the lovely hand-drawn images that Sam and myself are trying to bring to you, plus the fantastic new designs that we like to bring in the inkables, in the dinkables and the MDF as well. So you can use them across all different sorts of crafts and bring the best we can to a Chanda too. So make sure you don't miss the Bee Crafty shows on a Chanda. Hi, I'm Andy from Picture This. I've been a painter all my life. Picture This was actually formed on the back of a throwaway remark from one of my art students. This has developed my drawings into a series of photopolymer stamps, clear stamps for the crafting community and the crafting industry. The stamps are all hand-drawn by me. They're made in the UK, most important to us at Picture This, and we have so much more to bring. Our shows on Achanda, um, we hope to make them informative, amusing obviously, entertaining, but mainly it's about bringing the creative spirit to you. Make sure you tune in and watch the picture this shows on Achanda. Hi there, my name's Leona. I'm a presenter, a guest and a crafter here at Achanda. I got into crafting years ago, ever since I've been crafting since I was a child and I absolutely love it. I love my job, I love the presenting side because I get to meet loads of really inspirational people and that's just the beauty of this. There's always something new to learn, there's always something that you want to get into, it's fabulous. My Let Leone Loose show on Achanda is also fantastic. It's my weekly highlight. I get to work with loads of really cool brands, loads of fantastic products, and again, I'm always learning. And I do get loads of wonderful viewers getting in touch as well, which is obviously a highlight of our job. I hope you can join me on my Let Leone Loose shows every Wednesday, 11 a.m. and 2 p.m.
exciting news. For the fifth year in a row, Hochanda has been awarded the top accolade of Platinum Trusted Service Award from FIFO. These awards recognise businesses that deliver exceptional experiences as rated by you, our customers, and we're honoured to have been selected. The Trusted Service Award means you can shop with confidence based on the reviews from over 60,000 Hochanda customer experiences. Thank you for your independent reviews. It means a lot to us. launch last night has been amazing we are featuring brand new artwork not just from Tracy Evans who we're concentrating on with these fabulous images we're sharing with you but also Bipasha we've got fabulous abs with his designs and of course the lovely Janet as well but more about that in a while this is all about Tracy and a little bit about abs because he's here so we might as well chat to him how are you doing abs i'm very good thanks but it's about tracy i'm just doing the demos here <laughs> oh just doing the demos you're doing them amazingly now Thank this you. is a brilliant bundle we've seen brand new designs here from tracy yes um everything is brand new in the show mm -hmm. in this collection or in the mega one um this year you have five stamp set by tracy evans all new you have from the large a4 down to the small a6 um you have imagery you have background elements you have Gorgeous. text you have even some alphabets you have some not the alphabet here sorry you have the numbers and the months and the seasons mm -hmm. and even Beautiful. the st the nd the third if you want They're for your planners yeah. for your dating or for your inner project so we have everything we that you need to create do. a finished project <laughs> <laughs> we have and uh, you can understand why abs is so excited because you guys have been <laughs> loving this now got the details up on the screen for you if you're wanting to go for the tracy evans march complete collection those are the details that you're going to need. Now, I would hesitate to checking out your baskets because I've got something else to share with you in a moment. But if you've seen everything and you're wanting to go for this and this bundle by itself, then rapidly approaching it. Set, was it seven? 60% of the stock, sorry, 60% of the stock. Probably will be 70 before we know it because it is flying out. And you've got everything in here. You'll recognize the fabulous artwork that we see from Tracy. Her style is amazing. And she has so many different facets to her style. This is the thing. You can see that kind of urban look with all the letters and the, the dates there, the months, perfect for your planning. But then the botanicals, she loves her garden and she creates so many amazing botanical stamps that you are going to love these. And they're all all real flowers so you can go off and research these add that content to your project as well but then it's the butterflies naturally they incorporate absolutely beautifully alongside and also you have got the ability where you've got these they're already layered up so you've got lots of content already done for you but they work so well so you can add to these and really make them your own and I think this is a key thing abs I mean many of the design team we see you will see stamps where they're kind of just stamps by themselves single layer but if I just just turn this one around to show you now I know this one was popular by itself the large A4 stamp here you've got the multi layers already done so it saves you time Absolutely. Save your time. You have all the layering, as you said, already done there. But also something interesting I forgot to mention. Some people, um, I saw it in Fanatics Group, they stamp it as it is. And if they like colouring and spend a good time um, yes. with their kids yeah. or grandkids or whoever, yeah. um, so you just do some stamp for them images and let them do the colouring because everything you need is already done there by Tracy Evans. Perfect. All that you need. Is, is just include some colours. <laughs> but this is brilliant because what you've got here, you've got something that's quick and easy potentially, or maybe just to get you started if you're not overly confident. But as you look at the inner detail within these stamps, you'll see elements that we've seen from previous stamp sets from Tracy. So if you've already got those, they're going to work alongside. And they're what I call future compatible as well, because you've got certain essences of these that are going to work with other things that I know Tracy will be yet to bring to us. Then you see things like the fabulous letters, the wonderful numbers that Tracy incorporates. But whether you're just using a simple colour, I mean, this one, really the content's been stripped right the way back because it's just basic colour group has been used yeah. and the stamp does all the work. Absolutely. And here, um, for example, here, Kelly, she just stamped um, part of the that big stamp set. Yes, you don't have to yeah. stamp the whole, uh, the whole image. Point, you yeah. just get the, pick the section you want. And it's so effective. 
very, very much that. And I love text. I love text within a um, particular project because it draws you in because you want to read that. I love this one. It shows that even though you've got big stamps, they don't have to be big projects. Absolutely. You can, um, um, you can reduce them down to a small project. You can do a large project. You can just pick, as we said just now, the elements you want and you need from your stamp set because it's so rich. There's so many elements this to pick it. up. Now, if you like uniformity with regards to your design, because obviously a lot of these designs are very arty, um, kind of all those little dots and splodges. But if you like something a little more structured, then you still got those elements in here. Again, bringing those botanicals in apps. Definitely. And I like how Kelly did um, the vast toward the left and the other one to the right and yes. leaving that middle sense more negative space but open to highlight Beautiful. more the images. It's I really it. beautiful. And again, you don't have to do a lot. Let the stamps, let the artwork do the talking. Again, a beautiful stamp here as well. And of course, there's lots more to share with you. But I'm not going to show you anymore. <laughs> because we have got a fabulous little video that we're going to be sharing with you in a few moments, giving you an idea, getting up close and personal. But do you remember me telling you about Hold Fire for a few moments? I will meet you the other side of this and tell you how you can pretty much get this particular bundle as a bonus. So let me tell you how that £74.66 can be your saving, which in effect means that you are getting the Tracy Evans collection there as a bit of a bonus. Swap the details around on the screen because, of course, we have got a March release from the team. This is where Tracy Evans has teamed up with the fabulous Bikasha and the wonderful Abs. And down at the front there, you can see gorgeous artwork from Janet. Now, you will see all of these being concentrated on over the next few days. Tonight, we'll be concentrating a lot more on Abs and Bikasha's work. And then at the weekend, 6 o'clock on Saturday, we will start concentrating on Janet's. But it all comes together in this March mega collection. Now, you may have seen last month we had something similar. Well, it's a similar sort of concept. All four of those designers coming together to give you brand new work. Now, what you can see on the screen is your introductory price. Now, that £11 saving is on top of the savings from each one of these. So bear that in mind. So that's added all together actually works out at £31 um, that you're saving with regards to this. But, and it is a big but, if you are a Freedom member, then you can forget about that. You are saving £82.04. Yes, I know, it's phenomenal, isn't it? And don't forget, as a Freedom member, you're going to be paying £74 for um, the collection that we're seeing and we're concentrating on today from Tracy. But you can see here the fabulous range of stamps that you're getting. Now, this particular collection that we're looking at here, Abs, this is where you've worked alongside the Passion. I know you're going to be talking more about yes. this at 6 o'clock tonight. Yes. But I love this kind of kind of fluidity. You've got outlines, you've got solids. Abs yeah, exactly. So she has more open space. I have more, like, outlines. As I said, dark solid images and they work beautifully together. Also, the terms of size some A7, some A6, plus all these de small details that she added. So, I love a it. brilliant collection. I'm excited. I'm looking forward to 6 pm today. I'm looking forward to see what you do with it. Um, <laughs> and you guys at home, you're looking forward to it as well because you are buying this. Um, and we will see this later on. So, don't forget the saving that you would get with this one and look at it later on. You will still get it. I keep forgetting to mention washi tape. You're actually getting seven rolls of washi tape in with this set as well. And they all brand new. You won't have these in your collection at the moment. Different sizes. Um, lots of them have got, well, some of them have got colour in them. Lots of them have had the colour stripped back because, of course, you can change the colour of your washi tape as well. I'm sure we'll see more from those as we go on. But very quickly, can I show you Janet's work as well? Because that is the final jigsaw of this wonderful collection that we're bringing to you. And, of course, Janet's amazing artwork down at the front there with those characters. These are amazing. Janet manages to capture personalities of people that she doesn't even know. 
Because when you look at these, you'll see characteristics that you will be able to resonate with. There's a cat lady on there that could be my friend Samantha. It could be my fa friend um, <laughs> Jackie. I'm sure you will be looking at these and thinking, yeah, that's just like my friend and, as well. But of course, Janet has never met, met them, but she's taken those elements of personality and brought them all together in her own unique style. And that lends me straight in to our little Leone. She's a stamp and she's a bonus because if you are going for this complete collection that we're looking at here, you are going to get your little Leone on its way to you as well. And this is adorable. I mean, Janet's captured her perfectly, hasn't she, Abs? Yeah, it's, uh, it's just her. It's just her, like with her big smile and her hair and her favourite saying and her logo here on her apron and yes. everything. Everything about it. Now, you may well have spied then. I must admit, I didn't notice it at first. I've turned it around to show you the stamp because the stamp, you can see the spelling of favourite there being the, the traditional, well, the, the UK way of spelling that. On the packaging, and this is because Janet's an American designer. Yeah, she's from Arizona, she, yeah. she spelled it slightly differently, but the stamp itself is in the British spelling or the UK spelling of favourite. So just in case you've looked at that and thought, oh, there's an error there. There is, but it's only the cover. <laughs> it's the stamp that you're going to be using. So that's everything. Now, let me show you some of these amazing finished samples because they are phenomenal. This is something that I love with these abs. There's so many different styles and variations. You said colour in so many different ways. Absolutely, they're so versatile. And each time you change, um, you change the colour or you you mix them with something different, they look completely different and they give you a, diff a different. Yeah, this is just an ATC. I mean, look look at how that. you can go as small as you want or as large as you can. Love it, absolutely amazing. So a lovely little um, little ATC there that could be a topper on a card. But then Janet again has created um, using elements, using the numbers that we've just seen, using the florals. And I love this one. It's flowers in a bucket. I think it's a lovely phrase for that one. Again, all of these coming to you using the amazing stamps that we are seeing from Tracy's collection. It is so busy. I can't begin to tell you. Now half the stock of the March mega deal has gone. So this is where we're talking about all four of those designers coming together. So this is including Tracy's, which we're going to be concentrating on in a few moments, but it's also including Bapasha's work, um, Ab's work, and also Janet's as well, which of course we will see rolling out during the course of the next few days. But then you can sit back and relax and watch those shows safe in the knowledge that yours is going to be on its way to you and you don't have to worry about those updates. You don't have to worry about whether you'll get it or not you will know that you've placed your order and it's going to be ready to go. I mean, this is a fabulous one there, a little book cover. That is, yeah, it's an amazing book cover. And then you can, yeah, even inside you put some flowers, something. So you can write straight away on it or you can just, um, if you want to create uh, another book, you have all the background done for you. So it's an amazing it. idea. Absolutely amazing. And then if you need your cards, then again, you can use them in that way as well. Amazing finished samples. I'm sure you'll agree. And you've been loving it. You really have. So for less than what you were planning on paying for um, the, uh, obviously the collection that we've got from Tracy as a Freedom member, you are actually getting that first Lexi by payment made, but everything is sent on its way to you, delivered to your door for a phenomenal six and um, seventy-four pounds and eighty-eight pence. The saving of thirty-five pounds and ninety-six pence is in addition to the saving on each one of these different bundles, which means overall you are saving over eighty pounds, is it? Eighty-two pounds. Eighty-two pounds and four P, if I remember rightly. You've got to remember your P's. Um, so if you fancy getting hold of yours, at 560492. It's an amazing deal. It really is. And lots of you have been taking advantage of it. But what would finish this show off to perfection was if we had a happy hour deal. Guess what? We do. Have a look at this one now. This is brilliant because you can add this in alongside. Again, more artwork from the lovely Tracy. So very much her style. And again, what a phenomenal saving. You are saving more than you're spending. So you're paying just £24.98 if you're wanting to get hold of this one. You can add it into your basket as well. Um, alongside your fabulous bundle that we've been chatting about and spread the cost of these as well. So 474-647. But you only have up until the top of the hour, so about 45 minutes to take advantage of these you'd normally be paying 12 pounds and 99 pence for each uh, no 24.99 12 pounds <laughs> you're paying 12 pounds and 49 pence i knew that was in there somewhere uh, 24 stamps in total amazing right 
Abs, we're going to come right over to you nice and early at the top of the hour. So what have you got planned for us? Well, I have got a plan for you today. Um, so what I'm doing here, I'm going to go with more colours this time Ooh, different. So wow. as you can see here, a background that I prepared using distress oxide and I just flicked some water to get some textures. And the idea here, because last time when I was here, a lot of people asked me about um, the pages that I did in this book. And because I have my journal here, I did something similar, but this is obviously a different product. But by, by the way, all these stamps here are on the pick and mix that we have today. Those are on the A4 pick and mix and the numbers here are all on the A6 pick and mix. So I did this page here, I did another one with using a different release and they have another one there and they have one that I'm still working on. So I thought I'm going to add a new page and I'm going to create today with a new release. So we have different releases in this journal. So that's what I'm going to do today. Something similar but using our new stamps. Okay, so I have here my um, my two backgrounds ready. This just oxide water for textures, and now I'm gonna start creating some backgrounds. So the first step is just bringing some white because there's so many colors now and I'm going to do this with um, the white embossing powder because the best way to get as much white as I can and I'll be using this background stamp set here the A4 one from the um, Today Shows and also I'll be mixing it with other stamps so so I will start with um, I'm going to start with this one first my Versamark. Well, then using the acetate there as well is a good way of you actually kind of pre-planning your design there. Right? Yeah, so that's why exactly what I did just to see um, where I'm going to get and to have a clear idea and also to um, know where to stamp before committing to the big <laughs> step. <laughs> that's it. And of course you're working with one of your fabulous um, stamp bases there. We've got a lovely set. The A4 as well as the board are coming too for a brilliant price. You'll see Abs working with these throughout. £21.98, and pence, always worth adding in. But of course when you're working with the smaller stamps you don't have to use those, but it's useful when you're working with the bigger stamps. So I'm doing here my A4 acrylic block. That's nice. So I did one. Um, I'm going to do the stamping and then do all the embossing of the same page at once. And then I'm going to do here some of this beautiful um, border one now with the butterfly. So I can see here my my um, Versa mark is still here. So I'm going to add just some of the circles the other side. So I'm going to stamp just this um, section here. There you go. Beautiful. Um, what did they say? Yeah, here. Of course, we've got the details on the screen of the Tracy Evans March Complete Collection, which obviously Abs is working with at the moment. You can get hold of that collection within the bundle at the bottom of the screen. And if you're a Freedom member, your saving is more than the cost of Tracy's set. So do consider that. I know lots of you are going for the big bundle during this particular hour. And some of you are going for Tracy's collection. Entirely up to you. But just be aware of the savings and where they are before you check out your baskets. Okay, I'm using the same stamps again to do it on the other page while I still have it here on my block. So I'm doing it um, right here. Oops, maybe a bit toward the left. Nice. This is a good tip as well to work on the two pieces at the same time because yeah. being at a double page spread. So I was about to do sense. one by one and then hit on both and then come back and then we lose a lot of time. So I want to um, show you all the stamps. Well, so far you can't see anything because everything is clear. <laughs> We're using our imagination, don't worry. Yeah, thank you. <laughs> It'll all become apparent in a minute. <laughs> Finger crossed. <laughs> Fingers crossed. Okay, so I'm doing now uh, the same stamp set, but using now the um, the third um, design. And let me see where I stopped with that one. And I cannot see anywhere anything, but I know. But I, I suppose with these stamps, if they do cross over a little, then they don't look out of place. No. And what I do usually is when I put my powder, when I put my powder, if I see some section where um, I, I over stamped and mm -hmm. I have so much powder, just with a little bit of my finger or through the brush, get rid of that excess of powder where, where the design doesn't look nice and then just um, carry on. That's good the good tip. thing about the embossing. And I'm going to do it now actually. Okay, let me put the lid back on and get my embossing powder. There's that image. Now we can see. <laughs> now we oh, can wow. see what we did. So um, let me just put more in case I missed any details, the small details here. Looks 
fabulous already, especially that rainbow colour. That is one. And now just move this one here and then add more for the other parts. And it was just, just, you see, one, like oh, nearly one centimeter, which is perfect. <laughs> well okay. done. So, let me put all that powder back. I've had a lovely email in from Christina, um, thanking you, Abs, for bringing this wonderful collection and uh, saying how talented you are. It certainly is, Christina. Oh, thank you, right Christina. Um, and uh, she's also, uh, how are you managing to keep your hands so clean as well? That's what she's asking. <laughs> <laughs> well, because I did all the hard job before the show, which oh, is the ink and everything, and then I went to clean my hands. <laughs> oh, I washed all my hands because otherwise, I literally had like all the pink and the purple the and the blues and with from the distress side. So. <laughs> Now this is looking fabulous. And I love the way it's all over on the one side there, and um, yeah, and the detail that you've got from this amazing. I mean, we always love it when we we see the the heat embossing going on because it's preserving that design and of course Absolutely. making it brilliant for the next stage of your, the process. You can see the minute the heat touches that design, you have all this beautiful. And don't forget.